Question. How do you like your games? I wonder if this is the difficulty. Different times are hard. It's it's 5.31 p.m. for you, yeah. Like streaming is definitely one thing that's gotten me kind of more used to having to think about time zones. <laughs> You're a pro gamer, so I would say hard. I don't want to go, I don't think I want to do difficult. I think I want to go um, maybe like mid. Because I don't know, I don't think I'm used to playing any kind of combat in these games, so I don't know how I'm going to go with it. I'm guessing Pink Lemonade, I'm guessing the top one is like difficult and then it's like medium and then easy. Like going on a hike like going on a hike. Good exercise, but not too strenuous. I think that's, that's good. Choose like climbing the Everest because you pro. <laughs> no. Sorry, I was caught up in a fun fantasy 14 dungeon. All good lady. <laughs> All good. Highlight. Let's go. Yes. You wrote one Kira. I know you would do that. You tell me to play everything in the most difficult one. <laughs> I'm going to go with this one though. It's already done. Oh, hello. Chris. Chris, are you in this game? I didn't know that. Jill. Okay. I mean, I'm more inclined to go with the girl because I'm a girl. But I don't know. I feel like that's what I would do. Because you're good. You're slow on the pole. Just a little bit. <laughs> um, we're going mid difficulty. And you know what, guys? Look, if I like this game and I ever want to replay it again, at least I have, like, another difficulty to try out. Hmm? Hmm? This is like, there could be more content for you guys. Hey, Rasputin, how you doing? Resident Evil? Yes. <laughs> Jill, uh, wait, was that a spoiler? Uh, Rasputin, be careful of spoiling anything or telling me things. The dungeon you caught Lena and regretted it. He's dead now. <laughs> Jill, you guys like Jill? Jill, iconic, Chris, hot. <laughs> Difficult choice. You're a girl? I am. Minor backseat, yeah, yeah, okay. Just a difficulty thing. Look at these Halloween emotes, look at them. I love that uh, Lainey's and mine are up at the same time. So they can all be Halloween modes together. Um, okay, well, without knowing anything about the characters. I don't know if it's going to really change the game too much, but hey, we could always replay it and play the other character. So I'm going to go with Jill because I'm picking the girl. July 9th, Alpha T8. Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Found it yet? No, not yet, Brad. Bizarre murder cases have recently mm -hmm. occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. Yeah. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris. 
Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. What's gonna happen? Something's gonna happen. I just know it. Something's gonna happen. Mm -hmm. I knew it. I'm like, it sounds just like wolves. Just a bunch of dogs. Yep. Oh, they like zombie dogs. Ugh. Shit. Come on. Uh oh, this is bad. <laughs> A mansion. That's not going to be creepy. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. We don't know where Chris is. What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Whisker, where's Chris? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? Chris? Mm. No. Jill, okay. go and investigate. I, uh... I'm going with her. Okay, so we've been separated from Chris. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. Okay, I'm not playing yet. <clears throat> A dining room. Hmm. There's something shiny on the table. Oh, I can control now. Oh, okay. Now I can look at chat. <laughs> I missed a lot because I, I needed to watch everything. Is this, uh, is this the original or the graphic remaster? I'm pretty sure it's the remaster. This looks too good to be the original. What's the bet Vito likes these dogs? <laughs> yeah. At least they don't have people faces looking at you dark street, right, Alma? Right? Like, you were pretty young when you saw this intro scene and I kept having nightmares of scary dogs. I wonder why. Oh, <laughs> They're pretty scary. I thought his arm was going to get cut off by the dogs then. We'd wake up in a Buddhist temple with a prosthetic that we could upgrade over the course of the game. <laughs> Hi, Aaron. <laughs> This is already very corny and I'm kind of all for it. So you haven't, have you not played this one, Ryap? Uh, Eunice, hello, welcome in, I'm doing good. 
Uh, King, hello. <laughs> More polygons on Jill's face than a PS4 could handle. Yeah. I think it was remade for GameCube. Oh, really? Huh. I'm sorry to say you're getting a command made, Emma. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I have not. I've played a bit of Zero. Oh, okay. There's something here that I can... I can pick up. Will you take the ink ribbon? Sure. Oh. It's an old typewriter. Okay. You can save your progress. Oh, okay. <gasps> oh, I think, Kieran, is this like the Tormented Souls game where you only had... Hang on. I want to figure out what my controls are. I only have three saves available at the moment. Okay, I don't know if I should save just yet because we haven't really done anything yet. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? Ugh. Blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Let's just hope it's not Chris's. Mm-hmm. Did he lick it? I don't know. I don't know why people do that. <laughs> uh, is it Zaxa? Hello and good morning from Germany. Well, hello and good morning from Australia. And Miss Board, welcome in. You've got a cup. I've got an awesome streamer. Life's looking good. Nice. Oh, man. oh boy. Oh boy. Limited saves. Yep. Limited saves. <sighs> okay. When to save? Yep. Yep. With the new emotes, I've got to get them back to my frequently used section. Oh yeah, because they would uh, they would change, wouldn't they? He sniffed it. Okay. If he did lick it, it was to check if it was still warm. I mean, I feel like you could tell that by just touching it, right? Oh. Yes, we're just going to take everything. I mean, unless we have limited space. Take one of the swords, turn this into Dark Souls. Yes, I would, if I could. <laughs> examine an item from the status screen, select an item, and then select the examine command. Okay. So if I go in here, and... Oh, and I can use it. Oh, I can combine things. Examine. Okay. I can't read what's on it. It's galled all around the outer edges due to frequent fitting. Okay. It's so weird that I'm like, I, I, oh. Okay, so the left stick changes which angle she's at. So I guess if I, that'd be good if I'm like attacking something. But then the other one moves me around. But it's so weird that I can't change the camera angle at all. What's this? Can I go over here? Uh. I wasn't sure if it was able to be opened. Oh gosh. Okay. It's locked from the other side! Does not open from this side! An emblem of armor is carved into the lock. Okay, yeah. I don't even know how to use my weapon yet. It's like an elevator. 
Uh, okay, the different camera changes are weird. <laughs> locked okay so an emblem of a sword is carved into the lock right so there's sword and shield emblems on these doors okay I think that's where I came from oh <gasps> No, 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 no. What the fuck is this? <laughs> I don't know how to use my thingy. <laughs> Was, did I just see that out the window? I don't know. Oh, I can equip it. Wait. Okay. Yeah. Maybe is it trigger? I'm not sure. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to shoot. Wait, also map. I don't know. 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 I don't know how to use my weapon. I don't know how to use it. I'd be fine if I knew how. <laughs> oh wait, I'm not. I'm not meant to attack. Let me take care of it. Just yeah, shush and do it. Eh. Is this guy gonna die? He's standing very close to it. Oh, okay. What the hell is this thing? I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. Okay. Is there anything around that this side? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think they've taught me how to use my gun yet, because I was wanting to use it, but obviously that's not what you meant to do. Uh oh, did you hear that? I heard something. Wesker! Why is that a mo in specific neon blue? It's a ghost! <laughs> yeah, a ghosty Emma. I didn't even see what they said. Um Trial! Hello, how you doing? <laughs> Why though? Because it's Spooktober! Because <laughs> all the emotes are spooky. We have a witch, a ghost, a devil, a spooky blanket with spiders and spider webs on it. And what's the other one? I can't even remember. Oh, pumpkin, of course. I've returned and PC is all Resident Evil set up. Yay! Well, we found the first zombie thingy and didn't know what to do. <laughs> we we have weed motes, we do. Okay, we're meant to report to the dude, I think. Where'd he go? Hello? Let's can we go in here? Better finish searching the hall first. Okay, I think this was map, yes. Typewriter's there, the save point. I don't feel like I need to save yet. Better finish searching the hall. Uh, I don't think we're meant to be going down here. Um, can I talk to you? Like I'm meant to be going up here maybe? Some art. Hmm. 
I don't I missed what I missed what hall they wanted me to explore. Cause it's <laughs> wanting me to do it. Uh, I think leaving here is I don't know if I'm meant to go back into that same room. They said something and I didn't pay attention. Ghost in my house when I'm when I'm sleepy like <laughs> laughing. <laughs> Pumpkin, yes, yes. Barry. Any oh. luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. <sighs> this mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh! I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. <gasps> You'd make better use of it. I got the lockpick. Cool. Thanks. I may need it. Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I'm getting cold again. Heat is coming back up. Uh, how's the evil resident treating you? Uh, okay so far. <laughs> not, it's not too scary so far. I just don't know how to use my weapon, but I'll figure it out. I don't know if, I probably need, I don't know if I have, what's this got 15? I'm guessing that's 15 bullets. We got a knife, survival knife too. Jill, the master of unlocking. I like that we have a lock, a lock pick. Um, yeah, because I hold on my weapon like that, but I, but I don't want to waste any bullets, you know. We killed the evil resident who was matching on someone, so game over. <laughs> now I can open this, I think. <sighs> oh, hello. It's like a little gallery. <laughs> Please be a scare alert. It is not a scare alert. But thank you for the 11 months. How you doing? Get ready to shake a bitch. <laughs> is the only fear at the moment tank controls? Uh, the controls actually don't feel too bad. It just throws me off when the angle changes. Um, but that also kind of makes me feel like, think of like, Final Fantasy game, like the old school Final Fantasy games. I see a cheek. Yes. <laughs> You're loving the emotes. Yay, I'm glad. Portraits and photographs decorate the wall. It looks like they could come to life at any moment. You fucking serious. You see oh, there's something in the thingy. I don't want to look at that. No, 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 no. Wait, did it say it all looks like it's watching you? There's something in, look, up the top in the vase. There's a shiny. Woman drawing water. Can I like, ugh. Can I push you? Um, I don't have like a, a box or a ladder or something. Okay, camera angles. Ugh, we changed again. Or maybe, ooh. Oh, I can push that, can I? And I don't want to pull it. No, 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 no. Damn it. <gasps> ah! I don't want to be in here. I want to push the thing. Jill, can you? Yeah, there we go. Yes, yes, yes! Here we go. Okay, um, this way, and then we do another one, this way. I don't know if I can climb up here or not. Can I not? Oh wait, no, there we go. Can I climb up? No, I don't know how to climb. <laughs> I've got it nearby and I, if I, if she could just climb up on top of this, then I could get it. Nice bird. 
these tiles can be new photos, yeah. The fixed camera really adds an additional attention to Resident Evil, yep. Mm hmm This game was ahead of its time, I guess. You trying to make a joke and I'm not getting it. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, welcome in. You have so many new emotes locked under. Paywall! <laughs> I'm like, I gotta collect them all. The uh, bit emotes, yeah. And we're dropping into Legend of Zelda habits. <laughs> Uh, welcome in Joe, how you doing? Uh, yeah, so guys, if you didn't see, I updated all of my bit emotes, which are these ones. We have oh gosh, we have sip, and we have praise, if you guys haven't seen them yet. If you haven't seen all of those yet, those are new. And I also updated my tier 2 and tier 3 emotes. The Audrey one and the Agatha one. There you go. There you go. And yeah, I updated the oh gosh one because I think it looks clearer now. So, I like it. I like it. You're doing good? I'm glad to hear that. I want to get- I just want to climb this! <sighs> okay, I don't think I'm going to be able to. Maybe not yet. What's in here? Spooky... Painting. Yep, an eerie picture of the mansion. Oh. I did not look like there was going to be somewhere to go there. Various art supplies. <gasps> What's that? It's the shiny thing. What's that? <gasps> we got a dagger. Fuck yeah, I'll take that. Using defensive items such as daggers will allow you to escape momentarily when grabbed by an enemy. However, you will not be able to escape when the enemy grabs you from behind. Okay, so the enemy grabs me from the front. I can like use my dagger to just like be like and then try to get away. To equip a defensive item, go to the status screen and then select an item from the defensive item menu, then select the equip command. If your defensive item mode is set to manual in the controller settings, you must press LB to use the defensive item. Okay. So if I go Ah! Just let me. Nope, not that. Uh. Oh, my defensive item is different to my weapon. I think. When did you update the emotes? I haven't been here in a while due to work. They remind me of the Christmas ones where you updated for holidays. Ah, uh, Bill. So I literally they're from they're from today. I've uploaded, I uploaded the spooky ones today, um, and then you guys can probably tell they are, they're very, they're completely different to my old ones. Um, so when I, when we go back to non-spooky season, the new ones, you'll be able to see them just in their standard form. Um, but yeah, that's like a, that's a recent thing. Oh, praise the sun, awesome. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like it. I like it, Ryan. I was like, what should we do? I can upload the next one up as well, but I have no idea what it's going to be. I also, I will need to make Christmas versions of these new ones as well. That's something that I should do. Oh, I want an enemy to grab me from behind. <laughs> they look really nice. Thank you. Yeah, I was like, oh, I like my old ones still, but I have got my full fringe in the old ones and I've, I've been keeping the, um, the long side fringe for a while now and I will be keeping it for a while, so they kind of they're meant to be me, so they look more like me, and I I think I just did a better job anyway. Okay. I'm trying to remember how to play the game. Okay, so I think that's- ah! No, no, no! Fuck off. Fuck, 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 fuck you! No! Okay, this is a cutscene. I don't know what to do. <laughs> okay, yeah, I figured I was meant to use that.
Keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. Push, 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 push. Lock him in, lock him in, lock him in. Lock him in, 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 lock him in. Haha, sucked in. Then I can practice shooting. I'm gonna be out of bullets. How many do I have? Ten. He can get the fucker! He can get around, what the fuck? No, 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 camera, stop it! <laughs> oh, I don't think- I don't know if I can kill that one. I don't know if I'm meant to. I'm not sure. Where's our friend? I figured I was supposed to use the dagger. Because, you know, but now I don't... Now I don't have it because the dagger's in his head. I guess we've got to kill him so I can get the dagger back. <sighs> um, I guess we can have a look in here. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. <sighs> I feel like maybe I should save now. Because we've done a little bit more. Um. <laughs> oh, I never actually went around this side. When the two have run each other through. When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. A picture of two knights striking each other. The short sword has been thrust into the breast of one knight, while the long sword has pierced the head of the other. Thank you for the- <laughs> Those are fucking horse follows. Sorry. It's been a little while since they followed me. Uh, Anthony, thank you for the hydrate that I get hangry and the, the stretch. Let me just uh, ban these thingy uh, bot accounts first. Yeah, it's been a little while since they followed me, so I thought that was uh, that was kind of done with. Guess not. Okay. Banned. Not, I don't, uh, let's not thank those for the follows. Um, don't be this guy, he got caught simping, now he lost Emma. <laughs> Are you contracting somebody or did you have time to draw yourself on iPad Pro? Oh, Bill, I made them myself. So, um, I, yeah, I make all my emotes now on my iPad. It's great. Uh, but yeah, they are made by me. Uh, okay, hydrate. We gotta hydrate, we get doing hangry. I'm not hangry just yet. I'm not hungry just yet. Uh, it's only 11 a.m. But you gotta remind me, Anthony. In about an hour? Alright. And we got our stretch. Uh, <sighs> Bad hostage. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, Kieran, could you see the names of those accounts though? It's kind of funny. All right. I thought I could lock that zombie in, but I guess I didn't push it far, far enough. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. Do you want a list of bots to ban? Um, no, it's okay. I, I kind of just ban them as they, as they come in. Um, Sometimes if other people post about them. I know there's like massive lists out there that you can ban, but I don't bother with that. I just ban if they happen. Should be able to see it in mod view, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's like hoss numbers and then sniff. <laughs> I'm gonna save because I'm paranoid. Yeah, I guess we just go here. I'm sure we'll get more ink and typewriters and stuff later. Cool. Okay, now I don't feel so nervous. Probably shouldn't have used all that. Why is there smoke here? It definitely looks like the smoke coming from there. 
Um, that other zombie is probably going to be in here. She killed it! Ah! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> oh, gross! <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. <sighs> Ooh. First kills a special. I got an achievement for that. <laughs> I defeated a zombie! My first zombie! Oh. Yeah, its head is completely gone. <sighs> you prefer the new Resident Evil game since there's less running away and more being a boss. Yeah, I um, I just I figured this one would probably be less scary, but I definitely want to the the especially like the new one. The Resident Evil Village looks really cool, so maybe we'll get there eventually. <laughs> oh, there's a website where you can go and bans all known folly bots, and there's like four hundred thousand. Yeah, see, I'm not bothering with that. Um, I just band him as I, as I see him. Obviously you're not aware of the double tap. Wait, the double tap? This is great, she's experienced legit Resident Evil. <laughs> is this the only horror game you'll be playing? Uh, it depends. Depends how I, how I deal with it. There's a couple of other games that I want to play that are... I don't know if I'd say they're horror, but I'd like to play them. Like Bioshock, I've never played Bioshock, but that seems a little bit scary at times, but we'll see. I think, wait, I don't think that's where I came from. I think this is where I came from. That, that door there. It's locked. Oh, this is the, armor one and then there's the elevator here it doesn't look like you can access it from this floor uh i would have thought it'd be like a shortcut down here we have the one that has the emblem of like a um sword okay yeah just trying to get my bearings i guess emma hasn't seen zombie land i have not you're doing good for your entry resident evil game thank you <laughs> Uh, this one's locked, yeah. Okay, that's that one. I think this is where I came from. What's in here? I'm gonna get lost in this, I feel. Although we do have a map. We do have a map. Wait, oh, no, that's where I came from. Oh, uh, okay. Nick Minute Emma gets a taste for retro horror and plays System Shock 2. I don't know anything about... Where'd it go? I'm guessing the body just is gone. Yeah, okay, he's dead. Thank you for the follow, welcome in. All of my streamers are gearing up with horror games except somebody that started a non-horror game, which they won't be able to finish before Spooktober and then she realized, she said, oh snap. <laughs> Are you guys, are you guys hyped for um, Spooktober and a lot of streamers playing spooky games? I know spooky games are for everyone. Um, I definitely, I've, I haven't played much because I get really scared, but I definitely have been able to watch people play them. But now I'm going to try and play them. Try Soma or Visage. Oof, I've seen a little bit of Visage and that one looks terrifying. I don't think I know much about Soma. Soma D's nuts. <laughs> That's great. Just Kieran, you play Left 4 Dead. I don't know if Kieran plays that. This is still your favorite horror game today. Oh, really, Lord Bonk? Welcome in, by the way. We can. We're, step, we're stepping right. Yep, the corpse of your comrade, Kenneth. It looks like he's holding something. Oh, can we take it? <gasps> it's the film that belonged to Kenneth. I need a video play to see what's recorded on it. 
We better take that though. We took it, yeah? Oh, we didn't take it? Ugh, we're gonna have to come back here then and... Wait. It looks like his throat's been torn out. <laughs> Lovely. Maybe we did get the, the thingy. An eerie picture of the mansion decorates the wall. I realize in this game I need to like just be like clicking everywhere because it will give me like, it'll explain things. Why this angle? I can't see. Okay. Birdcage? Oh, it looks like something's hanging. Take the handgun magazine. Yes. Uh. There's a corpse collapsed on the floor like it was an instant death. So they... What the hell happened in this mansion? It looks like maybe they fell. They got pushed off or something. Ooh, what did I get? <gasps> the herb, sure. I don't know what it does, but I'll take it. And the other one. Yes, I will. Um, hang on. You haven't played that Kieran, right? It's weird, all this Halloween thing. In Brazil, we barely care about it just for the actual day, really. Yeah, I mean, Halloween has, has never been big in Australia. It's definitely more common now, but even then, it's not really a thing. Um, but on Twitch, I noticed that obviously a lot of people play spooky games in October, and it's a lot of fun. You're stoked to play spooky games on stream? Nice. It should be fun. I like seeing people get scared on their first reactions. Yeah. <laughs> Back for Blood or whatever, the Not Left for Dead 3 game is coming to Game Pass. Oh, okay, cool. I will tell Michelle you're talking shit about her ever. <laughs> that's actually no, that's how I know how to, how to pronounce Visage. Left for Dead is by Valve, so that's why it's still better than Back for Blood. It's by the people that made Amnesia. Oh, okay. Soma. There needs to be a fixer chair channel rule because this dang chair looks like it'll never get fixed. <laughs> I have, you have a huge list of horror games. I can't decide what to play first. Oh, really, Anthony? Maybe start with some like, you know, like something that's not too scary and kind of build your way up. At least this is what I'm doing. We have Halloween contests at work and school, so it's pretty nice in North America. Yeah. I just consume horror media all year round. Yeah. I've always liked spooky stuff. Um, Kieran and I started watching a new spooky show on Netflix yesterday, actually. Um, Midnight Mass, if you guys have heard of it. We've only seen one episode so far and nothing too scary has happened yet. <laughs> but it's by, I think it's by the same, someone that, made um, The Haunting of Hill House. So I was like, oh, it's gotta be good. Okay, where am I? Where have I been? I'm on the second floor. I think they wanted me to explore the first floor instead though. I think the red markers might be the doors that I can't get through. Yeah, that's that lower section. I mean, we can have a look in here. Yeah. Thank you for the follow, welcome in. There's a mirror. Ooh, shit. Let me take the plant first. I don't know what the green herb does. Let's have, let's actually look at the description. A green herb. 
Kind of looks like mint. And herb that grows wild in this region. I don't know if it'll be like health or something, but I could. Oh, I can mix herbs. Okay. Huh. Are you still alive? How do I. How do I. How do I stomp on you? How do I stomp on you? How do I stomp on you? I think when I try to open that door, he's gonna like get up. Ah! There's one in there! Shit, 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 shit. No, 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 no! You officially dead? You officially dead? I think you're dead. I think it's dead. It's not seem doesn't seem to want to grab me or anything? Okay, cool. I realized when I shoot, I can like aim down at them. That's what threw me off, I think, with the first zombie. We killed a zombie, another zombie though. I see it's not too bad, Emma. It's fine. It's fine. Um, let's get the other plant too. Although, yeah, I can't. Okay, so I am limited for what I can actually carry. And herb. Yeah, I said and herb. No, no. Um. Hell House is good. Wait. Wait, do you, sorry, do you mean Hill House? <laughs> I was like, I don't know Hell House. Hill House. I'm not a big fan of horror, actually, and I see the gays all love it. Maybe I am gay wrong. <laughs> not at all. It's not, not for everyone. I left up to my community during a community bell. Oh, nice, nice. It's weed. <laughs> yeah, and herb. I don't know. Oh, there's a movie called Hell House. Oh, okay. Ah. H words are usually preceded by an. Huh. I didn't know that. Yeah, there's a show, um, The Hoarding of Hill House on Netflix, which is really good. Okay, yeah, we can't pick that up. Can I go in here? I can. Oh. Hello. There's an inscription on the shield. Death is only the beginning. I don't know if I want to be going in here. I see spider webs. Ooh, that looks like it's gonna hurt me. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be moving. Shit. I don't know if I like. That. I want to check out the other door first. Uh. It's a big mansion. Uh, J Toys, hello, how you doing? I'm doing good. You happy to see me play this? <laughs> it's uh, it's gone well. We've killed two zombies so far. Haven't died. Um, I, yeah, I think that's a good thing. I'm sure my community will take pity and choose an easy game. <laughs> hey, then it's easier for you. What, uh, what spooky games do you have on your list, Anthony? It's locked from the other side. Does not open from this side. Okay. Oh, I see something shiny. Let me... Is that like a shit ton of spears? Are they spears? Ooh! Ah, oh, what is that? <sighs> I 
Okay. Let's get rid of one of the plants. Oh, I could probably- oh, I'm out of bullets, actually. I guess... Do I combine it? Yeah, okay. Cool. Well, in that case, I don't need to get rid of. The golden arrow. Yes, I will take the golden arrow. Oh, and there's more. Okay. Let's get rid of the... Let's maybe use this? I don't know what it did. I'm guessing maybe health, but I'm not sure. Well, we need more bullets, thanks. Thank you. Yes, please. Nice. Now we're pretty well equipped. I'd love to save now. Anthony's list, Pokemon Red, but just lavender town. <laughs> First way through of this the game is anything but easy. I'm excited because I know a lot of it is like puzzly, so. Thank you for the follow, welcome in. We've got two doors here. Okay. There's something that's been like shattered. It's like, there's like broken pieces. Okay. What's in here? It's locked. Okay, we can't go that way. What's in here? Oh, I unlocked it! Mmm. Mmm. Oh, I can- I see where I am. Ah, yes, yes, yes. I think it's dead. Oh, I did all right. Okay, I think it's- I think it's dead dead. Alright, there's something shiny here. Oh, it's another dagger. Um, yes, because that's a- I can take that item because it is my defensive items. If I get grabbed from the front, I can use it. Cool. Um, yeah, this is the room ab above just where we were before. I noticed, cause if you look- Oh, you guys can't see. This painting here, this is the one of the two dudes fighting. The herb for health. And Mickey, you might just get a little hungry. Yeah. <laughs> I used it. I still don't know what it did, though. I don't know. It's not going to be the most fulfilling f food, though. I played the original original of this game to scare the pee, pee out of me a little. Really? <laughs> I've been tickled the zombies? No. Emma got that spatial awareness. Mm-hmm. You guys know me and you watch me play other games. I like explore everything very slowly and uh, very cautiously and I try to just like take my time. Can I open this? Okay, this is gonna take us back to the main room. Cool, that's a shortcut. We just unlocked a shortcut. I can go back through this way. Okay, I was just checking. I'm like, hmm, hopefully. I'm pretty sure this door, I couldn't open it from the other side before. I just wanna finish exploring in here. I'm surprised we didn't hear that zombie before. Also, there's still that item in that uh, in that room with the other zombie. 
she's holding something. Can I take that? Oh, I can push that. <gasps> oh, shit. Hang on. Can we push it off the edge? I think I might be able to. There's a gap there. Let's do one more. <laughs> That'll let us get it. What's Kieran been streaming lately? Lately, uh, Kieran started the game Kana, Bridge of Spirits, and oh my gosh, it is so freaking adorable. It's basically like a Disney Pixar film, but like a game. Um, but Kieran played that. He also recently played Tormented Souls, which is the new game that is basically inspired by like the old Resident Evil games like this one. So, um, yeah. What else did Kieran play? It's mostly, mostly mean it. Uh, Hero Link, hello, how you doing? Zombies are attracted to Aussie accents, be careful. <laughs> Can you see lurkers on your end? Uh, what do you mean, Solid? Like, lurkers as in people lurk in the stream? <laughs> If that is it, um, I can see viewer list if I look at it, but I never look at it. Um, and it's only if you have a Twitch account. Um, yeah, for most for most chat boxes, if you're on like desktop, anyone can look at. I think anyone can look at the viewer list, but um, I don't look at it. And even if I did, I wouldn't. I wouldn't call out people who were lurking anyway. A stained glass window. The pattern in the center resembles a woman. Oh, does it? I can't see. Okay. Okay. Was that where I came from? Or this one? I don't remember which one I came from. I'm just checking. Okay, that's one that I came from, so you want to go to the other one. <sighs> ah, thank you. I like my hair too. If Emma catches you lurking, she'll personally lecture you at the end of stream about the consequences of lurking. Not at all! Twitch lurkers are great. It's locked. Okay. An emblem of a sword. All right. Well, I think that is all of up here explored for now. So we we did get the um, we pushed the thingy off. It looks like I should be able to open that window, but I don't think so. Okay, yeah, we can um Go back downstairs, go back through here, and get whatever that item was. It looked like a gem of some kind. But that seemed to be it. I wonder if something's gonna happen when we go back in there. Like, is our friend gonna be back? We're we gonna find him dead. I'll save points in here, so I feel like this room should be relatively safe. Thank you for the follow! Aha! Aha! I don't think I have enough space for it. Let's get rid of one of the uh, the herbs, or herbs, as some people say. I still don't know what the herb does, but... Maybe I can combine it with something, but I don't know. So I don't know what using it does. I just realized actually that thing in the top left that I guess is our heart rate. It says fine underneath it. I wonder if that'll change if we're like hurt or something. 
Hmm. Can I give you a PL? Uh, like in regards to the herb, Chris? The game is severely lacking in the MILF department! Oh, Jill's! Jill's alright. <laughs> he will be dead, and guess who killed him? Manus. <laughs> Zombies aren't really my thing, I hate to say. <laughs> yeah. Yep, herb related. Yeah, sure. Seeing M anything but red hair is so unnatural. So yeah, red hair is a natural colour. <laughs> I wish it was my natural colour. You guys know how much like time I could save? One of the few things you won't thirst for. I've I've I guys. I don't know if I've told you this, but I also really hate zombies and I find them really scary. So another another reason I'm proud to be playing this game. Uh, the zombies in this aren't too bad though. Okay, let's pick up the item. It's a gem. Yes, I will. I wonder if I can like put items somewhere. I feel like now would probably be a great time to save. But like, I've only got like two saves left, you know? You know? Your hair is super pretty. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Herbs heal you or heal status ailments depending on color. Can be combined with one another two. Ah, oh, okay, yeah, cool. I had a feeling it had something to do with healing. But I mean, I don't have any, I don't think I had any status ailments, so like, it wasn't obviously doing anything for me. But I guess I can, if I find them, I can just leave them, and then if I'm like, oh shit, I need to get health, I remember there being a health, you know, back in whichever room it was. Have you ever told the story of me pretending to be a zombie on stream, Emma? I don't think I have. Also, Kieran, it's lul ween. <laughs> also, I think, Kieran, you asked me earlier why I made it lul instead of lol. And that's because the emote is actually based off the lol emote because you've got like the little hand as well. Um, so that's why it's lol instead of lol. I don't think Jill is a mother, Emma. I mean, I mean, you can still be a MILF without being a mom, right? <laughs> Even though it definitely means that at first the M means mom. Anyway. <laughs> What do you mean pretending to be a zombie? Aren't you always in zombie mode? You're so used to typing- yeah, I know. But at least Kira, now when I change them, now when I change the emotes, it just won't have ween on the end for when they go back to normal, and then for Christmas ones I'll probably make it like, just put like, mass at the end, M-A-S. I don't know, we'll see. MILF is a state of being. That's what I that's what I thought. Um, I don't think so. <laughs> what does MILF mean though? Um I'm gonna leave that for you to to Google Alma. <laughs> I don't wanna say it out loud on stream. <laughs> oh, I feel like I should save just in case. I don't wanna like cause uh, I have to go through that whole section again. But I don't use my saves too much. This is this is the stressful part. Maybe not. I don't know. <sighs> We're doing pretty good for items though and stuff. Ugh. <sighs> Bumfluff, hello, how you doing? Mother, I like to friend, yes. Googling MILF rule 34. Mum, I'd like to fight. <laughs> Another game I had got to close my eyes for. Oh, you haven't played this one, Bumfluff. I know you, I know you've played some of the Resident Evil, so. Um. Mm. So far, it's so far I'm enjoying it. I'm not too scared. Oh, 
Oh, you've only played seven and eight. Oh, for some reason, I, I think because you were maybe playing them, I, I thought you had played the earlier ones, but I guess not. How are you finding it other than not too scary? It's good. It's good. It's just like I'm trying to just learn, you know, basic mechanics and how to play the game and stuff. Um, but it's good. It's good. I leave for five minutes and you, you start talking about MILFs. Yep. <laughs> you play all the Resident Evil, but for some reason, I'm glad it's coming out for Oculus. I want to play it like that for the. Ooh, VR. Ooh, that's going to be scary. Um. Oh, I'm torn on. There's still the other zombie we need to kill. The one that I left in the room. Um. That has the knife stuck in its head. Oh my gosh, is that sound? Was that sound happening before? I don't know. Let's just save. We have two saves and I'm sure we'll find more. Let's just do it. I don't know if I should start saving on other ones or not either. Just do that. Just do that. Cool. Have you guys seen the new Jill actress on the new Netflix series? Like a Resident Evil series? I have not. I haven't seen, like guys, I've literally never seen anything. I've never watched a Resident Evil because I know there's movies, isn't there? I've never played Resident Evil. This is my first time. I've only like seen a little bit of gameplay. I'm trying to remember where that other guy was. Where was that other? I think it was in the other side. Like, is that the clock? It's very noisy. It's very noisy. Need a bonk or pants command to tell everyone to keep it in the pants. <laughs> I think a bonk emote would be a, a bonk emote. A bonk emote would be good, but we don't have space for a bonk emote. Um, a bonk command would be. <laughs> Jeff, hello, how you doing? I see you found the spooky emotes and the updated oh gosh emote. <laughs> how you doing? The series is animated, isn't it? I have no idea. It's either a Resident Evil movie or series, they're repeating it, and now it's based on the game and not whatever they hell we've been getting for the last eight years. <laughs> I um I know one of the actresses in one of the new Resident Evils. I think it's a new Resident Evil movie. There's an actress in it that I get told that I look like her a little bit. Could not live with that clock? Neither, that's really annoying. Uh, Butterfly, thank you for the hydrate and the don't get hangry, thank you. We will use bonk command on Kieran all the time. Yeah, we should do it, we should do a bonk command. And so when you at someone, it'll be like a shout out and it ats them. <laughs> Kieran. <laughs> Thank you, Butterfly. I hope you're doing well. All right, let's check out. I think this was the room with the zombie that I left alive. <laughs> I don't know if I, I want to get the item in here, though. And we just saved before, so. Where is it? Maybe the zombie. Oh, that's another one with a sword emblem on it. Ah, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. Okay, shit. I can't fucking see. Just come out here a bit more, dude. I don't know if it's- it's not dead, it's not fucking dead. Oh my god. Controls, just- 
Oh, that automatically updated for me. Ah, nice. Okay. He has no blood coming out. No, I'm gonna waste my fucking bullets. Is he dead? I think he might be dead. I think I wasted some, but that's fine. It's fine. We still have 10 bullets left. Oh. <sighs> Um, am I hard to eat a little while ago? A red chili, bird's eye chili, and scotch bun on my pizza just now. Huh. That must have been very hot. <laughs> For so much chili. And that's what you mean by chili. Uh, by Emma, I've got rehearsals. This is my last show. I can be fuck doing this anymore. I hate it. <laughs> um, all good takes. I hope, I hope you do enjoy it. And I doubt it's going to be your last one. <laughs> J Toys, thank you for gifting a sub to Hero Link. Hero, enjoy your sub badge. Uh, spooky emotes and ad free viewing. Thanks to J Toys. Thank you. Okay, that guy is definitely dead. Might as well have a look in here again. I don't think there was anything else. Just various art supplies. I think this was just like to show you like, oh, you can use this, um, this is how you use the dagger. It was more of a tutorial. Okay, uh, camera. Okay, let's, um, I want to get that item. Can I push this? Can I push it that way? I want to get it back over. No, 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 not that way, not that way, not that way. Okay, this is really confusing at times. There we go. Like maybe I meant to leave it there. Oh, I just tap A to climb up. Okay. Glad I came back for this. There's, oh, it's a map. There's a map of the mansion one first floor. Nice. Nice. I definitely should have got that earlier, but I didn't realize that I just had to tap A to climb up. <laughs> oh, and it, it, oh, it shows me where I've got 100% of items and then the red areas are in progress of items. So I've got everything in those green areas except for that typewriter room. Ah, okay. You got the map. Yep. Sweet. Okay, and this is still locked, so I don't think we can do anything else in here. Now I'm like, God oh, damn it, I should have come in here and then I should have saved. It's fine. Maybe once we get more, um, stuff. Some more tape stuff. And I go in here, no, it's locked. Oh, oh an emblem of a helmet. So there's a bunch of doors that have emblems of either helmets, shields, or swords. That is back outside. We do not want to go back outside because there are scary dogs out there. Okay, so I think I've got to go down there. A heavy looking pitcher. Um. Cause that that first, the dude that we were with in here was saying he was like, "Oh, let's let's explore the first floor," but I haven't seen him since. I haven't seen him since. 
I hope I still haven't got everything. Oh no, that's that room with the um. <gasps> the big um dudes with the shields, um, and the statue thingies that I like went into, and then I was like, no, let's not do this yet. <laughs> You basically couldn't fit your mouth for a short period afterwards. Kind of knew what to expect. Just didn't realize the intensity from the Scotch chili. Oof. Yeah, that sounds not nice. <laughs> Emma, have you played Hyrule Warriors? Uh, I have played Hyrule Warriors. I haven't played... Wait, the Age of Calamity ones. I haven't played the, um, the Breath of the Wild style one. I played the one on the Wii U. But I played it with Kieran, actually, but we never finished it. I think we got close to the end, but we just never did. Winter is coming and I'm warmer with some gift subs. Thank you, J-Toys. And also, it's September, if you guys didn't know. Uh, which means subs are cheaper. Which is always a plus. Okay, looking at this new emote now, I made it too creepy. Oh, Anthony, that's terrifying! <laughs> that is scary. Oh no! <laughs> I haven't updated the command with um the right emotes. Forgot to do that. That's fine. Uh, okay, let's. Uh, I guess we can go down here. I mean, it might be locked. Who knows? It might be locked. Wonder what's on the other side of this door. It's just going to loop me around. Oh, okay. I don't want to go down there. I don't want to go down there. I don't think I can. So that's that's good. I'm glad I don't I can't go in there right now. Uh, I guess we can go Yeah, through to the other section. You haven't played Age of Calamity either. Yeah. I just got back. Did you <laughs> the goblin of fire. Kira, don't. <laughs> Do you have the hiccups now? <sighs> no, I didn't have them before. Oh. j toys what? <laughs> also, I think I said, Emma, did you put the, your name in the goblet of fire? Yeah. That's not the scary part. It was just being loud. Uh-huh. <sighs> you haven't played Age of Clemony either. I just came back to the first one. Touch it. <laughs> Today I really enjoyed though the first one. Yeah, nice. Yeah, Kieran, we have to um actually like replay that and finish it. Yeah. I thought if I ate some red chilies, then I would have a red wave like yours. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that I ain't going down there without someone in front of me for me to push. <laughs> Scare what a little colored clip art can do. Oh gosh, yeah. That scared the <laughs> fuck out of me. <laughs> right? Hey, Aaron. <laughs> Being scared it wasn't even in the game yet. There's the other scare, the other, the other one that scared me a bit when I think it um grabbed me. I wasn't expecting it, but yes. You did have the hiccups like five. I didn't, I wouldn't, I didn't have the hiccups. I was hiccuping a little bit. <laughs> um, that tends to happen on stream when I'm just talking a lot and then it just happens. It happens to Lainey as well, it happens to Crash, other streamers that I know. I think it's just, and I don't hiccup as much like that when I'm not streaming. I think it's just because I'm talking so much. It just happens. Emma, this is the one hiccup sometimes too, yeah. Okay, I think we gotta go back through this way. We could have gone upstairs, but I'd kinda wanna just go back through here and have a look. Emma, did you put your name in the chalice? Says Dumbledore calmly. <laughs> okay. All of this stuff was locked, I'm pretty sure. And if I look at my map, yeah, I think red means it's locked. Like it's like, no, you can't get through. Oh, he had, it's just something about something else, but maybe I already picked it up. Maybe there's items that I just forever pick up and I don't know. We'll see. 
You played Resident Evil 7 in VR and someone scared me. They almost got hit in the throat. Lucky I couldn't see them and missed. Yeah. That's a, not a good time to scare someone playing a scary game in VR. Ugh. It's dangerous. Lainey's weed motes are up. They are. It was good timing. I was like, yes, we get we get Lainey um, weed motes and Emma weed motes at the same time. Reminder, you have lockpicks. Yes, yes, I do. I'm pretty sure I tried it on those doors after I got the lockpick, but they were still like, um, they're the ones that have like the, um, it's saying that there's like an emblem of like a sword or a shield on them. And I don't think I can just unpick those ones. Okay. Yeah, I shouldn't have um, taken all those herbs. It's fine though, it's fine. Pocklix. We're going here and I want to go into that room with the big statue thingies. If we die though, I'll need to go and get the map again because that is something that I... I think this isn't the way. This is to exit, pretty sure. Yeah, this goes to here. And this was locked from the other side, so I can't open that. Yeah, cool. Oh my god, the camera angles throw me off a little bit. <laughs> I want to go back in here. We want to go back this way. We want to go this way. I think this was it. What's your thoughts on the Chocobo EGP and the new Kirby announcement. The Chocobo game looks adorable. It just looks like Mario Kart, but like uh, Chocobo and Final Fantasy characters and stuff. That looks really cute. And the Kirby game looks really awesome too. Even though I've never played a Kirby game, it still looks really good. Uh, and I'm really hyped for Nintendo 64 games to be on the Switch. I've been waiting for that for a long time. So um, very excited. Why is it going to be spiders up here? Like, that thing is definitely going to crush us. There's an inscription on the shield. Death is the true essence of bliss. Really? Hello, what do you say? Death is everything. They keep talking about death. Okay. An emblem of a helmet. So I've, we've got to obviously... What does this do? May whoever takes this emblem find peace in death. Uh, yeah, something bad's gonna happen though. Oh shit. Yeah, we're dead. Oh. We're dead, 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 we're dead. I know it! You are dead. Get used to it. Die for the first time? That was my achievement. <laughs> okay. When did we save? Uh, we, I saved just before um, getting the map. So I'll be, I need to go back and get the map. But I think I wasted too many bullets when I went for it last time, so I can do better. Where's this one? Um, in the darkness lies your fears. Bakers, thank you for the full month resub, guys. Also, did you notice that when the alerts come on screen, it um 
It's got the new emotes, just FYI. Thank you for the four months. That is much appreciated. Enjoy your spooky emotes for this month. Um, add free viewing and your sub badge too. Thank you. How you doing? There's some perfectly good pole arms in that corridor. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the Mario movie announcement. Who the helmet? Yeah, the Mario movie. I am worried. <laughs> Fun fact, the name for something shield shaped is called... Esuchion. I don't know if I said that right. Uh, you just hit 100k rain jobs. Nice. There's an inscription on the shield. Welcome to the cum zone. <laughs> <gasps> All right, I can imagine a lot of unique ways to utilize the abilities of Kirby with the additional depth. If there's a star system collected on like Mario, we could get some pretty fun gameplay. Yeah, yeah, it definitely gave me vibes of like those kind of 3D games like Mario. It looked really good though. You saw some anti Chris Pratt memes though. Yeah, yeah. Yep, Chocobo uh, GP is Square's answer to Mario Kart, though I'm surprised it's taking this long. It looks so good. It looked like so much fun. Especially because, like, we haven't had a new Mario Kart in, like, something like seven years, and I'm just like, oh, it looks so good. And I saw you can obviously play as a Chocobo, you can play as, like, Vivi. So I'm not sure if... So in that puzzle, in that room, I didn't know the... I didn't think the walls were going to go in, so I was, like, thinking, oh, I can, like, go to the side. But obviously they close in on you, so... You've obviously got to do something to stop that so you can get the key. Um, I think I'm, yeah, I'm without my, I'm without my map. So we can go back, get the map, or I could just try to see if I can figure out that puzzle beforehand. Hmm. I don't think I've been up this side. It's locked. Emblem of a sword. I wonder if we'll have like key, like a key with an emblem of a sword, key with an emblem of a shield, and then they open these cer certain doors. Emblem of armor. Hey, I know this painting. It looks very familiar. An oil painting in a large frame. The painting is dried and cracked. It looks like a famous painting. You can't make anything out through the darkness and fog. It's been well preserved and the people in it are still vividly depicted. It's locked on the other side. Okay, so this is the other one. Yeah. Ooh, camera. The Chocobo Racing game is going to take over my life. Right, it looks so good. It'll just be like a new Mario, because it looks like Mario Kart. So I'm like, it'll be like a brand new Mario Kart, and um, I'm sure it'll have like online play and stuff. So I'm hyped. I'm hyped. Freeze. I said freeze. <laughs> hey, Demon Lord. If they decide to get fancy with Chocobo uh, GP stage designs, we could see iconic areas from old Final Fantasies. That would be really cool. Not that I would probably get a lot of them because I've only played a couple of Final Fantasy games, but yeah. Don't know if it's a spoiler, but Resident Evil 4, the community remaster is full of beautiful paintings. Huh. I wouldn't say that's much of a spoiler. Okay. Yeah, so we already got the gem. It's just that other room that we didn't go back into. This was the door. I think it might be quicker to go this way. I was hoping for at least maybe a little sneak peek of the next Mario Kart. Yeah, same. You're more sat more than satisfied with the Chocobo Racing, right? It's kind of just like it'll it'll keep everyone that loves Mario Kart going until like the next Mario Kart comes out. I don't know if this way was quicker. I might suss out. the room before we go and activate things because I don't know if I can 
don't know if I can even solve this puzzle yet. Like, I'm not sure if I need something in particular. Don't tell me. I'll figure it out. So this one says, death is only the beginning. So they're all just about death. Like, maybe I meant to... Can I push this one? I can't seem to do anything with it. I knew this guy was going to kill me. It was pretty freaking obvious. This one says, death is the true essence of bliss. So they just talk about life and death, really. This room, I wasn't able to do anything. And see, I didn't realize that I was like, oh, once he comes through, I can hide here. and That's fine. And then I didn't realize that the walls were closing in. I was like, oh, shit. There's this guy here. Death is everything. So I can't seem to, I don't think I can pull anything in this game. Like I think I can only push items and stuff. Can I push this? I don't think so. Hmm. And then when I was stuck here, I pretty much just, I think that guy came up behind me. So I couldn't go through here. It's locked. Yeah, I'm like, I'm just like, I'm not sure if I just, I don't have the right thing yet. Maybe I need a specific item or something. I don't know. I wish I could like move them around. I wonder if there will be a type of blue shell handicap to keep the front runners back like Mario and if so what will the item be in the Final Fantasy universe? Hmm. Have to death drop to survive how much yet? There's a new Mario Kart. No there isn't but there's um there's a game Chocobo GP I think it's called and it basically Ryab it's like it looks like Mario Kart but it's Final Fantasy related so it had like a Chocobo you could play as or Vivi um, from Final Fantasy Nine, um, yeah, it looks um, it looks really good. Can't open that. Hmm. A large bird cage. There's a dead raven inside. Lovely. I didn't check that before. What's that painting? That painting looks familiar to you. I think they've got a lot of sorts of paintings in here that are like old famous paintings. You bet Vivi will have 9999 speed. Oh, that was Dagger <laughs> with the, the glitching. That's cool. We need more kart races good enough to rival Mario Kart. Yeah. And especially because like we haven't had a new Mario Kart in so long. It's just like, oh, this will be good. It'll keep us going. Oh my god, camera. <laughs> I'll be like going in one direction and the camera changes and it's like, oh, you're going this way instead. Yeah, that's locked. I don't think I can go through any of these ones. Technically, I can go out the front door. Apparently. Okay, I 
think this might be the eggs. No. This one? This one. Uh, Twisted Rune, hello, how you doing? Unless, like, maybe, like, we could, I don't know if it would work, but the trick of, like, oh, maybe, I haven't even tried using the items that I have around there. Ugh. Another bot follow. No thank you for that follow, silly bot. Uh, welcome in Resident Evil Jesse, by the way. Hello. Look from the other side. So Dark Souls took from this game too. Yeah. <laughs> right? That's exactly what I thought. Um, I guess it's like a big shield. It's not necessary to use this now. I wonder if I could use that to block or something. My other idea was like, oh, maybe we find another key somewhere and then like when we take the key, we can replace it with another key and trick it. But the only movement is the silent flicker of the candles. Play. Eerie. Okay. Oh, that's... Yeah, that's a statue. I haven't really done much since we last um, saved. So maybe we go back. I might try the shield. That seems kind of like maybe the, uh, the only thing that seems like I can do right now. We'll give it a try. We might die. But I haven't done anything since um, I reloaded. I didn't go back into that room with the... Um, um, I think I'm going the wrong way. The um, the map because I'm just like uh, if I die, then I've got to do that again and again and again. So we'll wait. I know how to get the map though, so I'm gonna try the shield. We'll try the shield. I kind of forget that I have items like that in my inventory. That's like I gotta just go in and actually select use rather than just having like a button that I can go to use it. Okay, um, in here. Okay. I mean, hang on, let's... Yeah, so it's not necessary to use it now. I'm guessing once I take the key, maybe I stand there and hold it and that can block it. I don't know. That one's locked. But I'm pretty sure this key is gonna like, I think it's like the master key, I think it said. So it's going to, um, it's going to help. Let's just see. Oh, I need to eat the thing. <laughs> Let's eat the herb. Even though it doesn't do anything for me right now. Okay. Mansion key. So I'm, I'm sure this will probably open a lot of things. So. 
Then I'm gonna see if using the shield is going to be useful here. Don't know if it can protect me against that. I can't use it now? Yeah, it's obviously that just like reversed things. Helmet. I wonder if the ones that talk about a shield, I can, like I meant to present the shield? I don't know, that doesn't seem right. Hmm. You love the new emotes, by the way. Oh, thank you, Bumflop. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I'm really happy with how they turned out. Um, and you guys probably noticed I did get rid of the Guru emote. I still liked it, but I really like the cozy one with a little blankie, so. And I think, because I think the, the angry one, like, I liked it and it got used sometimes, but it was one of the more, it wasn't as usable as my other ones. I think the cozy one is going to be good because we have some cozy streams. <laughs> and um, I think it's really cute. I might do a, another, like, angry one for maybe a different um, different thing or like a bit, em bit emote or something. I don't know. We'll see. Hmm. Yeah, I could not seem to use the shield. Like, I don't know if it was just like, oh. I wasn't close enough. I feel like maybe I need another key that I can replace this with. You know? Or maybe the, the arrow? I don't think that'll fit. Let's just take this. We'll try some other stuff. The arrow is going to be too long, I think. Make one washing your hands! <laughs> it's not necessary to use this now. I can only equip it. I don't... What if I try to use it now? I can't use it. I think I must need another key so I can trick it. That's what I feel like I'm meant to do. But I need to find another key, I think. Guys, no spoilers or backseating. I uh, I, if you guys are new here, I do say a lot of questions, but they are rhetorical. I don't actually want answers to it. I want to be able to figure this out for myself. Because I think that's more fun. Rather than you guys just telling me what to do. It's locked. Yeah, I want to go to one of the doors that talk about how needing a- that have like a shield emblem on them. I don't think anything's changed in here since I- since I do that. Now the question, do I make myself another copy or wait a little bit? Hmm. Depends. Can you handle a lot of coffee? I actually could go for I haven't had a coffee in ages, but I'm like, you know what, I could go for a coffee. It's a it's a nice 
cozy day today. Yeah, I think um you'll make one. Ooh, a mocha would be would be lovely. A mocha instead of a biscoffee. Um Maybe we do get the map so that I can actually have a look at the map and see where else there is. Because I've tried so many of the doors and they're all locked. They're all locked. No. Hang on. Is this the right way? Yeah, okay. I'm getting confused. Uh, this one is locked too. Off from the other side. That's like one that I have to open from the other side. It's like a shortcut one, like in Dark Souls. Um, pretty sure all these are locked. Can I fall off here? No, I can't. Can I jump down here? I cannot. Okay. Just check it. Just check it. idea for a stream play a game with the blindfold on and it's a backseating only stream that has to literally guide you through <laughs> but how would i read the chat <laughs> a little mocha as a treat yes i don't have coffee a lot like i'm not like addicted to coffee or anything but i don't mind it occasionally so it'd be a nice treat That'd be good for a shortest period of time. You could do text to speech, but uh, I think that would be very tough to do. And also I wear makeup and any kind of blindfold is gonna rub my makeup off, so that would be bad. I wanna do world building and watch stream and my book is right there, but like effort. <laughs> I know the feeling, Miss Bourne. That maybe it would be better for Kieran because he doesn't wear makeup. What I really don't get is when you play a game for the first time and you figure something out for the first time, you get that kind of trumping feeling. So when somebody else is playing and it's their first time at the game, sometimes I uh, feel the need to mention it when clearly the fun is to figure it out as they know from experience themselves. Exactly, exactly. That's like, I mean, some people play games on, on on Twitch, on stream, and they want backseating, and obviously that's like how they want to play, so that's totally fine. Um, but I feel like it's definitely, I think it's more common for people to not want backseating because they want to play the game for the first time, and a lot of it is figuring things out, you know, for themselves. And I honestly think that makes it more fun to watch as well. Because if, if someone's just telling them what to do, then it's like they're just doing it, you know. Um, I think it's more interesting and it's it's fun to watch someone else figure something out. What's this? Wait, there's a door? What? Since when? Since when? Is this outside? Oh no. It's like, is it a cemetery? Fuck. I don't want to be out here. Um, I haven't done anything since my last save, so... We good. We good. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. <gasps> is this a key? It's locked. Ugh. I need another key so I can get the other key. <laughs> Okay, wait, that's there. The perspective is throwing me off. Uh, I was not expecting outside parts in this game. Like, I knew you were in, like, a... Mansion of some kind. <gasps> a tomb engraved with the picture of an angel, and there's also an arrow on there. There's an indentation in the shape of an arrowhead. I don't think I can... 
Oh, it won't fit in the indentation as is. Oh, maybe I need to combine it with something. Text to speech would be madness. Yeah, yeah. You saw a chat controls Dark Souls recently? Oof. <laughs> you really want to see either of you play Pokemon? If I ever play it, uh, it'll be like, yeah, very much first time playing. When you give people space to play, they work out interesting new ways of beating things. That's way cool and following a guide. Yeah, right? 100%. So if I'm watching someone new to a series that you're super into familiar with, yep. Watching them explore everything fresh is fun. Exactly. I think it's like uh, the best way to kind of try to experience the game again for the first time. But you're watching someone else experience it. But it's like, you know, you kind of get that same feeling of like, oh, this is like all new to them. Um, yeah. Also, welcome in uh, Tiles. Uh, all good all good here, really. Uh, welcome in Nocturne. Hello from France. Well, hello from uh, Sydney, Australia. You do a good job at uh, understanding, at least attempting to read and understand my kerfuffle. Yeah. <laughs> that kid grows up to be an Onolondo archer. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to bed now. You're going to a festival in the morning. Oh, that's exciting. I hope you have fun at the festival tomorrow. Thanks for hanging out. Have a good sleep. And we're playing Pokemon would be fun to see what nicknames we would come up with. <laughs> Guys, I've never played a proper Pokemon game. I think if anything, I'll probably play like Pokemon Snap. Po the original Pokemon Snap is coming to the Switch. That's pretty cool. Okay, so it says it's... What did it say again? It wasn't... It won't fit in the indentation as is. So I think I'm right in that I need to use that, but I think I need to maybe combine it with something... Wait. Okay, yeah. <laughs> it's the closest thing in the similar shape that I had. I'm just waiting for a zombie to pop up though, like. Oh, there's a box here. Will you take these shotgun shells? Sure. I think so. Do I want them? I don't have a shotgun. But... I feel like I should collect everything in this game. <laughs> even if I don't have the space for it. Okay. Well... I don't think I can combine... Yeah, that's just for a gun. Hmm. Okay. <gasps> Pardon me. Over here is this. Look from the other side, so I'm guessing I will be able to access that from a different angle. I am surprised there's been no zombies out here. I can hear those moths. Ew. I need your help? What do you need help with, Alma? Pokemon Snap Seeds. <laughs> you have Pokemon Snap on your Wii U. Oh, nice. You played it again through LA this year? Oh. I um I remember playing it a little bit when I was younger because we like rented it out, um, but I never owned it, so I don't think I got very far. Limited space is always so st stressful to you. Say some challenges for Ori in the Blind Forest game, maybe something different of charmless Hong Kong, <laughs> but as much difficult. I need to remember what um what like the controls are and stuff, or what things there are in Ori. I forget. Okay. Um. <laughs> I might get the map just so it gives me something to like look at. Cause I that is 
armor. I need to find one that says a shield. Right back, 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 okay. And I think... I wonder where our friend is. I haven't seen him in ages. Okay, what I'm gonna do, we're gonna go and... Actually, maybe let's look out the front door. I, don't, I haven't done much since like I last died. So we went out, we went out to that outside area, picked up the shotgun. Shells, and that's it. Uh, uh. Oh shit, 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 shit. No! I didn't think that was gonna do anything! I didn't think that I didn't think uh, anything was gonna happen there. Okay. Let's not open that door again. Let's not do that. The dog didn't drop anything. Okay. We're gonna go through here. We're gonna find one of the doors that say it's got a shield emblem on it and then try using the shield there. That's gonna be my, that's the next thing to try. Nocturne, thank you for the stretch and Anthony for the hydrate. I think it's been an hour. Uh, it has definitely been, it's 12.30. I'm getting a little bit hungry. Um, oh, Kieran, I have, as part of my lunch, you could just microwave the leftover chips that I have. If you could put them on like a medium sized plate with a fork and microwave them for a little bit. That'd be good. It won't be enough for lunch though, but... Oh. Chip sandwich sounds really nice, actually. I could do chip sandwich with, like, barbecue sauce. Maybe Kieran could help. Your wisdom and knowledge of the force would be welcome. <laughs> I'll be back in a little while, Emma. No worries, Jeff. Feed them some Scooby snacks. Uh, microwaved is fine. Okay. I'm gonna go through here. I was like, uh, going through these doors takes so long, but obviously like this and this an old game <laughs> probably needed some load times. It's locked on the other side, so that's just a locked on the other side door. Maybe they don't have any with shields. I thought it said shield, but maybe it just has been armor this entire time. I don't think I can. I can't use the elevator. I'm guessing I can only act. I can only access it from the actual elevator part. Okay. Hmm. I definitely think we need to find another key, like a dummy key, for that other room. That's what I'm thinking. We go this way.
I think there's some people, I don't know if they're ones that have like the sh um, armor or sword emblem. I think a bunch of them are just locked or locked from the other side. I don't think I've missed any items. And this one takes me back up top. Hmm. It's with a sword emblem. Like that must that must mean something when it's talking about like the emblems on them. Otherwise, if it didn't matter, like, why would they mention it? I'm gonna go get the map and have a look at the map. It might be something that I'm missing. I was like, shit, I've only got two bullets left, but we have the other one. We have got the other 15. Because pretty much everywhere is, is like blocked off. We need that key. I think this was just... Yeah. Alright, we'll go back in here. We'll move the thing out of the way. Because I want to be able to kill this guy. I don't know he's going to come out of here. Okay, yeah, he's dead. Okay, cool. Don't waste your bullets ever. Don't push it that way. No, 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 no. <laughs> I can't pull it. It's annoying because I've got to like get it in there. And then we do this. At least I don't think I can pull it. So the map might show me extra stuff. Not sure. Yes, we will take it. Well, I haven't found everything in that typewriter room. So maybe there's something in there that I just haven't found yet. Because all the others, and except up there, that's the room with the... Um, the statue that keeps killing me. But I haven't found everything down there. Huh. Okay. And it's just the first floor so that, yeah, there's separate maps for each floor. Well, I can't go in there. That's an emblem of a sword. There's like a- wait, hang on. Is there a back room? Hang on. If you look at the map, it looks like I should be able to get in there. I don't know if this is a good idea. I don't want to waste my bullets. <laughs> um, I just want to like break it open. This is just, I mean, I could equip that and then
So I guess this is good to have if I do run out of bullets. can definitely there's if you look on the map there's that little there's a there's a gap there hmm please in a back seating guys don't tell me anything this painting obviously does not want to break I thought maybe I could move it but it, this feels like a flat wall so I don't think so. I don't think so. I'll go back out here. I'm going to check the other room because there's definitely something in there that I haven't got. It's telling me that I haven't completed the room yet and I don't know if that means like I should complete it now or not. Um, but yeah, there's also in the middle up the up the top. I think that's the outside section. I don't know if I can progress there. Let's go back in here and have a look. Let's see if I've missed anything. I think I had. I feel like I'd explored this room pretty thoroughly, but you never know. Maybe I meant to use something. When the okay, so this was like a this was like a hint. When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. When the two have run each other through, I don't know if that if that's talking about the um the statues up the top. Yeah, so we got that. Haven't been able to use it yet. That clock is so annoying. <laughs> it's so annoying. A large Filth encrusted jar. Why don't we? I'll actually will get my other. I'll get my survival knife out and see if I can use that because it's not like I have limited use with it. I don't think stabbing the fire is going to do anything. the other way. Other way please, thank you. Hmm. Biggest spoil this game. Do not get bitten by a zombie. Bad things happen when they bite you. Yeah, I um I want to avoid the zombies and getting bitten by them. And the two have run each other through. I don't know. This 
way. Hmm. And I can't seem to find like a dummy key or anything. I need to use my knife and it's just not doing anything else either. <laughs> I, I thought I could might maybe break that painting and go through, but I could not. And I don't think there's anywhere else I can hide in that statue room either. Like, I don't think I could run towards it. And then hide somewhere like it's pretty much, it's pretty much like blocking you in. Like as soon as it, pardon me, oh gosh, comes around here. I can't go, like I can't go to the right, so. Uh, I wouldn't be able to go forwards and run around. You can always pretend to be dead. <laughs> I don't know how that's going to help me. That's a hiccup. Yep. Yeah. It's like a hiccup, but it's not like I have the hiccups, you know, having the hiccups. And it's not like, it's very different to a, an other, when you actually have the hiccups and you can't stop hiccuping. Those are not real follows, guys. Well, that's disappointing. I don't, so it says we have reached over 3,000 followers, which is very exciting, but also very disappointing that a lot of them are probably fake followers and they're bots and they're just gonna unfollow me right away as well, so. Fuck you, you bots. <sighs> Give me a, give me a moment guys. I'm just going to go ban them all. Lame bots. It's so annoying. I heard hiccup while they're making your lunch. Do I need to scare you again? No, you don't need to scare me again. That was enough. That was enough. You got a couple of hotspots today too. Ugh. I wasn't getting them for a bit there and like obviously today we've gotten a bunch through. How can you tell the ones are fake? So they're they all start with Hoss, a bunch of numbers, and then like there's like a variation of the name. It's a very well known um oh my god. Bot accounts that are um known to be connected with like the hate raids and stuff. How do the follow bots hurt a streamer? Uh, they're fake follows. Like, it's just like having, it looks like you'll have more follows, but you know, it's not legitimate people who are following you. So you have inflated numbers, which I don't know, some people want more numbers and they don't care if they're fake, but I don't want people following me who don't actually want to follow me or who aren't real. Um, so I think I got them all. Uh, I'm just going to stop alerts for the moment. I've never had it like this bad though, where they've just constantly come in. If you click on their profile, they page you like IP, yeah. So you don't ever look at, look at a profile of an account, at least starting with Hoss. 
they're real. This is the worst I've ever had them. I don't know if it's because I told them to fuck off. <laughs> I don't know if it's someone who's like actually here or if they just like, they just go and mass follow accounts or something. I'm not sure how, how it works. Um, maybe have a look at your, your own accounts and see if you guys are getting follows from them. I don't know. Might be a warning. Yeah, that's something that like it could be. That's why I'm always careful when I see them come through. I'm always like, okay, I'm just going to like wait and see. Emma, you keep playing it. I'll clear out the trash. Are you able to see them though, Mistborn? The fault, the usernames? Anyway, anyway, I'll just, does ModView um, show the follows, does it? Okay, I don't use ModView on Kieran's channel, so <laughs> I don't know. It's disappointing that the name following wasn't longing, then rusted, then 17. <laughs> Sometimes an individual hangs out in chat and waits, happen multiple times to, to tune. Oh, really? Oh. Why do people got to be so shitty? If people come in saying awful things, though, I do have a button on my stream that will help, but hopefully not. I've never had to use it, which is which I'm very thankful for. I spent like 30 minutes putting a new glass screen protector on and off, making sure no dust would get on. Oof. It can be tricky. I think the glass ones are easy to put on than the plastic ones. The plastic ones are horrible. I mod view for my friend channel and it's so busy in that mod, really. If they get all the follows without getting banned. Streamer says, ready to comply. Oh gosh, yeah. <laughs> they like attention, especially if it's negative. Yeah, yeah. Well, I've, uh, I've turned my alerts off for now. Um... Actually, I have my follow alert and my other alerts on separate thingies, so I can actually turn them on. And then I'm just gonna turn my follow alert one off for a little bit. So, hang on. I think that's right. Yep. Yeah. Um, that way it follows won't come through because it's, I mean, not that they use username shop on screen. It's just kind of annoying having them go off and I'm like, oh, they're not legitimate follows. But anyway. Um, because this is my first Resident Evil, I'm also like not. I'm not sure what the puzzles are like. Like I've never, I've never experienced these puzzles before. So I don't know what kind of puzzles they are. <laughs> so that's one thing. Like, I think once I've, you know, I've played through this one, it'll be like, I'll understand how at least some of the Resident Evil games work. Um, hey Bagel, how you doing? Did I say hello? I'm sorry if I didn't. If I said it twice, then hello twice. <laughs> Mod view should be able to see them. Katie's very nice and clears out the trash followers. Oh, nice. Okay, I didn't. I didn't know that. Um, that is good to know. Uh, why can I watch Twitch stream in 720p but not a Discord stream? I have no idea. I don't know anything about streaming in Discord. Sorry, Bagel. You're going to die a lot, probably. Skull, probably. We had Canadian elections here and some kid on Twitch didn't like the party I was with, so he tried to change my mind with his passive aggressive attitude, <laughs> but I knew he was a troll. So I told him to annoy his parents and I'll block him. So then he started cursing at me. Ends up I was right and my party won the election. <laughs> nice. I mean, hopefully it was a good party that won. <laughs> but that's, that's kind of funny. Yeah, people like that. I'm just, at this point we kind of just Ban much easier these days. Uh, Kyle, hello, how you doing? I see you found the emotes there and the sip emote. I really, I really love how the sip emote turned out. It's so cute. <laughs> it's 
It's Lulloween, Kieran. You'll get used to it. you get used to it. Ween motes are here. I can't see new followers come in, but I'll wait to see if we get new followers. Yeah, there's uh, none have come in in about five minutes, so um, I'll put it back on. I mean, it doesn't really matter because they don't... Um, on the screen, like the usernames don't show up anyway, so it's just like annoying if I think if I know they're fake. But the alert will still go off now, and and uh, you guys will be able to see if there are any other host accounts. They're fantastic. <laughs> I'm glad you like them. I'm really happy with them. I think they look really good. Ah. <sighs> Can we just, can we stab you? <laughs> okay, move the right time for your emotes and they're gorgeous. You did! Perfect timing, Bill. Like, literally to this morning I, I uploaded them. Like, I don't want I've only got one save left, so I don't want to do that yet until we figure this out. But I do need to remember that outside I've been outside and I got the map. That's all I've done. I might go back outside again and see if there's anything else. These all just talk about death and they don't say anything else. There's no way for me to run and hide. Like I, I think, I think I must need a dummy key or something. That's my guess. I don't know for sure. Don't tell me if that's it or not. But that's my. That's really only how I can see that I can solve the puzzle, and for me to have the key, and for me to to stop this thing from stabbing me to death. <laughs> Perfect time. It's ninety-eight hours stream day. <laughs> no. Please, it makes sense. Stream to 99 hours since it's new mode. <laughs> I won't survive that long on stream. I need my sleep. You guys know this. I swear, Emma has a guy. She's OP. Really? I've been stuck for ages. <laughs> we are not getting anywhere at the moment. I will bring coffee. Coffee over sleep. <laughs> Coffee's not gonna keep me awake if I'm that tired. Can't say I know about the dummy key, but I do know I'm dummy thick. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna head back out here. We're gonna go back outside and have a look. I kinda need to go to the toilet too, so I might go take a little break. We'll have a little break. If I leave the game here, hopefully it's fine. No breaks, but I need to take a break. <laughs> Have you been playing this game for three hours? I've been playing uh, probably for about two and a half hours, maybe a little less, because we chat we chat at the start for a bit first. Kyle's here break time. Honestly, Kyle, I mean, it's just how the stream goes, isn't it? <laughs> the timing that when you arrive and me needing to go to the toilet, just like, It happens. It happens. It'll probably change though when uh, daylight savings changes and stuff. <laughs> uh, but yes, I'm going to take a quick little break. It wasn't right away this time you're getting, yeah, it wasn't, wasn't like exactly as soon as you got here. I was like, bye. Um, yes, I'm gonna take a quick little break. Don't go anywhere guys. I'll be back very soon and hopefully I can figure out this puzzle because I, at this point, I'm not really sure, but we'll get there. This is, this is what you get with, um, a first playthrough. You watch me struggle. And then eventually figure it out. <laughs> she lets you watch for three seconds now before break. <laughs> All right, I'll be back soon, guys. Be back soon. Right on the second balance. Like, just jump. Like, am I? I don't. Guys, I think this is just gonna be stream from now on. <laughs> Uh, jumping on this flower's tatas. Does me saying hearts sound really weird? Hearts? 
I don't say like heart. Is that like, do Americans say like kingdom hearts? <laughs> No, that's it. That's it! Second try. Fuck yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. Did I get him? Yes! Fuck yeah! <laughs> Let's have bonus. Let's look at them. <gasps> look at that! It's done. What's bonus? Is the bonus just the mini games that you play? in this game is beaver bother the like the worst one where you've got to get the beavers in the the hole we can we can just go and re i wonder if anyone literally goes i'm gonna go replay these mini games because they're just so much fun come here i want to i want to get off there ha <laughs> one two three here we go oops oh, oh i didn't mean to do that <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> okay. And he growled and everything. Can I keep the ball? I've got somewhere to take you. Follow me. <gasps> Is this the birthday stuff? I'm so excited. Oh, <gasps> there was the creepy dude in the back there. The guy that sells the art. Did you see him? Look how cute this is! Yeah, the, the guy was walking in the back. Oh, it's so cute. And look at the guy, his party hat. And there's a cake. Do I get gifts? <gasps> this is so adorable. I got it, but I'm probably not going to make it. I'm going to swerve to the right as much as I can. <gasps> I made it! Oh my gosh. Finally! <laughs> Fuck. Thank you. 
my gosh, I didn't, I, because I'm not listening to the music. I was like, I had no idea. I wasn't even looking at the time. Woo! Oh gosh, I hope this me game is. Welcome to bonus day. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you serious? There's another one? Oh gosh. I did it. That is so much easier without sound. Oh my gosh. It is the last one. I never have to do that again unless I decide to replay this game at some point. <laughs> I don't know if I'd ever want to go for 100% again. Mm, maybe. Done. I did it so much quicker that time though. All that practice from before. I'm back. Uh, yes. Kyle, I didn't think you'd seen those emotes, but I'm really happy with them. I love the Agatha one because <laughs> she likes to eat. She likes to eat. So I was like, let's make one that is more themed around her. I almost carried myself on the door. Oh, no. There you go. Thank it's hot. you. Eat it now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Okay, gear it. You have two hours, mate. Hmm? For what? Wait, you wanted Kyle to send you money? Uh, Bill, what are you doing? Okay. That's really weird. Kieran? Wait, no, sorry, it's hiding behind. I was like, where's my lipstick? But it was hiding. It's okay, you didn't do anything. All right. This stuff is going to be really hot, so I'm probably not going to eat it just yet. But Kira made me a chip sandwich. We'll look outside again, and then I'll eat afterwards. What is a chip sandwich? So it's just a sandwich, and then you put hot chips on it. And then you could either have salt with it, or like a sauce. In Australia, you'd eat, like, it's popular to have uh, the tomato sauce or barbecue sauce on it. Fries on a sandwich. <laughs> so, hang on. We had a map. We had a map. Oh, this is that part. That part that's going forwards, right. How come Kira makes commands for your stream? Because he likes to. <laughs> you never heard of that before? It's really tasty. Your favourite Australian movie is Wolf Creek. I haven't seen that. I have not seen it. Uh, could you give a tip not to spoil it? Ah! No. I... I'm being careful with it. I'm being careful with it. If one of my mods could, uh, bop those fake followers that are coming through, please and thank you. Both of those were, um, fake followers. Oh, you can't. Oh, good. I can get him. It's honestly not even a tip. If you don't do this, you literally can't progress. Is it a game mechanic?
I know I'm obviously like missing something, but that's part of playing the game though, so even if it's I'm still hesitant to know what it is. <gasps> no, what am I doing? Oh, I I always type raid ban. I type I'm we're not raiding one of the bots, guys, don't worry. <laughs> ban. Not raid. What am I doing? We're not ending stream, it's early. That's just my go-to, like, what I'm typing in. Ban. I have to go. Need to finish an article due to two days. Due two days from now. Have a nice stream, and I hope you get the key you need to open the place with the key so you can replace the other key with that key. <laughs> yes. I hope so too, Alma. You have a good sleep. I'm sure we'll see you tomorrow. We have to be in mod mode for that. Ah, uh, okay. It's why you're stuck after three hours. Hey, that's uh, that's part of playing the game for the first time, with no help. I'll switch over a few reference. Oh, good, it's fine. I mean, we don't normally um have this many come through. I would say scold DM uh, carrot and zero with what it is, and he will let you know if I should be aware of this said thing or not. Oh my god. Right, yep. Yeah. That was an accident. <laughs> oh, King, you just got floated by one too. Yeah. I don't know if it's because I've got like, if I want to fuck up my little follower goal or what. I feel like they're- I feel like they're here watching. Oh my god, Emma, stop doing that! Fucking hell. Not raid. Oh my god, guys. <sighs> I keep typing raid because it's just my automatic, like, when I'm typing in forward slash to do something, it's always raid. They just like to um to ruin the stream. Cause now I gotta sit here banning everyone. Not everyone. Just go back what is happening. I'm accidentally raiding bots and then realizing that I'm saying raid and not ban. <laughs> so that's fun. That's fun. I'm hiding my follow alert. We're trying to raid the hate guy. Is there anyone lurking who is also hoss? Cause that sometimes hap that might happen. I don't see anyone. I I feel like I feel like th this person is actually. I feel like a lot of the the bot followers are just automatic, but I have a feeling that uh, this one is actually somebody watching, and they keep coming back and doing a couple more, which is really annoying. Now my followers are like fucked up. You know what? Let's just, uh, goodbye follower goal. We're just gonna have a sub goal. See that we can't see any changes happening. Uh, I've turned my follow alerts off. Now that we have no idea that they're here. I'm not hot, host, please. <laughs> hey Kyle, how you doing? Also, Darren, welcome in. <laughs> Not everyone is banned, just the just the Hoss ones. Fight the evil bots. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm gonna have some food now. Thank you, King. I thought you should give him a shout out. And I was like, wait. But yeah. Yeah. You want a chip sandwich, Valentine? We have no more chips. Oh no. You're in my view now, so yeah. Sorry, I read that one already. Damn, Hoss, I missed the. Want to become famous, Bots? <laughs> 
I um I haven't gotten that that one in a while actually. Thank you, Kyle. This is really good. So it's just basically a sandwich with fries for you Americans or hot chips for you not Americans with barbecue sauce. You can just leave it up in another tab, yeah. So you can just watch on a normal one and then and then check it. You see guys, as soon as I took my alerts off and as soon as I took the goal off, there's been no other follows yet since that last one. I just want the attention. Mm, this is really good. I'm in mod view too, but it's more confusing for me than anything. I've seen mod view like once, Mistborn, when I was like in Kieran's channel and I was like, oh my gosh, this is so confusing. <laughs> You want a burger now? A chip buddy? Yeah. I had some leftover chips and then Kira was like, do you want a chip sandwich? And I was like, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Try not make a mess though. Sandwich is best life. Mm hmm. What view is really helpful when you get used to it. Yeah. I don't want nothing here to to like warrant using it. <laughs> I have it so I can have like the little quick icons next to usernames for like ban, timeout, or delete. That's about it. What have you done so far? Um, I found kicked booty. <laughs> Not quite. I found the arrow. I found the shotgun shells outside. There's that puzzle room and I just like the one with the um the moving statues and the key. I tried to put the arrow here on this thing, but look what it says. It won't fit in the indentation as is. So it looks like it's just the end piece actually. Like it looks like I just need the end piece. So maybe I got to break it. Can I break it? I'm not sure. Um. The arrowhead looks like it can be removed. That's what we've got to do. Oh. The arrowhead is made from, is it the T is not pronounced? Peridot? Sometimes referred to as a poor man's emerald. So wait, have I? <gasps> oh, fuck yeah. Let's go. Here we go. I'm smart. I can do things. Um, Darren, thank you for the hydrate, by the way. If you wanted to give Emma a real horror game, I have a suggestion. You guys are just Minecraft. The freaking um, is it the 
Mm, there's a creature in Minecraft that's scary. I'm going to finish my sandwich before we progress because I don't want it to get cold. Silent Hill. I don't think I know anything about the Silent Hill games. It's a chip sandwich, like hot chips with barbecue sauce. I'll get back to the end very soon. <laughs> We did same, but okay, it's so good trial. Happy to try it one day. Silent Hill is trippy. Oh. I've also got coffee here too that I need to have. Okay. You just eat a cheeseburger with a donut as a bun like us Americans. <laughs> why, why would you have one that's like a donut bun? Why just like a normal bun? Okay. Coffee, dessert time. Because America. <laughs> you enjoyed Evil Within, but I do agree it can not be for everyone. I tried playing a little bit of that last year and I could not, but maybe now that I've played more scary games, maybe. Mm, that's really good, Kieran. If you guys like my mug, if a uh, shop is still here. Thank you again for this. Okay. <clears throat> oh. My tummy feels good now. Had lunch, had a nice hot drink. Gonna redo my lipstick. Then we can get back to play. By the way, Anthony, did you notice your new tier two and three emotes? Just saying. Dead space is good. I don't know if I'm too scared for that. Redo lipstick being pretty sounds exhausting. Mm -hmm. When you eat, because the lipstick comes off. <laughs> Emma got to look fabulous before she's kicked some booty again. Yeah, always. Okay. <gasps> we unlocked this. I guess we should go down here. Uh, let's get yeah, all the way, Emma. This way. Um. Let's put on our gun again. I've already got six bullets left. Shit. I don't want to go into freaking crypt or something. I don't want to be down here. Why is there things cogs moving? <gasps> 
a stone statue with a hole where the eyes should be. A stone statue with holes where the eyes, nose, and mouth should be. Okay, it's the puzzle. Ugh. A stone statue with a hole where the nose should be. A stone statue with a hole where the mouth should be. Yeah, so there's one with the eyes missing, nose missing, mouth missing, everything missing. <laughs> that makes sense, yeah. <laughs> Probably something that you wouldn't you wouldn't think of if you don't wear makeup. <gasps> is that a dummy key? No, it's a book. A book is fitted perfectly in the indentation. Oh no, something's gonna happen if I take this. Will you take the book of curses? Not yet. Let me keep exploring, please. I feel like we should be finding like Vincent Vincent Valentine down here. And then Jill and Vincent can live happily ever after because they have the same name. I guess we take it. I guess we take it. Okay, I thought something was going to happen. Oh, the following inscription is carved into the indentation. Uh, sorry, I've been overlooking my stuff because I've been putting up. Oh, no worries, Anthony. Um, but yeah, you have you have two new emotes because you are tier three, so you get a new tier two and a tier three emote. You don't have patience for slow-paced games. That's one great thing about FromSoft games. You're killing things one minute out of the gate. I love FromSoft games. You forgot how small the inventory was. It's tiny. It's not fair. Okay, what does it say? An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. The flames are dancing wildly. An eye for an eye. But I can't like really do anything here with them. Let's have a look at what we picked up. Book of Curses, lovely, sounds great. Oh, <gasps> wait, is that a key that I can take out? There's a key embedded on the back cover. Will you remove it? Yes. Oh, it's a mansion key. Oh. And we open the Book of Curses. The four masks. A mask that speaks no evil. A mask that smells no evil. A mask that sees no evil. A mask that cannot speak, smell, or see evil. When all four fall into place, evil will awaken. Yep, great. I mean, obviously it's got something to do with these things here, but... <laughs> That's actually where the Resident Evil and Final Fantasy VII universes intersect here. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> the save system in these games is ultimate anti-save scum. <laughs> it's so funny people translate an eye for an eye to a life for a life. Jill and Vincent, what is, what is their story? I wonder. Mm. Lainey would hate the no saves coming. <laughs> Lainey would crush this game like easy mode. Look, so far this game hasn't been too scary. So. wonder how Lainey would go. <laughs> but look, we're only very early on in the game. Okay, so we have, we've got the key, but this key, I feel like it's going to open everything now. Oh, shit, yeah, it's got the, it's got the thing on it. It's got the sword. We needed a key that has a sword emblem so we can open the locks that have a sword emblem on them. 
knew it. I knew it. I knew it. So let's go and open everything. Open all the doors. I'll look all the doors that had the sword symbol on them. Okay, now I'm scared that something's gonna jump out at me. <gasps> Wait, can I open this one around? No, this one's a do not open does not open from this side. It's locked from the other side, so I need to actually I think access that from the other side. Okay. Alright, we're getting somewhere, guys. We're getting somewhere. Welcome back, Miss Bourne. Insert gift of Laney punching you. <laughs> the thing! The thing! I did it! Okay. Now I need to remember which doors. Wait, hang on, does the map? No, it doesn't show me. I think the red ones are just ones that I haven't opened. It's not like... Uh... But wait, there's ones that are grey now as well. I don't know, hang on. We're just gonna, we're gonna trial it out route. <gasps> new room, new, new room. Maybe we should just go, hang on, if I move off that, is that gonna be blue now? It's grey now. That's an armour one. Okay. It's off on the other side. Okay. Alright. Like I don't wanna I don't wanna like explore all the rooms yet. I wanna just um unlock all the doors. I think. I don't think there's any doors on this side, but I think I'll be able to go out if, out here at one point because on the map there's another door like that's too low. I think there's another room in there and I'm guessing I can access it maybe through that. <gasps> another one. Another one. Because once I've unlocked everything, then um, I won't need the key anymore, I guess. I'll have a look in here. I'll have a look. I hope it's not scary. Oh, that'll link it up to that area. Okay. Um. Uh. <sighs> oh, that's a door. That's oh, I lockpicked that. Okay, let's go in. <laughs> oh wait, is the scary thing gonna be in here? No, I think it was in the other room. Oh, I'm like oh wait, hang on, where am I? Where am I? <gasps> ah! I thought, I thought, I thought I could. There'd be something out here. I thought so. The pattern in the center resembles a witch. Uh. Okay. I guess I was wrong on how I came out here. I guess it's kind of like a shortcut in a way. Because I unlocked this door and this one will lead me back into the main room. This is the one that I just tried to open before. Aha! 
There we go. There we go. We unlocked all of that. But I haven't found everything out there yet. Might do more of a look. I wasn't sure if anything was going to jump out and scare me, but there doesn't seem to be anything just yet. Wait, Alex! Alex is here! Hello, Alex. How you doing? The zombie pockets is going to be awesome. <laughs> Imagine like this will be vacant. You could squat in them, go to supermarkets and just take what you want. Running around killing zombies like this just looks like it would be fun. I don't think a zombie apocalypse would be fun. <laughs> no thanks. No thanks. I am just button mashing along here just in case. What about this plant? I don't think I was anywhere near it. Is there anything in this pot here? Anything in the pot? Nothing? Ooh! Some kind of thorny plant you've never seen before. Okay. I wonder if that is no, it's still red in progress i wonder if like finding descriptions like that equals to progress in an area because it's got 100 percent items oh this is items though it must mean items okay okay no that's just the plant one i was trying to see if there's anything on the ground Well, I can't seem to find anything <laughs> just yet. Like there's this one, the stained glass window, but hmm. humanity would be even more doomed than how movies depict it, right? I mean, look how we dealt with a pandemic. I didn't mean to go back in here. That's fine. I feel like I really should save soon because we've done a bunch. We've done a bunch, but I also... Oh no. I don't know if it's just the one. Does she auto-aim? No, I've only got my knife. Shit. <sighs> okay. That's fine. I made it. Uh, am I? Caution. Yep. Okay. I think now there's a plant somewhere that I can use something. Deal is a strong word. <laughs> yeah. The way they spoke of COVID, I was truly expecting to be piles of bodies in the streets. Um, didn't that actually happen though, Scold? I'm pretty sure in some areas of the world there were like bodies around. This 
Uh, he's just chilling there. It's fine. We need to kill him to get past, but he's not chasing me or anything. Is there another one or is that him? Oh. Oh gosh, okay. A save room! <laughs> oh, this feels better in here. Okay. Emma, is, this is your first playthrough and already cheating with aim hacks. <laughs> I, I don't know if she auto aims or not. It was kind of hard to tell. No. Poor Italy got pretty bad. Yeah. I don't know if it was like piles of bodies, but like I think I heard there were some areas in the world where they had bodies around on the streets, maybe. Emma 2021, zombie is scary. Emma 2022, knife only run. <laughs> Let's go watch Mizu. <laughs> I've always been very scared of zombies, so I am proud of myself for playing this. Yay! I'm so glad, Nova. I'm so glad. You were only safe for the next hour, enjoy it, right? In real survival mode, there's no auto aim, right? No spoilers, guys! I need to explore this room myself. Oh, or are you just saying bagel? There's a chest here. <gasps> Fuck yeah! Okay, I was hoping we'd get something like this because I was like, my inventory is so freaking tiny. Can we please like swap things around? That's good. Nice, there's this. And I... Okay, I can store a shit ton of stuff in here. Ah, <sighs> okay. That makes me feel better. First aid spray. <gasps> more of these two. Yes. Well, I might, I could leave them in here. So when I come back and save, if I wanted to. Let's do that. Very good. Um, I don't really need these at the moment because I don't have a shotgun. I don't know if I'm gonna need the rest. Oh my gosh, having a chest that is very helpful. There are several kinds of serum here. Many of them are of a sickly color. A well-used bed. Lovely. Don't think I can use it. Okay, special instructions for the disposal of dead bodies. Lovely. We have new information regarding these beings. They may appear to be dead, but in fact, they are able to come back to life. However, there are ways to prevent them from becoming active again. Currently, there are two known methods to seize their resurrection. Incineration, destruction of the head. If further methods are discovered, you will be notified immediately. Meanwhile, to those of you who still have the will to live, Oil has been placed on the first floor of the mansion. Take as much as you need. Ah, we can burn them. First floor. Okay, I didn't see it anywhere, but I haven't been in every room on the first floor. You'll need something to light it with, which you'll need to find by yourself. Of course. Of course. Oh, I f I'm, I'm happy that we're here. I'm happy that we're here. It's an old typewriter. You can save your progress. Yes! Let's do it. Oh. I don't know if it's worth saving over these ones, but probably. <laughs> I guess we can save over the first one. Medical storage room. Now 
Not to brag, but my Dragoon in Farm Fantasy Fourteen is nearly level 60. Nice. You are, you are welcome to brag here, Light. Drink some tea. I don't like tea. <laughs> Where's the tip on the ground? Chest ahead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you had some tea today. Am I a pyromaniac? I'm not a tea fan. I do like my coffee though. And this is a mocha, so it's even better. It's got chocolate in it too. Mm. So good, Kieran. You made a really good mocha. Okay. <laughs> um, well now I've got some more bullets. I mean, we could try stabbing that zombie to death and see if it works. <laughs> but... Mm. I also don't know if I'm going to need these other things. So I don't know if I should like... Uh, remove them or hold, them, hold on to them now. <laughs> I'm not sure. Coffee is top tier. It's good. Okay, so will that tell me? Yeah, typewriter and item box. Cool. I was hoping that the, the game would tell me that. I was hoping so. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't know if I'm meant to be solving that puzzle up on the this floor yet. I don't know. How did I look around here? I didn't. Ugh. There's nothing but cleaning product inside. It smells faintly unpleasant. The zombie sound is really creepy. Where are you, zombie? Where are you? Where are you? I can hear ya. Oh, maybe he's behind a door. Okay. That's fine. Ugh. Why does it sound like it's... <laughs> it's fine. We just saved before. It's fine. It's fine. You think the zombies sound funny? They do. I don't hear a zombie. So it must be in the other room. <gasps> There's still plenty of kerosene left. Can I take it though? Those, I don't know. Well, it's been a bit. Uh, welcome in, still water. Trout, how you doing? What's this? Battery pack. Fuck yeah, I'll take that. Oh, is that the shotgun? Oh, it's a broken shotgun. Well, I guess we've got to fix it, but we'll take it. We can go put it back in our thingy. Put it in our chest. It's weird that I won't let you take that. What's over here? Oh, yes. Thank oh, that's three of them! Fuck yeah. Okay. Okay. I think that's everything in here. I think so. Hey, Jonathan, how you doing? I feel like I should go and put things away, but... If I die, then I'm gonna have to collect these again anyway. It's locked. I can't get through there. Okay. Good to know. Oh, I found everything in that room anyway, so. That sound, it sounds like there's a zombie, like, sorry, just in that hallway to the left, but obviously it just sounds like it. Wait, that's the safe room. There's a zombie boy up here. Oh, now he's moving. Now he's moving! Run, 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 run. You dead? 
Can't see if you're dead. No, he's not fucking dead. He's not dead. He's not dead. Now there's blood coming out. I think once the blood puddle comes, I don't remember that guy. Wait, no, I think I do. Once the blood puddle comes out, then we're good. All right, I think this was locked. Yeah, helmet. What about here? Where does this go? Oh, this takes me, oh, okay. I think this is a shortcut. Because this takes me into the room with the, yeah, here. All right, I'm going to go pop some things back into the chest, I think. Are you doing good, Jonathan? I'm glad to hear that. Guys, okay, so I've been like scared to try these games and stuff, but honestly, right now, I am actually really enjoying this. I'm really enjoying the game. I thought I would be absolutely terrified, but it's not too scary so far. It's not too scary, and I fucking love puzzle games. So, like, this game is full of puzzles, right? Um, yeah, I'm not like. I'm not too scared to play it, and I'm really, really liking it. They're so good. Have you played, like, all the Resident Evils, King? Just open the burger pickles you recommended. Oh, yeah, we, we got them recently. They're good. I don't know if you prefer them over coals, but good pickles. Okay, I'll have to try them, and I don't want one right now. I don't feel like eating a pickle right now. <laughs> Resident Evil is more puzzle than horror. You see, I always thought they'd be, like, really, um, really scary. <laughs> Because I also, along with being terrified of aliens, I've always been terrified of zombies. Um, yeah. I knew you'd like this game, really? Uh, yeah, it's it's a lot of fun. I'm already enjoying it. I've only played for like, what, a bit over three hours. Yeah, they're not scary games. Yeah, I always thought they were. Resident Evil games are all about puzzles. Well, most of them, not Resident Evil 4. They ruined it. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> You don't do well with scary games either, King. Okay. I just, yeah, I always thought they were going to be terrifying, but I, um, I like the puzzle solving. They taste closer to the Macca's ones. Oh, okay. Dislike Resident Evil 4 with a passion to action orientated, not Resident Evil, like, in my opinion. Oh, okay. I mean... I feel like I'd be willing to try all of them just for the sake of trying them all. <laughs> if I like this one, like, you know, then I'm like, oh, maybe I'll try the others. Um, but I don't know if I'd like it if it's more action or not. Kieran, you might like it if it's action based, but Kieran, Kieran, I don't know if you saw Sweet Beat, Kieran played um, the game Tormented Souls recently. And that one, it's a new game, but it's basically like, it's inspired by old school Resident Evil. And Kieran really liked it. But Kieran, you might like a more action-based one. I don't know. I just learned what, in my opinion, means. I am means. Oh, really? That's why you just like six. Okay. You thought four had a good blend, right? Resident Evil 4 is still a brilliant game. Yeah, I can see, though, like, if you prefer, like, you know, not as much action, how it wouldn't be someone's style of game. Oh damn, I've heard good things. I loved 8 and it was apparently very close to 4. Oh, okay. I'm excited. I, from what I saw of 8, that looks really good. It looks really good. I don't know how I'd go with... I mean, I th I'd be fine with first person, but I tend to prefer games that are third person. I don't know if I need... To, I mean, if I do want to save somewhere else, I guess, but... Because if I come across another save state, although there's probably going to be ribbons if I find a new one. Let's put this away. That leaves me with two slots. I don't think I'm going to... These items are obviously going to be ones that we have to use at some point, but I'm just like... I'm not sure when, so we can always come back for them, I think. I'm not going to bother saving because we haven't done much. 
We killed that zombie guy and we got the shortcut. That was basically it. I need to remember everything that I've done since the save state in case I do die. <laughs> um, okay, so... I can't get through that other room, I don't think. Yeah, so we have a shortcut through to there now. So now for that puzzle, it's like we're much closer. But there might be doors in there that I can open now that I have that other key, so... Let's have a look. Wait, I think I already tried to open it. Yeah, it's locked. <sighs> Resident Evil 4 is where they started trying to do something different, not my jam. Yeah. Not everyone's going to like it. That's fine. I was looking forward to Kieran playing 7 and 8, but now I guess I've got to wait a long time. Wait, why are you waiting a long time? Kieran, I, did you say something else, Kieran, and I missed it? Four is usually ranked as the best. I guess a lot of people like that, more action-based, but I don't know how I'd go with it. You don't think it is, but it's a fan favorite, yeah. The two remake was great. I've heard really good things about the two remake. Starting Resident Evil Heart. Awesome. Love it. Resident Evil 2 Remake will blow your mind after this one. Yes. I will probably be playing that after this. Possibly. Because uh, I'm really enjoying this so far. Also, welcome in Kandra. Hope you're doing well. Um, I think Kieran was going to play. He's going to start at the start now. Oh, wait. Kieran, are you starting at the start? Like, I mean, you... I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'm so far starting at the start, so it's locked from the other. Okay, that's not one that I can open. Possibly, I'm not really watching you play this year, yeah. You probably just see me wandering, wandering around a house and you have no idea what I'm actually doing. <laughs> you might start at seven and come back to one. Yeah, you could do seven and eight, because I think they're connected in a way. And then you could go back and start from one or whatever. You're doing well? I'm glad to hear that. Wait, I've already been through here. Yes. I need to look at my map more before <laughs> going into these rooms. Yeah, this is here. This is here. Okay. There was another section. There's another door that I opened in the main area that I can explore to. You could start anywhere, to be honest, yeah. I've seen that hall full of polums a whole bunch of times. Yep. <laughs> I've walked through there a few times. <laughs> I have. Oh, I found everything in this room now because I unlocked that door. Okay. I get it. Yeah, so that door up the top there that's grayed out, I can go through there. Um... Oh wait, oh I found everything on the top part of this room, but I haven't found everything on the bottom part of that room that's red. Right, maybe I go back down there and have a look. Seven and eight are fantastic. I'm I'm scared to play seven because I've heard seven is quite, is quite scary, but um, I've, I've also heard it's really, really good. And with eight, you, you know, getting really, um, I saw so much about eight when it was like coming up towards the release of it. And um, I mean, it's got vampire mummy lady and I like have to play it right. <laughs> Do you think you'll play through all of them, including Resident Evil Zero and Resident Evil D? Well, Resident Evil D's nuts, is that what you're trying to get at? <laughs> um, I, I know there's quite a few Resident Evil games. I'm not sure what order we should play them in, but I know there's like Resident Evil like zero isn't, yeah, there's zero, I don't know. I mean, I'm enjoying this, so I'm, I'm open to trying the other Resident Evil games for sure. Okay, I think this was the door that I unlocked. Yes, I didn't go in here though. 
Resident Evil 7 is scary, is very scary, but I think you'll love it. Yeah. Mummy Dummy, yeah. <laughs> Resident Evil D's not I I got I know I knew what you were doing. There's also code Veronica, yes. Which you think is between two and three. Okay. Forget zero in my opinion. No way, Zero is definitely worth playing. You know what? Like sometimes people are like, oh, I don't recommend this game or whatever. But if I like a game in a series, I'm just like, I gotta try every single game in this series if I <laughs> if I enjoy one of them. I might start it and be like, nah, I don't like it, but like I mean, for example, with Dark Souls, a lot of people were like, oh, Dark Souls 2 is not that good, like, you know, eh, whatever. Uh, but I was like, I still wanna play it. And I really enjoyed it. Um with the Banjo Kazooie games, I tried Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts, played a few minutes, I was like, no, nope, it's not for me. But I gave it a try. I gave it a try, but it was not my kind of game. <laughs> there doesn't seem to be anything useful here. Hmm. Dark Souls 2 was amazing. I really, I really enjoyed it. There's nothing here but a bunch of knickknacks. Okay. I don't have a map for this floor. Can I? No, it's locked. Armor emblem. What's this? An emblem of armor. Okay, this is all armor. Oh, is that like a shattered? Yeah, the glass has been broken and the picture inside has been removed. Dun dun dun. Uh, Resident Evil games though are quite different. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, even if they're different, it's kind of like, like I said, the Banjo-Kazooie situation. Like, the first two games are very similar, but then the third Banjo-Kazooie, well, it's not even Banjo 3, it's just Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts is, like, a very different game. <laughs> and I tried it, but I was like, eh, nope, nope, I don't want to play this. <laughs> Goes from survival to action and back again, yeah. I think that's how you should do it. Ignore all us poo-pooing on the other <laughs> Resident Evil games. Yeah, I'm like, if I if I like a series, I'm like, I'll give them all a try, but I definitely, you know, don't know if I will play through all of them if I'm like really not enjoying one of them or something. Resident Evil Revelations 1. Uh, two are very underrated in my opinion. Played them recently and enjoyed a lot. Okay. I'm gonna need like a guide on like what the Resident Evil games are. <laughs> like, if there is some type of order that I should play them in or what. Did someone say knickknacks? The game did say knickknacks. Nuts and bolts is so bad. It's so bad. Like, I understand if you like that style of game, then it might be great. But nuts and bolts is just like, it's so different to Banjo, Kazooie and Tui. Like, it's a different game. And I did not like it. Resident Evil games are like Final Fantasy games. Everyone has their fan base, yeah. Yep. What's that? A wooden mount. I was like, maybe that'll help with um the spiky thing, but probably not. It's wood. It'll just break. Okay, there's a door there. There's a door here. Is there anything else on this table that I can... <gasps> you can feel the heat from the light on your skin as you approach. It's locked on the other side. Okay. We can open this door. <gasps> There's something shiny. Okay, this is a little room with a bunch of shiny stuff in it. Okay, I want to... An old-fashioned gramophone. The record is Jupiter. Okay. What's that? Oh, dog whistle? Sure. A crumpled memo. 
<gasps> that's um that's outside near the stained glass window. I would do this Resident Evil, then two, three remake, then straight to eight, which is the latest and maybe greatest entry in my opinion. <laughs> you see, I want to leave like the best one till last, you know. And isn't seven connected to eight? You're still salty about Dark Souls 2. <laughs> Anthony, I think you're going to be constant, like you're just going to be salty about it forever. I hope not. I hope you get less salty about it when you replay it. <laughs> But also, you're allowed to be salty about it. That's fine. Seven is directly connected to eight. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, today, Sir Spencer told me to hide something where no one could find it. Well, I had this idea. I figured if I could somehow have it protected by a dangerous animal, like the vicious canine that lives here, no one would be able to get near it. As far as I can tell, the mutt is always hanging around the second floor balcony on the west side of the terrace, and he ought to come running at the sound of a dog whistle. Okay. Second floor balcony, west side, and it's near that, I'm guessing it's near that stained glass window. Well, we blow the dog whistle. This is where you come in. The thing is, I reckon you're the only person that can get near that damn dog without risking a serious mauling. Which means only you can put this collar on him. The object that Sir Spencer wants hidden is concealed inside. You're the only person I can trust with this. Of course, you'll get something out of it as well. Remember that certain item that you've always wanted to get hold of? Oh, my foot is itchy. Foot, why are you being itchy? It's really annoying. Well, in exchange for your services, I just might be able to get it for you. This could work out well for both of us. John Tolman. Okay, so there's gonna be an item on the dog's collar. Hmm. I will definitely take the handgun magazine, thank you. There's chess. A chess board carved from ivory. The game appears to have ended in a checkmate. Okay. An open journal. The pages are blank. Books on various peoples of the earth. Okay, where are we? We... yeah, we can go through here. You wanna watch Emma play Resident Evil 7? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> fuck, 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 fuck. Wait, why did that? Why do I, wait, wait, when did I get a stun gun? I'm confused. And why did that bullet, like it fucking went, it like, Destroy that! It just... I destroyed its head. Okay. Um... <laughs> for that reason right there. Uh, as I was saying, I will probably... I We might get to seven at some point. You couldn't get into seven, don't know why, but you loved eight. Yeah, well, maybe now that you've played eight, you could go back to seven and see if you could try to get into it. You loved eight more than seven. Seven was my first and it was, and it's what got you hooked on the series, yeah. Chess puzzle, yeah. <laughs> no zombie, no, bad zombie. <laughs> the first night I played it, I had to turn all the lights on in my house afterwards, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> When people who are scared of scary games play them, it's super entertaining. As long as you want to do that, it is yeah. <laughs> like I get, I get scared quite easily. Um, but I'm definitely, 
more open to this game now. I on guys, honestly, like Dark Souls got me used to more scary games. Not that Dark Souls is really scary, but when I first played Dark Souls, Dark Souls, I was terrified. But I got over that feeling, and then I loved it. Resident Evil 69. <laughs> These shifting camera angles are so disorientating. And it's even more confusing when I'm holding the controller in one way and then I, it changes the camera angle so then I've got to move my control stick in a different way. I'll have to start Resident Evil 7 on a Friday or during my B-Day stream so I can play it hella late and get spooks. Yeah, you could play that on your birthday. Resident Evil Marathon for Halloween. I mean, Skull, that's kind of what's happening. <laughs> I'm. Uh, this is why we're starting early and honestly guys, we might We'll probably end up playing more spooky games after Halloween if I'm enjoying them so much. By the way, you have my full attention now. My fingers hurt from trying to color in emotes with a laptop mouse. Oof. Using a mouse for any type of art on a computer. I mean, some art, it's fine. If it's like graphic design, it's fine. But if it's like what you're trying to do, Anthony, it is not easy. The Forest in Dark Souls one was eerie as hell. Yes, it was. You remember getting so lost in Dark Souls 1, literally was obsessed with it. Oh, it's so good. Uh, Scold, I'm actually going to be doing, probably soon actually, I'm going to do a magic run in Dark Souls 1 because I've never done one. I've only played the game once um, and I really want to do a magic run. So I'm probably going to be doing that soon. Okay. So I entered from this door, was it? Yes. And this door, I just unlocked it. Oh, that's like a little shortcut. Okay, this goes back to that other, just checking, that other area. Yeah, so we don't have to go to the other room to get through here. Mm. And we should do a miracle only run. Imagine only using miracles to beat Dark Souls. <laughs> I don't know the differences with the different types of magic in Dark Souls 1, so I'm going to have to look up and see what I want to do. Um, I'm not sure. Magic builds are for Dark Souls 2. Okay. I might do another Dark Souls 2 run as well, doing magic. But no Resident Evil scared me more than The Evil Within. I literally have playing it mid-game. Don't call me pussy. Mm -hmm. um, evil Within is scary. I did not like getting... I, I played the tiniest bit of that game. And I did not like getting chased. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if we keep going this way... There must be a zombie down there. Maybe... I want to keep going this way. I think, yeah, it's locked. Armor. A picture of a woman being menaced. Okay, I think this might lead me out onto a balcony, maybe. Your pointer finger really hurts. I just hope they're a little... I just hope people are a little happy with your Halloween emotes. Yeah. The one boss in Evil Within always freaks you out. I assume it goes without saying, but everyone is hyped for Elden Ring, right? Yes. <laughs> you are correct. I'm so hyped for Elden Ring. Okay, maybe this doesn't... Oh, some alcohol? An omelette fireplace. Oh, that's like a map of the place. Up there. I see some books down here. See, there's books. A picture of a partly built mansion. It looks an awful lot like the one you're in now. Yeah, I think they've got lots, lots of art around of their mansion. The dark forest stretches as far as your eye can see. There don't seem to be any houses in the area. 
I can't see what's in my way here. I think it must just be chairs, but it's kind of hard to tell. So we've got these herbs here that you're going to probably heal me, which I might, might be a good idea to take one actually because it says caution. Um, I don't know what the red herb does. Does it tell me? No. I wonder if the description of this herb tells me more. No, it just says that. If I use that now I say now it says I'm fine. Okay. I kind of want to take this other one and see if I can um see if the description tells me anything. No. It obviously must do something else though. Okay. Um, I guess we'll go through this door if we can. It's locked. Okay. I think a lot of the doors on this side are all... I will need the helmet one. I'm the worst person to ask if something is scary. I always just say it's not too bad. <laughs> Uh, how scary is evil within? It's on the poll list we've able to vote on. I only played a little bit, so, and this was like a year ago. Um, I probably better handle the game better now. But, and it's hard to say as well, like everybody obviously has different tolerances for how scary something is. It's got some good scary bits. Uh, welcome in Harry, but please, no spoilers. Um, that is kind of like a foreshadowing because I do not have a I do not have that item, but now I know that it's probably something that I want to get, but I did not know that. So, um, just please be careful if it's like, Hey, do you have X thing yet? Have you found this yet? Cause if I haven't found it, then it's giving it away. Um, Catacombs is another scary area in Dark Souls 1. Yes. And in 3. Looks like there's like a... I think there's a hole in the glass there. Where am I going? Because like... Oh, there's down the stairs. We can go down here. I think there's going to be a zombie down here though. Yep. Zombie friend. I got lots of bullets though. Can't fucking see though. Oh my god, Jill, please. Other way. Okay, I think that's dead dead. Cause he got back up and I think, yeah, so either when they fall down, I shoot them on the ground and then that's it. Or if they get back up, I think the other shot will like actually kill them. Okay, we're fine, we survived. I don't think- I, I haven't had a zombie kill me yet. I've only had... Uh, the spiky thing kill me. Oh. I mean, I have the space for it. I'm not gonna take it yet, though.
Okay. Oh, it looks like I can actually maybe... I think the door, the one that's just like this section here and it goes along, I think maybe if I can go through there, I can unlock. I think I could open that one from the other side, maybe. I don't remember for sure. There's a little room in here as well. So let's check this out if it's open. It is open. Dragoon, thank you for the luck. Hope you're enjoying your first Resident Evil game. I am. I actually am enjoying it. I thought I would be terrified, but it's only a little scary and I'm enjoying the puzzle solving. Have you found the Moonlight Greatsword yet? <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> oh my god, spoilers. <laughs> Have you found yourself? I think so. Okay, so I can't seem to pick up. Oh. I got a save point around here. Um, not yet. How many do I have? I got three with me. Glad I, glad I brought them with me. Let's take this stuff. Oh, and there's a chest in here. Wait, they're probably not going to be connected. Oh, wait. Okay, I have, I have a pink lemonade. I'm. I, this is pretty obvious, but the chests are connected. Yes, because I've got all my items in here. That's amazing. I was going to be like, shit. There's going to be multiple chests, and I'm going to have to go back between them. I've. Feel happy that in modern games we can reload without going into your inventory. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's so good. That's so good. Let's put this wooden mount in here because I don't know what that's for. Uh, the dog whistle we've got to try out. Uh, this plant. I guess I could go grab the other herbs now and put them in here too because I didn't want to grab them just in case. What's this? Alcohol? Fuel, oh, I was gonna say fuel. Fuel canteen. Yes, I will take that. Thank you. Let's put that in here too. I can store so much stuff in here. This is great. Let's go back and get the other ones. That way they're all in here. So that if I'm like, shit, where are my health items? If I need to, I can just come back to the, the safe zone. I don't think you should drink fuel. Yeah, I'm, I don't think I should drink it either. <laughs> That's a good thing about chest. I didn't, I was gonna, I, I did not think it was going to link up. Where was the other? Wait, have I been here? I haven't been this way. I just want to find the other health item because there was another one around here. Maybe it was back in here. There's no knob on this door. You can't go through. Wait. Oh, I thought I... Maybe I came from here. They don't in real survive mode. Ah, that makes sense. Because there are diff there's obviously the difficulty levels in this game. Wait, had I been in here yet? Yes, this is this room. Uh, I forget where it is. But there's definitely, I haven't found everything in here. Because the room is still red. Hmm. 
Hmm. I just want the I just want the health item. <laughs> Nob. Oh, okay, that's where that's where I did come from, but I can't go back through that room. Okay, that makes sense. Um maybe it was down the stairs. Oh, I think I already tried this. Wait, no, I didn't want to go in here. I still need to go back and save. Oh, wait, <gasps> this was the room. Okay, cool. We're fine, guys. We're fine. We're fine. Now, yeah, now it's green. And I can't get through there. Cool. I forgot that I'd already been in here. Nice. Now we can go back and save. <gasps> Jamie! Welcome in. How are we doing? Um, Light, you said you're going to sleep. No worries. Have a good sleep. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, welcome in. Sorry, I'm going to put my follower lots back on because we had some hoss. Hosses in chat earlier. Hosses is following earlier. Um, welcome in, Jeff, and who threw that? <laughs> who threw that? Nice. <laughs> Swishy. What were you playing? Oh, you're playing Untitled Goose Game? That game is so good. Grat, welcome in. Tuxedo. Katan. Oh, Jeff. Thank you for gifting a sub to Jammy. Jammy, enjoy your sub badge. Spooky emotes, guys. We have spooky emotes from today. Um, and ad free viewing. Thank you, Jeff. Much appreciated. How are you enjoying the goose game? Have you played it? I mean, is it a first playthrough? It's so good to see you too. Um, welcome in, everyone. Uh, if you're new here, I'm Emma. I am an Aussie variety streamer. And I'm playing my very first Resident Evil game, Resident Evil 1. I was kind of terrified to play this, but I'm really enjoying it. It's a lot of fun and I love solving puzzles. So we, and we have a lot of puzzles in these games. Hotspots attacked a lot of streams today, right. So it wasn't just me. I was getting like, and it was weird though. Um, is it Grogru? Grogru? Like Grogu, but Grogru. Um, it felt like the, someone, the person doing was watching my streams because I was like, when I would talk about it, they would keep doing it. And then when I finally hid my follow alerts and I had my little follower goal over there, but I removed that, um, they stopped doing it. So I don't know, must've been a today thing. Jam was goose and last I saw, <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh wait, you finished it today. <gasps> nice, my alerts just shut down when they followed actually. Oh really, huh? Yeah, I just like, I was like, uh, I just like turned them off for a bit. Um, but thank you for those of you that followed that were not a hotspot. <laughs> Herds of hosses, they're everywhere. Yeah. It was weird though, because I haven't had a follow from them in a little while. And it, then it was just like today. I was like, oh, this is odd. Grow grew like the word group. Yeah, so grow group. Is it just grow grew? But without the P. My let's just quite going off to quit going off too. Oh, that's weird. Maybe like, maybe they were following so many accounts. It like, just like messed up with the alerts. Huh? I use, I use stream elements for mine. So I don't know if you guys were using that too or what. It's so weird. Yes. Okay. It's so weird and so annoying. Um, but they seem to have stopped for now, so that's good. I've just ended up removing the follower name from my follow alerts at this point. Yeah, Gratch, I have had mine like that for probably over a year now. So before I even, like before the, you know, the hotspots were a thing and everything, sometimes I would get like troll usernames following me and I was just like, eh. I just have a little like thanks for following thing that pops up and it doesn't say the username and I don't even read out usernames when they follow. I just say like thanks. 
and um, just leave it at that. You were thinking of removing the follower names too? Yeah, I've had it like that for ages now. And I think also it kind of helps. I think, I don't know, some people, some people who follow maybe don't want their name read out either. So I was like, it helps those people too. Is this the Resident Evil game that was originally on GameCube? I have no idea, Katarn. <laughs> I don't know um, much about the history of Resident Evil games. I don't know. I gotta head off to bed, but I'm happy I could see you. I look forward to catching your streams. No worries, Jamie. Thank you for the raid. I hope you have a good sleep and we'll catch you soon. Uh, thank you for that follow. As you guys would have seen, it just like popped up saying thanks for the follow. That's just how I do it. The remake was originally on GameCube. Oh, okay. For PS1, they remade for GameCube. Right. Thank you for the follow. Yeah, five out of the six streams you're watching got host follows pretty much all at the same time. Yeah, it must have been at the same time as me too. Uh, welcome in, War and Peace. <laughs> welcome in, welcome in. No worries, it's fine. Did you already play the original 96 version? No, this is, this is my first ever Resident Evil. I haven't played the original version of it. I figured just... There's probably not much point in playing the original over the remake. I don't know. But I'm enjoying it. It's a lot of fun. The GameCube was a surprisingly a surprisingly powerful little system. The GameCube was so good. I love the little the little discs. I wish I never I think we I don't know if I traded in when I was younger or what, but I had a GameCube and it was a lot of fun. Okay, I what am I doing? I'm heading to the safe zone because we found a We want to go down there, so we want to go down the stairs. Cool. Because I haven't saved yet, but I wanted to like make sure that I'd gotten certain items and things before I progress, just in case. Is it in here? Yes, it is. Warren Peace, underrated pun name. Warren Peace. War is it war and peace? War and peace. Hotspots act like those stalker clowns with a creepy smile. <laughs> They're so annoying. Just like stop it. Okay, chest. We'll put some things in here. We can put our health items in. So I don't need them right now. We also need to test out the dog whistle on the balcony. Fuel canteen has nothing. Oh shit! I can use the. F I just realized, I can use the fuel canteen. I can fill it up. I think. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Maybe now, maybe I just interact with it. Ah <gasps> yeah. And it was telling me how much is in there. I'm sure that will run out eventually. Yeah, okay, okay. Cool, cool. I figured it out. Let's um still pop this away. Okay, now we can save. Now we can save. I feel like I'm at a good moment to save. Yes. Okay. We'll do it over this one. I'll have two saves going just in case. East Wing Storeroom. Or is it War and Piss? <laughs> You've played more of the Silent Hill games than Resident Evil, right? I've, um,. I don't know anything about the Silent Hill games, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, welcome in Zen, how you doing? The original and the remake are both excellent video games. Okay. Sweet me, thank you for the stretch. We'll do this before we move along. There's some more areas we can explore down here. I still have my GameCube. Maybe I need to track a copy down. That's cool that you still have your GameCube. 
Thank you for the Hydrate King. I will do that before we move along. I feel like I'm getting somewhere in the game though. <laughs> That's good. I feel like we're getting somewhere. I still haven't seen the guy that I um was in this, entered the house with. Obviously we don't know where Chris is. But there was another guy that I was with and he went off to explore, but I have no idea where he is. Hang on. I can't progress anywhere up there. There is that room that's kind of to the left of where I am that I couldn't seem to find anything else in there. So I think we want to go downstairs and have a look down here. Chris is in New Zealand. Not that Chris. Okay, this is the way to go. Ooh, that painting looks kind of familiar. Picture of a woman praying in front of a large crowd. The doorknob looks like it's ready to fall apart. Oh no, am I not gonna be able to get back through here? Ugh, let's go through anyway. <laughs> I'm probably not going to be able to get back through, but that's fine. We just saved before this. Thank you for the follow. The door's fine. I think. I am here. Yes. <laughs> okay. I guess if we go through here, we might get this shortcut to the... the main area. What's this? A picture of a knight mounted on a horse. There's a door in there. It's a little room. Can we enter? The little rooms tend to be relatively safe, I've noticed. It's very echoey in here. It's very echoey. Can I get the shot of like from above again? I don't think so. Okay. Is this the door that I <laughs> want to go through? Let's try it. <gasps> There's more safe thingies. There are traces of something burnt here. An acrid smell permeates the air. I'm not sure what acrid means. What does acrid mean, guys? Picture stands and bronze statues. There's nothing of interest here. Oh, nice. Will the dagger? The dagger must, oh. Oh, I can swap between them. Right. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. Good to know. A well-polished silver pitcher. And we have some save, some save tape, save ribbon, I should say, not tape. <laughs> oh, and that all just piles up in the one spot. Cool. Okay. This was a good room to check out. Decay, sour, ah, okay. I guess the dictionary says it, acrid means bitter, strong, right. Oh! <gasps> this is a working shotgun. I think this is like just a, this room doesn't go anywhere else. Can we sit down for a rest? I don't think so, but that was good. Did I find everything in here? Yes. Bitter and acidic, sort of like the smell of burning wires. Oh, fuck off. No, 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 no. Something's happening. Oh, shit. 
Get the fuck out, Jill! Don't stand there! Oh god. What did I do now? Okay, that's actually like a cutscene. Wesker! Barry! Help! Jill, oh, our friend's here! There? Barry? Get me out of here! The door's jammed! Stand back! Get me out! Pull me out! Okay. So you just try to- I just had to try to open both doors and then that the cutscene happened. Cool. Well, he's still alive. I wasn't sure what happened to him. Barry. That was a close one. A second late, you would have fit nicely into a sandwich. Really? Thanks. Mm -hmm. But Barry, didn't you say you were going back to the dining room to find other clues? I'm glad and all, but why are you here? I just had something I wanted to check. Anyway, we should get back to searching for Wesker and Chris. Thanks, Barry. I owe you one. Don't mention it. He was kind of acting a little bit suspicious there. Something weird's going on there. What a great guy. Save Jill using Barry. <laughs> what a great guy. Jill sandwich. <laughs> that line is so much better than the original. Oh, really? Okay, well, um, we got some more save stuff. And, uh, yeah. Cool. I think, hang on. I think I tried to open that other door. Actually, I don't know if I did, but I want to go this way because I want to see if I can unlock a shortcut. Hang on, where are we? <laughs> yeah, I just want to see if I can go through and get to like this corridor here. <sighs> OG had voice acting, if you could consider that, that voice acting, it was awful, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't hear any zombies. I don't want to go in that door just yet. Oh gosh. I picture up the match and it gets the setting sun. This is what I think I want to go through. <sighs> yes, this is where I want it to be. <gasps> My God, dog. I think it's dead. It's a pool of blood. Well, glad I had that item on me. <sighs> the original says, that was close, you were almost a Jill sandwich, right? <laughs> you remember the live action cutscene in the original that was so amazing at the time? Yeah. Good doggy. No. Oh, I can push that. I just want to get the shortcut here, guys. See where it is? There's nothing here but a bunch of ornamental plates. Fuck, 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 fuck. Stressful music just stopped. Are you dead, dog? I think it's dead. Huh. Okay. This is where I wanted to go this whole time. Okay. 
if we open this, then this links us all the way around. There we go. There we go. I feel like I probably want to save soon. Why does it sound extra eerie? <sighs> okay. Oh, that door. See the door up there with a the little X on it? That's the one where, um, I guess you can't go back in there now because it's like the whole room is like crushed. Okay. I feel like I want to go back and save after that. <gasps> I just don't know. I'm like, I don't know how risky or how careful I should be with saves. Don't tell me. I'm just like, let's go and explore this other area though. Rip headphone users. <laughs> On that note, it's almost 1am and my old butt needs sleep. You guys have a wonderful time. No worries, King. Have a good sleep. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, hopefully the times will get better soon when we have daylight savings. Streams will be a bit, bit earlier for you. Uh, welcome in... Is it Rim? Still at it? Cool. Yeah. It's me. I'm headphone users. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. That's what happens when I play games with some jump scares. Various sculptures and bits of pottery. Can I push this? There's definitely these ones. There was some that I could push. Like, hang on. Is there going to be like something behind here? <gasps> ah, nice. An extra, extra. Is it defensive item? Is that what it's called? Yes. I thought there'd be something there. A picture of the mansion suspended in darkness. Now it just sounds very eerie. Can I push this one please? No, this one I can't push. You can tell that the, the graphics look different for the ones that you can actually push. Oh, that was weird. Maybe we've got to push it the other way? Aha! <gasps> nice! I will take that, thank you. Now I've got 30 bullets. Fuck yes. I feel like I should also maybe go on the balcony and do the dog whistle thingy. But also, like, I still want to explore around here, too. There's a bunch of areas around here that I haven't been. No daylight savings for me, so it's not, so it's so nice having to think about it. Yeah, well, that means the time will be different, though, between a stream's drive, won't it? Will you be... Wait, will we be an hour before or after you? What kind of mic is Emma using? Anyone know? I use a blue Yeti. Yeah, oh, Anthony got it there. <laughs> um, I've had this mic for literally years. I Back when I used to do YouTube, I actually had it for YouTube stuff. Um, and then when I got into streaming, I was like, sweet, I've already got a good mic. We voted to remove DST in 2018, but they haven't done it yet? Oh, wait, did it like... I'm guessing it got voted that it was most people voted to remove it. I think a lot of people um don't like daylight savings. Don't we do this every year and it just leaves us even more confused in the end? Yep. <laughs> you start at 9am for me in DST. Yeah. Okay. So you guys are like an hour behind. It passed. Okay, but the people in charge is dragging their feet. Right. Thank you, Kieran. That is my gaming channel. If you guys wanna wanna watch. Alright, let's go back through this way. I think I'm gonna go save. 
because we've had a couple of events happen since we saved. We had the squishy room, we had the dogs. This is very up close. Uh, where was it? Where was it? Where was it? I've got to go through here and around. You know, because Kieran told you, and it's the same mic that you have. Yeah, yeah. I know a lot of people use it. Um, like, I still needed to add, like, um, filters and things to the mic to make it sound even better. Um, but it definitely is one of the easier ones to use. I don't remember there being a zombie around there. Maybe I haven't gone around that way. You had to shoot doggos? I did. I did. Oh yeah, we go around here. Cool. <sighs> it's a good little mic. It is. It is. Like it's not like the absolute best out there, but it's like decent price for what you get and ease of use. You need to get a new mic and or headset, yeah. Actually, hospitalizations, accidents increased by a significant amount after the time change every year. Oh, really? Huh. That's interesting. She just pretended they were only burned and then had no issues shooting them. One dog caught me, but then I had to use my other item and then the other one I had perfect shots on. <laughs> Once you learn how to use it, Anthony, yeah, yeah, it takes a little bit. Um, scold, I am not, your comment got caught, but I am not allowing that because we don't use that word here. It is not a nice word. I also don't know who you were talking to because you added yourself. <laughs> um, wait, I've got a broken... I wonder if I can use the broken shotgun for something or maybe I can fix it, but... I mean, I have this shotgun, so... We really are running out of space. I might put the other shotgun away. Cause I got my other gun and I got 30. What are they called? Magazines. So that should be fine. Already saved, that's okay. If I die, I just need to remember to do that. I think I, I do have some of my um, mocha left. It's gonna be cold now, but it's still gonna be tasty. They got very cold. <laughs> you guys spreading misinformation about Onion Bro and what happened there? At least we have the true one. Which is Onion. Okay, all right. Um, where do we want to look? Where haven't I been? So there's a little room to kind of the left of me and there's upstairs as well. But I think I want to look, there's a room up there that looks like there's like maybe a balcony outside too. Let's have a look there first. I don't know if I'll be able to actually go in there. Um, Kieran, if you enjoy Tormented Souls, I think you'll really like this, by the way. 
I wonder if I can only go through here a certain amount of times. Shit. I didn't think about that. We're still good. We're still fine. That should be changed to unfortunately this happened because Emma's cruelty knows no bounds. Kieran likes tormented butts. <laughs> um I need to constantly look at this map because my sense of direction is just gets messed up because of the camera angle changes all the time. I'm just like, where am I? What what am I doing? We want to go into this door. You give me a hard time about it, but you got to give her story events and be fair. But I believe the true onion command. <laughs> Thank you for that follow. Welcome in. Oh, this is a creepy bathroom. Okay. By end of the game, it'll be muscle memory. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully. Um, guys, I had an amazing idea. I told Kieran about this idea about if I ever do like proper like merch, like shirts and stuff. I had an idea that is um. Souls game related. Ugh. Why is it full? It looks like the water still works. Can I use the water? Are you gonna let me? Wait, that's where I came from. Okay. Shall we take a bath? <laughs> it's full of dirty water. Remove the plug? Okay, let's do it. Oh no, something's gonna happen. We're getting a cutscene. We're gonna see something behind us! I oh, there's something in there. Shit. Get your gun out. Get your gun out, please. Please shoot. What are you doing? Girl. Oh, is she just. Okay, she killed him. I don't need to do anything. Sweet. Cool. I don't need to do anything there. Someday I want to see a horror game with a clean bathroom. <laughs> it doesn't look like it's been serviced in a while. It's probably icky. Oh, nice. Is that just like, hopefully that just stacks up. Yeah, my defensive items. Sweet. I guess it was just about finding that, really. I don't think there's anything else in here. I'm trying to think out of my items that I have. I'm just like, is there anything that I could use? And even in like my in the chest I have, I don't think so. Poor Jill, yeah. This is the one that makes her puke, not the others. <laughs> you just puked into a Jill, yeah. I mean, there's probably other icky stuff in there too, but like she just added to it. What? Also, why did she run for the toilet and didn't she didn't just throw up in the sink that is literally right behind her? Anyway, I think that room was mainly just giving me that extra defensive item. Okay. Um. Oh, that's a balcony here, I think. I use the lock pick. All right. Hey, Soul Ripper, how you doing? Yeah, I think this is gonna take us to another balcony. I feel like I can hear something walking. Uh, uh, puppy. No. Will you take the chemical to use on plants? Sure. Oh shit. 
There's so many plants around here. Okay, I might just leave them all here. Because, like, I don't need to pick them up. Look at the puppy. He looks so friendly, right? <laughs> hey, Rika, which Resident Evil do you like more? Uh, this is the only one that I've played, so... This is my only experience. Liam! <laughs> Welcome in. Thank you for the raid. How you doing? What were you what were you playing today? <gasps> were you actually playing Sekiro? You actually playing Sekiro? <gasps> That's so exciting! <laughs> Welcome in Liam and Dressian. And Fiticus, hello! Can we also get a uh, shout out for Fiticus as well? Another lovely team member. How did it go? Did you, did you start? You started again? What did you get up to? He was raging at Sekiro. <laughs> uh, look, I don't blame him. It's a, it, it's a game where that can happen. <laughs> You tried playing when it came out and you didn't get too far. I remember, I remember you saying that, like you said you tried it, but you weren't really, like you weren't really into it. Um, I hope you can stick with it this time though. I do hope so. Like it, it does, once you get that learning curve done, like it's better. It's very good that you started with the first. I suggest next Resident Evil game should be Resident Evil Zero. Okay. I'll, um, have to keep that in mind. I, or it might be this one or maybe the 2 remake. I'm not sure. Uh, thank you, Kieran. Thank you. <laughs> You've got to the dude with the spear in Hirata Estate. Dude with a spear in Hirata Estate. Oh, yes. Yes. He's like a mini boss. Well, a Liam Rage is like dropped eyebrows and casual flip of a controller. <laughs> it's all been pretty much what I remember and I've been having fun. Yay, I'm glad you're enjoying it. Just after you get that. Yes, yes, yes. Should I be Hunter? Ancient of Misen, yes. Um, I'm so glad that you're, um, that you're getting back into it. It's so good. Um, I, so depending on what ending you choose, um, there's certain bosses that, you can miss. So I actually, when I finished it, I did New Game Plus and did a different ending with some different bosses. And um, yeah, it's so much fun. It's so much fun. Uh, but if anyone is new here, I'm Emma. I am an Aussie variety streamer. And uh, this is my first ever Resident Evil game. I've never played any of the others and I'm not getting too scared and I'm really enjoying it. It's really fun. Some of the mini bosses so far I've beaten first or second go when last time they took forever. Oh, nice. Hey, you see, you've already gotten better. You've already gotten better at it. That's good. Yeah, I'm just going to, I'm going to leave all the healing items out here and try to remember that they're here because I don't want to have to carry them all inside and they don't stack up like the, like other items do. Okay, where do we want to go? Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. There. I wish I had a cursor on here so I could point to where I'm talking about. Um, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Um, to the left of the typewriter item box closest to me is where I think I'm going to go. This way, I think, yeah, these camera angles are confusing. I think we go through these doors, yep, and then we keep going. I might check out that little room. Check out the little room. Sorry to rate and run, I need to eat, so I'm gonna lurk while I eat and try to sort out some streamings. No worries, Liam, all good. Do what you gotta do, go and like just chill after a stream. I know how it is. I hope you have a tasty lunch and that the stream stuff goes well. Thank you for the raid again. 
Okay, um... <laughs> Ah, shit, 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 shit. Okay, there's, there's a guy there. There's a guy there. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I was, I was too close. Okay. I think he's dead, dead now. Cool. <sighs> Not too bad. Not too bad. Still haven't died to a zombie yet. <laughs> Your alert stopped alerting, so I want to sort that out. Actually, funny you say that, Liam. Um, I had another streamer come in and say the same thing. I got raided earlier, and they also said their alerts weren't working, and someone else said it too. Um, so I think it might just maybe whichever alerts thingy you use. It could be a stream labs, labs thing. I use stream elements, and mine have been fine. But I, I didn't get... Bot raided, but I had a bunch of bot follows too. She turned on the host bots. I think I think it must be a thing that has happened to like everyone in the last couple of hours or something. Yeah, I had a shit ton of them come through, and it was really annoying. My alerts have been working, so it could be that if you use Stream Labs, maybe they got like overloaded with follows or something, and it just kind of broke broke them. The camera angles on this look interesting. <laughs> they get really confusing because it would it would just change and then I'm like, shit, where am I going? <laughs> Definitely something to get used to. I wonder if it's hitting a threshold. Yeah, I think it must be something like that. Okay, I think this is the room that I want to see if it opens. <laughs> it's locked. The Spencer family emblem is carved into the doorknob. It's like a lion. Okay. Okay. I wonder if I can go in there. I think I can... It looks like this is going to take me outside, actually. I'll look around and see, that, uh, see if that's what it is. Yeah, no worries. All good. Hopefully that's it and you don't actually have to do anything yourself to fix it. We are outside. So this is going to lead me like somewhere else. I don't know if I want to go out here yet. Jamie had problems with her lots tonight. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Hip hiccup count. Yes, we do have one here. <laughs> I have some other streamer friends that have them too. And they, one streamer friend, he, do you guys remember how many hiccups he's got on his thing? It's like, is it like, it's more than a thousand. I think it's like a 10, it's like 10,000 or something. Like it's a lot. Crash. Yeah, crash live. Is it over 13,000? Holy shit. <laughs> My other our other streamer friend, Lainey, I think hers is over 1,000. But like, Crashes is like, <laughs> very high. I was like, I can hear something, but I think it's just me. <gasps> shit! I don't know what to press to, to do the thing. No! Oh. <sighs> Puppy, stop it! At least I got plenty of those knives. Wait, it's not dead? Oh my god. <sighs> well, am I hurt? Caution! Great! I guess I should be careful of the dogs when I go outside. I've got plenty of bullets though. That's annoying though that I used the defensive item and it didn't actually kill them. What is this? There's something written in the indentation. 
the defiler of the accursed coffin. Okay, I don't know if I can go in here or if I want to go in here. It's locked, we can't. Okay, well at least we killed the dog around here. I guess that's something. He adds fits throughout the stream and his mods will get each one. Yeah, yeah. Oh no, a bad dog. Yeah, the dogs are scary. I think she must be doing that because she's hurt. I might go, although it's so far away. There's plants outside. <laughs> it's not too far, it's not too far. And there's no enemies along the way, so. Probably should heal. Probably a good idea. Just we have these confusing camera angles. Wait, this is the bathroom. We don't want to go into the bathroom. We want to go... I think this is this door definitely looks different and it looks like a, a door that might go to outside. Yes. All right. Wait, good. Please take that and uh, let's go and use that. I don't know what, hang on, I, let's examine this one. I haven't examined it yet. There's nothing unusual. Oh, so I can actually, I can check certain sides of an item. Oh, one of the, the bot follows his back. A chemical agent to destroy plant growth. Okay. We might need that at some point. Let's use this though. Okay, we're back to caution. Let's pick up an- <gasps> Fuck! What the fuck? I went out here before already. Oh my god, seriously. I don't know which button it is, I'm just literally mashing all buttons. Dog was hungry. Yeah. That was annoying. I'd already been out there and I was like, we're safe if we got here again, right? Hmm. 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 Welcome in, allegory. Evan Star. Uh, we are just getting bot followed at the moment. There are a shit ton coming through. That's why my alerts are off. Should have carried around some schmeckos. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um. Here, and I don't know if any of my mods have the uh, mod view up or not. <sighs> There's a bunch coming through. Uh, getting bot followed. There's a there's a shit ton coming through.
There's probably some people in chat thinking, what the fuck am I talking about? Probably. <laughs> Ignore it, keep playing. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I'm just grabbing my mouse because fuck trying to highlight that many names. With yeah, the track yeah. Pad. Any after, obviously, these ones up after that one. Yeah, cool. Hopefully, that'll stop soon. Happy that another channel you're watching. Okay, they must just be going through and doing it for channels that are live, or even you guys, if you're offline, they might even be doing it there. But we turn off the follow alerts. Uh, I'm glad I have my follow alerts separate to my other ones. So if you guys sub and stuff, that'll still come up. It's just the follow ones that I've turned off for now. So, okay, so the last one was a minute ago. Hopefully that's stopped. Load, okay. <sighs> I can't remember what I... What I've done. Since. Fight your fears and survive. Please no tips, Harry. I do not want any unrequested help. There's definitely areas though that I'm just like, oh, I don't really need to... Uh... I think I need to go back to the bathroom. But the bathroom scene was pretty easy because I didn't actually, I didn't have to do anything, I just interacted with it. Why did that not work when I did it? I think I have it set for everyone. Let me... Let me check. I think so, I didn't, I don't think I set a limit for it. Um, if anyone's following me that is legitimate, thank you. Most of them are bots, but... There was a, leg leg a legitimate looking one that came in there. Yes, thank you. <laughs> we just have the alerts off at the moment, cause... People are annoying. Thank you for that, Kieran. Um, let's have a look. Not there. My map. Well, that was my first death to an enemy. I think. But it was a, it was a dog, not a, a human zombie. <laughs> Uh, I think I want to check out the inside of the house before we go back to those other areas. Um. Yes. Got to scoot, but enjoy the rest of the Resident Evil. No worries, Fidicus. Thanks for joining with the raid. You have a good rest of your day. Um, is this where I wanted to go? Yes. Yeah, it's fine. We'll go through. The, the door handle hasn't broken yet. <laughs> Hasn't broken yet. Death by murder pup, yep. I think, oh, I've already, I tried to open this before, but then it tells you it's got the emblem on there. Let's check out this area. Oh, it's locked. Armor emblem. <gasps> What the fuck? I forgot about you. I forgot about you. I forgot about you. I forgot about you. No, I fucking what? Oh my god, I'm gonna have to reload. I don't want to fucking use up all my stuff. Ah, uh, now I'm out of those items. I actually might just reload. <laughs> Um, didn't want to use them. Dogs in every game are a nightmare, obviously. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 
I mean, look, not every game, but in a lot of games. <laughs> Can I just... Mm. I'm guessing I could probably just go quick game and reload. By the way, I never asked this, but I'm assuming the audio volume is okay for the game. <laughs> I mean, at least that, that zombie is dead. And I'm fine. I kind of want to go back to that one of the early rooms, the one in the bottom left there that's red. And go on the balcony and blow the whistle. I don't want to do that. That's because I... It's broken! Now I can't get back through there. Shit. Thank you for doing all of that, Kieran. Did you just copy and paste the first half and then you're typing in the words? <laughs> uh. Also, we got, a, we got a legitimate follow not that long ago. Thank you for that legitimate follow. You figured that out after 10 of them? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um... I mean, I guess I can go that way. I'm tempted to just reload. I keep pressing the wrong button. Okay. We go this way. We go this way. This, I think this door here, yeah, the main hall. Oh, Barry, Jill, got any good news? Other than I'm still alive in this madhouse, no, can't say it's much safer here either. We'd better secure our escape route first. There's gotta be a back door somewhere. All right then, let's split up again. Hey, hold on a sec. Look what I've found. What? A can of fizz. It's sure to yellow and mellow those things. It's yours. Hopefully you won't have to use it. Acid shells, okay. Can of fizz, I was like, a fizzy drink? <laughs> a fizzy drink, what? Okay. What about you? Oh, don't worry. I like the buddy system we have here. I see. Thanks. I'll take it. See you later. Ciao. Uh, I just bot followed Mistborn. Apparently it's happening to a lot of other streamers as well. So I think they just must be targeting people today. Okay, so that gave us a little cutscene. I do want to go down here. Um, 
Um, and the thing with the bot follows is like, they, they always follow and then unfollow right away. This is why I just ban them rather than trying to like remove them myself because they usually remove themselves anyway. At least the names are making it easy for Kieran to ban them. <laughs> like, much easier. So there's still something in here that I haven't got. Because the room, the room that I'm in is still red, so I haven't found all the items. If I go to up here, it's green. So I found everything on the top part, but not down here. We good now? Thank you. I'll let you know if any more pop up. I'll put my follow lots back on for now. But whenever I see like a bunch of them come up and it's like, um, if I can see heaps of them doing it, I'm just like, turn that off. And I'm trying to think like what items I have and I'm like, oh, like... <sighs> Do I have items in here that I... Could use? I don't know. But I do want to go... To the balcony up the top and use the dog whistle. Maybe something else will happen here and then I can... that I can use. We'll see. We'll see. No, I didn't mean to... <laughs> I was button mashing to get through that and then I accidentally <laughs> looked at it again. Let's go up here. We want to go through this little door because we have the dog whistle. The dog whistle. And it basically told us to go to the west side of the balcony. That basically had... That showed... This. Let's see it. Let's see what'll happen. Did I examine this? I don't know if I did. By blowing into it, it generates frequencies only audible to the ears of dogs. You can call a dog with this whistle. You blew the dog whistle. Shit. I didn't think it was going to just use one of your things, Jill. I. Oh my god. There's fucking shit tons of dogs. No, 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 no. That's fine. I kind of wanted to like go back to my other save anyway. <sighs> you are dead. That's like the original, like, <laughs> you died. Maybe other games did it too, but, you know. That's fine. That's fine. I kind of wasted too many of my items before, and I think I was out of them. That's why I didn't do that. Hmm. Kind of wish I had a save closer, but it's just like, I don't know if it's worth it <laughs> to have one closer. We're going to get through that cutscene again with the other dude. That's fine. 
How many? I've got four ribbons there. Actually, I can just combine them like that. Okay, cool. I didn't realize. If that's the case, then I may as well just hold on to all of them. First aid spray. Obviously that, I wonder, I want to um, actually just read the description on that because I haven't done that yet. A medicinal spray that can heal wounds completely. I do have a pink lemonade question. Pink lemonade, guys. Uh, is the with the first aid spray? Is this a one-time use? Um, or can I just continuously use it? Or is it like you can use it like five times? Like I just kind of want to know because I don't know. <laughs> One time, okay. I had a feeling that might be the case. I I had a feeling. <laughs> um, I'm gonna pop that away because I don't feel like I need it just yet. I don't think there's anything here that I'm like, oh, I can use it. I don't know what I could use the wooden mount for. I feel like there'll be something that I'm like, oh, that's what it's going to be perfect for. Full heal one type. Yeah. So that's what I thought. Um, obviously the gra like the herbs heal you like a little bit one time use. I figured that one was going to be like a just full, full heal and then that's it. Okay. There is Is there a guy near here? Yeah, he's out here. Ooh. I think that I think I can't get through here again if I go back through this door. I know there's a guy there. You coming, buddy? Come on. I know you're there. Oh, come on. Kieran. It's happening again. It's happening again. Um, uh, that's a lot, but they'll, um, they'll remove themselves anyway. Come on, guy. Ash! Ash versus evil bread! <laughs> Thank you for the raid! Welcome in! Um, I have my follower lost for the moment because 
those damn hotspots are at it again today. But thank you for those legitimate follows that are coming through. I appreciate it. Uh, welcome in, uh, N R Jaku. I should know evil redites. I hate to collect your souls. Oh no. <laughs> And Gamer Freaks, welcome in. Retro Fiend. Hello, T Prime. Ashley Slavic Man. Hello, how you doing? Same dude with the hoss. Hoss. Ugh. I just have my. I've got my follow alert separate to like all my other alerts, so I'm glad I do. I never did it on purpose for that reason, but I'm like, hey, it's, it works out really well for this. Follow bots, yeah, it's been happening a lot today. I was worried. I'm like, am I going to bring these assholes with me? <laughs> all good, all good. Um, the thing with them uh, is that they tend to follow and unfollow right away. So uh, we just go in and ban them and then they'll remove themselves from following me anyway. It's just annoying, you know. But I I've heard it's been happening to like a lot of people today. But I hope you had a good stream. I hope you had a good stream. What were you playing? Did I miss that? Possible to rid of everyone, yeah. I think it's just best if you follow while it's off and then just ignore it. It me, I'm the asshole you brought with you. <laughs> Hi, Joji Berry. <laughs> you love my bright red hair. Oh, thank you, thank you. Uh, welcome, old school game guy. Welcome in everyone who's new here. Uh, mm -hmm. I am Emma. I am an Aussie variety streamer and I am playing my very first Resident Evil game. I've never played a Resident Evil game before and I'm really enjoying it. I thought I would be terrified, but it's really fun. I'm off to bed, night everyone. Good night trial, thank you for hanging out. I complimented your hair, you're playing my favorite Resident Evil game. Oh really? <gasps> this is my very first one. Um, other games that I love are, I love like Zelda games, I love Soulsborne games. Um, yeah. And now we're getting into some scary games that aren't too scary, actually. <laughs> if there are any trolling, they will have to deal with me. <laughs> um, they seem to have calmed down for now. So. Yes. You love the hair as well? Thank you. It reminds me, did need to dye yours as well. <laughs> I just dyed mine last week, so it's very bright. Thankfully, I dyed it myself because we are in lockdown, so I wouldn't be able to go and get it done anywhere. I'm going through the Resident Evil lore, and so far this one has been your favorite. Oh, really? <gasps> nice. What were you playing today? I think I must have missed it. Um, wait. No, you're playing Resident Evil 2. Nice. Are you playing the remake? I've heard some really good stuff about the Resident Evil 2 remake. I know a few ways to ban them en masse, had a follow bot incident a while back and got a lovely few ways to get rid of them. Um, oh, good Slavic man, I, I know there's ways you can mass ban them, but, or like mass remove them. I'm always scared to remove them because I don't want to like remove legitimate follows. Um, and they just like, they will, they, they follow and unfollow anyway. So, I mean, banning them, who knows how much that actually does, but. That's fine. Not yet, wait till you play Resident Evil 7 or 8. They look scary. <laughs> they look scary. I could dye your hair for you. Uh, thank you for the offer, Kieran, but I will stick to doing it myself. <laughs> Res 2 is awesome. Yeah, Res 4 is really cool. You like all the Resident Evil games, nice. The remake, yes. Nice, it's a lot of fun. I, that's what I've heard. I'm excited, I'm enjoying this, so. Where is this guy? Are you coming through? There you are. Okay. We killed him. We didn't use any of our other items. Shit, he's coming. What? What? what, what? Excuse me. Well, you're not dead. Are you dead now? 
I think, yeah, there's blood. It's wasted a bullet. It's fine. We're probably going to die between now and the section I'm trying to get to anyway. So anyway. <laughs> You just love Jill. Got a soft spot for Jill in my heart. Meow. I uh, I chose her because I was like, I don't know. I'm I'm a girl, so I will play a girl character. <laughs> but maybe if I ever replay it, like maybe I'll play as the other the other guy or something. We'll see. Please check Messenger. I, I quickly can. Oh, of course, Kieran. That's fine. That's totally fine. I think you will like Resident Evil 8 uh, Village the most. I know I did. I've heard a lot of people prefer 8 over 7. Um, and I mean, from what I saw of that game, it looks really good. Silent Hill and the Evil Within had to be the scariest games I've played so far, really. I played a little bit of The Evil Within and I was absolutely terrified. But that was when I wasn't really used to scary games, so. I'm not a girl and I will always play the girl character. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I tend to just gravitate towards the female characters personally, um, but doesn't mean that you have to. <laughs> you like Jill? Chris and Jill have pretty different experiences, but about 80% of the same. Okay. Leon and Claire have totally different experiences around the two. Okay, cool. Well, if I do ever want to replay this, then I would definitely play as Chris and then and maybe do the high difficulty. We're doing medium difficulty for this one. Eight is awesome. Seven got weird after leaving the house, huh? Um, yes, by the way, guys, um, we do have a friend, streamer friend that is getting very close to affiliate if you would love to check her out. Um, she only just started streaming. She's only done like, what, three streams now, I think? But she's pretty close to affiliate, which is really exciting. And she also plays in a Vampire the Masquerade campaign, campaign, not campaign, campaign with my lovely fiance, Caradine Zero, as well. You only play horror games in complete darkness. <laughs> I can't, no. Chris goes to the mansion with someone else. Okay, yeah, cool, cool. I don't want to know any more, just in case. But I figured it might be a bit different if you play as like the different character. And I mean, that adds replayability to the games as well, which is cool. Okay, I'm stalling. I don't want to, I don't want to go to the dogs, but I know I probably should. That dog has an item on its collar and I need to get it. <laughs> um, but we're kind of far away. Actually, we're not too far away. I didn't need to kill that dude. What am I doing? I literally just needed to go up the stairs. I mean, he's it's good to have that zombie dead anyway, but if I die again, I'm not going to kill that guy. I think this is the way. Did I remember correctly? I did. Okay. Cuz yeah, now if I try to go back out that door again, the lower one, I probably, I don't know if I can. Vampire the Masquerade, nice. I used to, to do a lot back in high school. Nice, yeah. Um, Caradon Zero is my fiance and he plays with a bunch of other streamer friends um, on various different uh, channels, depending on who's running it and or whichever campaign it is. Okay, I just need to loop around. Because I want to get that item off the dogs, but I wasn't expecting two dogs to like attack me. I didn't even know how they got to the balcony. Like, how did they get up to the balcony? Barry. I don't think I can skip this cutscene. <laughs> Other than I'm still alive in this madhouse? No. I kind of feel like I'm like, oh, should we just make another save state closer? Our escape route first. There's gotta be a back door somewhere. All right then, let's split up again. Hey, hold on a sec. 
because I don't know if I can no, skip this. Oh wait, I, can I? I can skip it. What about you? Okay, that's fine. That's okay. If we can skip it, um, we want to go up here because there's something important there. I wonder if it's like maybe another key. Maybe you can do it. I believe. Thank you, Ash. <laughs> I, um, I'll try. I'll try. We're pretty high up. I just don't know how the dogs got up here. But if I'm ready, like if I'm prepared for it, it won't be so bad. Um, thank you for that follow. We just had a follow come through. Sorry, I had my alerts off, but I'm going to pop them back on again because it seems to have gotten a bit better. Okay, so what if I, we wait, we stand here, give us some, some space. Hang on, am I at a good angle? The angling in this can be kind of tricky. Okay. Dog whistle. I fucking went to... I... My god, seriously? I can't fucking shoot! My god, seriously. They're dead. They're dead. It's fine. I used up those two knives, but whatever. <laughs> yes, I will take the color. I did it. <laughs> I have no more defensive items, but we can find more. It's okay. I think there was another one in a bathroom that I didn't go back to because I died after getting it. I thought you had ended already, but in respect, that was naive of me. <laughs> I definitely haven't finished yet. I've been on for almost six hours, and but this is usually how long we stream for. Six, seven hours. Do you play D&D &D and Vampire on stream? Uh, so Kieran, uh, which is Karen and Zero, he doesn't play D&D &D on stream, but he plays Vampire on stream. And we definitely need to have some health too. Let's examine this collar, shall we? But this, there's a switch. Yes, we press it. <gasps> what is that? A coin was hidden inside the collar. It's like an armor. Oh, it's a key! Yes, I thought it might be one of these. Imitation of a key. Shaped like a key, but lacks the rigid, rigid, I don't know how to say that. Rigidity? Rigidity? <laughs> I know what it means, I just can't say it. Oh, this is the dummy key. This is the dummy key. I'm, I'm guessing this is the dummy key and we can replace it with the... I fucking knew it. Okay. Where are we going? I need to go save. I think I'm going to go to the typewriter on the left there because we are not far away. I think... Yeah. You probably don't need this dog whistle anymore. Oh. Yeah, sure. I'm assuming... That means I should get rid of it. <laughs> okay, where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? We want to go down those stairs. Ugh. Okay, my eyes itchy. Um, I did join your Discord. Oh, thank you, Ashley. 
Welcome to the Discord. Yeah, I put replica Resident Evil ID in general gaming session. I have Resident Evil 1 ID. Check it after stream. Okay, I'll have a look after stream. I'm probably going to run a relatively short D&D campaign on stream at some point. Ooh. Ooh. Cool. Rigid titty. <laughs> okay, so we want to go this way. Yeah, down the stairs. I don't remember if I've got any health items down there. We'll see. Um, I think it's just in here. Oh, okay. Do I have anything? I think we do. Yes. I probably should put some things away. That's fine. I don't know what I want the acid shells for yet, so... I'm gonna have this other herb too. I know of other areas where there's a bunch of them, so if I ever need more, I know where to find them. There we go, now we're fine. We're good. I think it's probably a good time to save. We've got seven. We've got seven saves, so it's not too bad. I mean, like, I'm pretty sure the next thing's gonna be easy to get, so. I'm like, oh, maybe we save after that, but at the same time, if I do die, I don't want to do all of that again. And if it's easy to repeat, then I can always just do it again if I have to. Yes, please. Okay. And at least now we've also killed that other zombie that was on the other side of the house too. Very good, very good. Okay, let's go. I, guys, I, I, ha I had a feeling we needed a, a fake key. Had a feeling. Baymol, hello. What did she even type on there? Dear diary, today I killed some zombies. <laughs> yes. Always the worst in these games, trying to conserve saves and having to repeat an hour or two of progress. <laughs> I'm trying to like, once I do like a decent amount of progress, I'm like, okay, now it's time to save. But I'm also kind of scared that I'm like gonna run out of them. Like, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, thank you, Spider-Man. Uh, we have a shortcut, so we wanna go up the stairs. And I think I know where I'm going. I think we want to go through here, yeah. It's a very specific looking door. I think it's through here, past all the pole arms. Wait. We want to, no, we want to go the other way. Shit. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Camera angles. We want to go this way. <gasps> what the fuck? What the actual fuck? Fuck you. Fuck you. What the fuck? Well, I just saved. I was not expecting him to come back to life. I... Oh, maybe that was one that I didn't kill, but the first time I was here, he wasn't alive. And then he...
I'm very glad that I made a save point before that. <laughs> <sighs> I'm gonna go to bed now. Good night, y'all. Thanks for the fun stream, Emma. No worries, sweet beat. Thank you again for the raid for earlier, and I hope you have a good sleep. The camera angles are perfect, just like real life. <laughs> Welcome to Resident Evil. Yeah. <laughs> it just throws me off when I've like gone back to an area and I'm like, wait, it changed. Did I do anything in here last time? No, I think I had it. I set it up perfectly. Like I saved after doing this. Cool. I think we're good to just keep going. Okay. And that zombie here was fast. I was not expecting it to just get up and like lunge at me that quickly. But now I'm prepared. I might actually shoot it. Oh, I can try shooting it before it gets up. How many? I don't have any defensive items. Shit. Can I? Okay, I can't. It won't let me. I think this guy's meant to do that. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. That's tricky. That's a tricky spot because you're really like closed up in and I definitely can't shoot him beforehand. I don't have any defensive items so I can kind of break free but then he's still really freaking close to me. At least I'm nice and close. I'm not like, I don't need to kind of do much between the save and getting there. <laughs> no backseating bagel. Even if you don't know what to do, guessing still might be what I need to do. I don't want you guys trying to guess what to do. You see, I do want to try to kill him though. He's very quick. That's why I'm just like, I don't know if running through is the best thing. How many? I have four bullets. I think if I go all the way. I have to change. Okay. Wait. I got it! I think that one's dead. Defeat a crimson head? Maybe the crimson head means it's like a fast one. I definitely, we got, we got a, we got a, um, a thingy for it. So I think that must be it. <laughs> Okay, I, I managed to actually like get away from it because I was 
quite stuck. Okay, let's take this and use it. Yes, please. Danger. Yep. Now we're back into caution. That's better. <sighs> Love the wiener votes. <laughs> I'm glad, Bainwall. <laughs> I must be drunk or sleepy when you ran past the mirror. It scared me. Oh no. <laughs> All right. Yes, imitation of a key. Perfect. It's what we want. Yeah, cr the crimson ones must be just fast versions. Here we go. Here we go. This is the puzzle that I tried to solve earlier. And now I'll be able to. Because we have a dummy key. Will you take the mansion key? I will. And now. Now we put this one there instead. Haha. Uh -huh. I knew that was how you got to solve it. But now we have the real key. So. Let's have a look. It'll probably have, aha, it's the armor one. So we can use it on all the doors that uh, say there's an armor uh, inscription on them. Yay, we have more access now. I'm also tempted to do another save because <laughs> Oh, that fast one. I don't want to have to fight him in Although that was better though. Being able to run away and then kind of get more distance and reload definitely helped. There's an engraving of armor. Nice. Okay. I wonder if I can open this door. Where does this lead to? That's the third floor. It's locked. That's helmet. Okay. Not armor. I'd also love some health items too. That would be good. This guy better not wake up again. Although his head was pretty well blown up, so... That's good. What's... Oh, I think that's where- that's the first area of here. Yeah. <gasps> no! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! I, why did I fucking know that he was gonna get back up again? No, 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 bitch, 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 fuck off! No! I should have just gone through the fucking door. Now I gotta get past that first one again. Oh, I had, I had a feeling he that one was gonna get up. I had a feeling. I can't trust the dead bodies on the floor, even if after I've walked past them. If it's one that I, I don't know if I killed that one earlier. I would say before this guy. <laughs> yeah. I bet you wish you could save. Yep. 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 I got the key and everything. I mean, now I now I know how to deal with those guys better. <laughs> Ugh. So the first guy, I can shoot him until he grabs me, and then um, Kieran, I need your assistance again. They're back. Um, then run away, get some distance. 
That guy I was like too close. I should have gotten further away. It's fine. It's fine. Imagine zombies playing dead, right? I wasn't expecting that. I was not expecting that. Well, maybe we can deal with the first guy better. I don't know. Yes, Anthony, yeah. Keeps happening today. Well, only a couple came through, but who knows how many more. Apparently it's happening to like a lot of streamers. Not just me. But we just turn off the alerts and uh, let Kieran do the thing. They follow and unfollow anyway. My followers have been like up and, up and down today. <laughs> I hope the amount that I have now is a legitimate amount, but it's I think so. It said it was way higher earlier. Um, and it's yeah, it's gone back down heaps. But I think we're legitimately above 3k, which is very exciting. I, I hid it over in the corner there because I didn't want the- I don't know if that made the bots want to do it more. I don't know. Okay, we want to do this. We want to run away. We want to run away. This hallway seemed to be good. Shit. Okay. That one's definitely dead. Oh, wait, no. I was like, there's something in that mirror, but I think it's, that's the mirror shattered. Okay, well, we dealt with that guy. We can deal with him. It's fine. <laughs> now, once we do the key room, then we gotta come back out and kill the other fucking guy. I mean, or I could just race back through here. About 10 bullets left. Cause I could just yeah do that. Cause he get back he gets back up when you walk past him. <sighs> the bots should see this guy in hell. <laughs> nice Anthony. Now I'm gonna do this again. Yeah, I can't, can't do my saves. Well, I, you know, technically you got save states in this game, but only very specific st save states. <laughs> I can't rewind or anything. That's fine. Did I, I did not eat this, but I should. All right, swap the keys over. Uh, no worries, Anthony. I don't think you're spamming them at all. Okay, we can't go to the door behind us. That is closed. Actually, I was just thinking, I might be able to go, if I don't walk past that guy, I could go the other way around. <laughs> we could take the long way through. Let's see, let's see. Hmm, mm, he didn't wake up, he only wakes up when I walk over him. Oh no. Do I really want to be in here instead?
Why are there so many crows in here? There's like handcuff things on the wall here, I just noticed. Avoid that other guy. That's great. <laughs> okay, this is where we are. I forgot. I was like, where are we again? There might be doors in here. where I can use that key. Because this is the one with the armor on it. Yeah. It's locked on the other side. I don't remember if these were sword ones or armor ones. <gasps> there we go. Okay, where is this taking me? Uh... Big room. I don't know if I want to go in here, but let's have a look. I don't want to save yet because it feels like too soon to save. Can't hear anything. There's something written in the corner of the picture. Commemorating the completion of the mansion. Another door there. An expensive looking grand piano. Oh, that's what that is. <gasps> Something shiny. It looks like a bar. A wooden counter made of oak. It gives off a pleasant aroma like fine wine. Give me the shiny shiny, please. Why can't I? Ooh, okay. Yes, I will. <gasps> Nice. Oh. What's back here? Anything? Can I push this? Oh. <gasps> Oh, yeah, I can. Does it go any more further? Hmm, what's this? Musical score. Sure, we'll take it. Um, examine. Moonlight Sonata. Okay. Dang, I want to build a mansion just so I could have a party. <laughs> that sounds like fun. Hope I'm invited. All right. Okay. I think that's that. Can I, can we learn? Wait, can we just learn to play? All right, I think I got everything from here. Is the room, it's still red. There's something, oh, that's the picture. Um, hmm. I think it's so fun discovering things and trying to figure out what they do. I get so excited seeing there's an item maybe picked up, right? <laughs> it's so good. I was like, what's this for? What's this going to solve? What puzzle will this solve for me? 
stepped away to get ready for bed, but overall, what are your feelings towards Resident Evil? I'm really enjoying it. I don't really play horror games or anything scary, uh, so I was kind of terrified to play this, but I, I've seen little bits over time, and I guess in the last couple of months I got more interested in trying them, so I was like, oh, maybe I'll try them, you know, for Spooktober this year, and I'm really enjoying it. And so far it's mostly puzzle solving, which I'm like, I love puzzle games, so yeah, it's not, it's not too scary. And I'm really, really enjoying it. Maybe I can't do anything else in here. And items tend to like shine when I know that I can pick them up and I can't see any others. Unless, I wonder if we're like meant to push the piano. Hmm. That looks like that goes somewhere, but I can't see. It looks like that is like behind the elevator. So I don't know if it'll open on this side too. Don't know. I don't want to push that back. I think that's it for this room. Cool. I mean, for now. It's obviously still, uh, it's still showing up red for me, I think. Yes, yeah, so I haven't got everything, but that'll do. You love horror, but you suck at puzzles, so it's weird to me. <laughs> hey, well, you still enjoy them. I mean, and you can still enjoy puzzles even if you don't think you're very good at them. Don't have to be good at something to be in to enjoy it. Yeah we can't access that. I don't remember if this door is one that I can Okay. I can. There's no further use for this key. Oh, okay, yeah. I didn't open many doors. Um, Pink Lemonade, when it does say there's no further use for this item, I'm assuming like the game is legitimately telling me the truth. Yes. And there's no point in keeping it. Yes. <laughs> when I figure out a puzzle, I feel like I have a 2000 IQ and get so happy. <laughs> is this a runescape? No, it is not. It's very rewarding, that's the idea, yeah. You can dispose, okay, cool. I thought so, but I wasn't sure if like, you know, maybe it's like, oh, maybe you shouldn't. Basement, I really don't wanna be in a basement. <sighs> Basements are scary. It's been a little while since we saved as well and we've done some stuff. Oh, it's a kitchen. I see a thingy right there. Um, <laughs> I feel like I want to, um, I want, no, there's a cutscene. Shoot it, shoot it please. Please shoot it, Jill. I think we got it! We got it! <laughs> um, also, we got a follow earlier that was a legitimate follow. Thank you for that. I'm I've been having to turn my followers on and off all of today. But thank you for that. Uh, Jay Toys, thank you for gifting a sub to Ash. Ash, enjoy your sub badge, your spooky emotes, and your ad previewing for a month. Thank you, Jay Toys. We are smashing through that sub bolt today. <laughs> Resident Evil's cutscenes? Apparently. <laughs> We've had a couple so far. 
I hate it when that happens when I'm like, I've gone through a door and I go to go back out and it's like, nah, this is a zombie. <laughs> I will take the magazine. Yes, please. The dishes are crawling with maggots. It's disgusting. Okay, you're gonna say the same thing over and over again? Cool. A piece of meat from an unidentified source. Ooh! I didn't even see a dagger there. Where was that? I don't know, but I'll take it. We have a defensive item now. <laughs> Maggots, you mean extra protein? <laughs> That's disgusting. That's disgusting. A bunch of spices you've never seen before. Oh, can we take them? Okay, where are we? I don't have a map for this area. There's a little room there. There's obviously this door here. I think there's like a little closet. I'm scared. So you're gonna get up. The power doesn't need to be turned on. Oh, this is the elevator. So you're gonna get up. We gotta turn the power on. You know what, we've kind of done a bunch since the last save, so I really want to go and save. <laughs> we've Because I think we did, yeah, we did the key puzzle and everything. I, I feel like I want to go save. I feel like I've done enough that warrants a save. <laughs> Without having to repeat too much. Okay. Um... I think I want to go to the save that's just below me, I think. Is it this one? I think it's this one. Uh, welcome in Misfit Sandman, how you doing? Yes, in here. With a really annoying clock. They're so cute too. I love the spoopies and so far liking it here. I'm glad. I'm glad you enjoy the emotes. I literally uploaded them today and um, I completely redid them like I, so I make my own emotes and my old ones when I had my other hairstyle was like a front fringe but I've been having my long side fringe now for a while so I was like oh it's time to update them anyway. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I've got nine of these. I've got nine. That's, that's a decent amount of save states. And we will obviously find more as we go too, so. I am terrified of exploring more of that basement. <laughs> At the moment. Yes, please. We'll save over this one. I'm um, good, so that it's your first playthrough and wanted to watch for a bit and see how you're liking the game. Yeah, well, welcome in. And this is not only like my first playthrough of this game, but it's my first Resident Evil game ever. So, um, yeah, I'm really, I'm really liking it. It's a lot of fun. Uh, okay. So yeah, we used up, hang on. This is the one with the, oh, the other key I must have finished using. Okay. Yeah, this one we still need to, we can still open more doors. Um. Yes, so we have There's the basement. We don't have a map for the basement though. 
There's also some doors on the left there that have the red that I'm like, maybe we can un unlock them now. But I was avoiding that other, <laughs> that other uh, zombie that was around there that caught me last time. And now we've saved, so I might go up and explore them. And there's those ones there too. I might try those doors. Uh, where's the door? There it is. In my humble opinion, it's the best Resident Evil and my personal favorite game ever. Oh, really? Uh, so I hope that opinion stays true for you. We'll see. We'll see. I've heard a lot of good things about other Resident Evil games and, um, yeah, but I, I'm, I'm really enjoying this. I thought I was going to be absolutely terrified, but it's not too scary. Oh yeah, this one's locked from the other side. What about... Wait. Oh, I... Th How do I get to that? I think I've got to get through to that side by the top. Okay. I think I know where I'm going. I think you want to go back around up top and then the other way. <laughs> I wonder if we'll find our friend again. I don't know, he, we separated and went off exploring. Right on, yeah, they're all pretty fun. You've So you've played most of them, Baymore? Yeah, so far it's definitely more puzzle solving than um scary. Uh, we want to go through here. We don't need to go out onto that balcony with the dogs anymore. <laughs> Since where the fuck did you come from? Is a fucking fast one. No, 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 no. 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 See, I almost forgot that I could run. No! Fuck off. This tactic's not too bad. No, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> we just... We're just running around, guys. It's fine. Wait till I can get a good shot of this guy. Just keep running. <laughs> Oh, oh, you dead? You dead. I think he's dead. How many fucking balls did that take? Felt like a lot. But we kept our defensive item. I ran away. I'm in danger, but... At least if I come up here again, I'm, I can know to expect it. Um, I guess I want to see if I can go into that door. Can I go in here? Oh, this isn't here. This one? Yeah, look from the other side. Oh, this is near that other guy that wakes up. Ugh. And I think I'm going to have to go near him. I guess we could try. Because I've literally only fought that other zombie. Before our last say, after our last say. The original and the remake of two are great, but this one holds a special place. It's always cool to see someone give it a try for the first time. Watching a blind playthrough just has a special feel to it. And that's my favorite part. Exactly. 
Um, I think watching someone else play a game for the first time, especially one that you also love, uh, is like the closest you'll get to experience it again for the first time. Because obviously you only get your first playthrough once, that's it. But watching other people play them for the first time kind of, kind of gives you that feeling again. You still have Capcom so much back then. Every game they make is amazing. They were untouchable back then. Capcom was my hero, Mega Man. <laughs> it started with Street Fighter for me and then of course Mega Man, DMC, Devil May Cry, Resident Evil and more. I'm in danger, yep. Why is your heart rate so fast? Because <laughs> we're playing scary games. <laughs> Ink, hello, how you doing? I'm doing good. I'm doing well. Uh, this game isn't too scary and I'm really enjoying it. I welcome in real guts. Welcome, welcome. <sighs> I'm just contemplating it. Contemplating if I want to fight this other zombie in here. I don't have to, I can avoid it. I can avoid it if I just loop around. Because <laughs> we're kind of hurt too. So I'm just like... I think if I get caught I'll, I'll die pretty quickly so... What the fuck? Seriously, what is that sound? No. That wasn't doing that earlier. <gasps> no! They're all coming back to life! What the fuck? Maybe they come back to life because I haven't fully, like, killed them. Like I don't know if I can just stomp on their heads. I mean I guess I could burn them. I'm sorry for the loud <laughs> loudness. I scare you more than the zombies? Yeah. <laughs> I didn't expect all of them to like the two of them to get back up again, and then there was that other one that came through the door. <sighs> Mike is a touch loud. I mean, I can, um, I can make the game audio louder. Um, Kieran, does the mic sound normal like it normally does? Exactly knowing the answers and watching someone have that aha moment is always just fun. Yeah. But out of curiosity, what other games do you stream typically? Uh, I'm a big fan of... I guess... Would you call it action RPGs? I'm a big fan of Zelda games. I love Zelda. Zelda's like my favorite game franchise. Um, I grew up with Zelda games. Uh, I more recently got into the Soulsborne games and I fell in love with them. Um... Britain. <laughs> Thank you for the host. Thank you. Uh, I like Mario games. I love a lot of Nintendo. So I love Mario games. I love like Mario Kart. Um, yeah. I think like Zelda Soulsborne, that's kind of like what I generally go for. But I do also love puzzle games too. Um, this week I will be actually playing a new, it's an isometric puzzle game that recently came out that I'll be playing too. Um, I really, I'll, in terms of more horror games, I love the Little Nightmares games. Yeah. Gonna go play some Apex, good luck, and I hope no more bots. I hope so too, Miss Bourne. Enjoy playing some Apex, thanks for hanging out. The best part of this is I hear the screams IRL before on stream. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. You were saying about this game not being scary. <laughs> It's not, honestly, it's not that scary. There are definitely scary moments, but I'm not like, oh my god, I'm terrified the entire time, you know. Ah, uh, thank you, Rasputin. So you're the kind of streamer that is right up my alley. Okay, <laughs> cool. <laughs> uh, what kind of games do you like, uh, Misfit? Would you prefer Misfit or Sandman, by the way? Do you have a preference? Um, but yeah. 
I love a good game that has some good combat, some good puzzles in it. I mean, just why I love the Zelda games. They're basically, you got combat, you got good boss fights, you got good puzzles in the temples, and you got some good exploration. I love games where you explore. I actually recently played Skyrim for the first time, which is a lot of fun. I definitely prefer third person style games though. Like I have played some first person, um, but first person I'm not super used to. I'll be heading out off for the night. Need some sleep, it's late for me. No worries, Ash. Thank you. Pardon me again for the raid and uh, you have a good sleep. Uh, Link to the Past and Resident Evil 1 were my first games ever. Oh really? That's cool. Uh, I only played A Link to the Past uh, the first for the first time when it came out on Switch. My first one was Ocarina of Time. That's what I started with. Back to the salt mines. Anthony, are you, are you playing Dark Souls 2? Is that what you mean? <laughs> if, if I had to categorize you as a streamer, a variety RPG action streamer, that's what I would say, Anthony. Like I definitely, I definitely play variety. Obviously I'm trying these games and I do play, I don't stick to same games all the time but I do gravitate more towards the um, action RPG games for sure okay so we've got that guy up top uh, I thought I thought I was thinking oh this is an easy way to get back to where I was before <laughs> but now I'm like oh shit there's like more zombies and where I've been is not safe anymore Um, uh, actually, there's that other section on the right there. I don't know if I can open that yet. I might be able to. Let's take, let's, let's check it out. Am I going to avoid this, the spots where there's lots of zombies? Yes, I am. We're going to ignore that for now. Can I open this yet? No, that's a helmet one. Damn it. Um. Well, we do have the basement to look at. That means I I just don't think I can get into that, that section there on the right. Yeah, because it's basically locked from either side. Um, there's that top bit there that takes me outside where there was lots of dogs. The left side is where there's lots of zombies. I'm like, I might be able to get in there, but like, oh, we've, we've got to deal with all the zombies. There's so many of them too. I just bought some ghost pepper snacks. Chex Mix and chips. They're so good. Ghost pepper. I admit, first couple of bites I felt like I can breathe some fire out of my nose. Oh, that must be hot. <laughs> yeah, Ocarina, Ocarina of Time was a blast. I'm really big into Zelda, Resident Evil, Souls, and anything that had a fluid combat and or movement system. I've really been hitting the 2018 God of War pretty hard again. Oh, nice. Yeah, so you like a lot of the same games that I do. Um, yeah, so you probably like like all the games that I play, uh, I've heard really good things about the 2018 God of War. Um, it's been brought up a couple of times in my last couple of streams and uh, I've seen some gameplay, but that's one that I'm like thinking of, ah, oh, I might, I might give it a try sometime because I haven't played it. I've never played a God of War game. No, my way, no, my way, just my wording of politely excusing myself for streamer stuff. Okay. <laughs> Dark Souls 2 is very far off. Well, look, it get, makes you salty. So I was like, hmm, maybe. <laughs> Five Fantasy uh, 7 is the Goat Devil games, the old one. And the remake, J Toys. I still have to play the 7 remake. I was going to play that soon, but then I didn't have enough time to play it between my last game and 
spooky stuff. So maybe after October, we'll get into the Seven remake. We'll see. We'll see. My internet is being poop and I got to get up early. Oh no, Babel. Well, I wish your internet stops being poop. Uh, but no worries. Have a good sleep. Thanks for hanging out. Oh my DM, you got to play God of War. Those guys know how to make some damn good games. Okay, I'll have to. I have to add it to my um, to stream list. Just so like I have an idea where about are you in the game? What was like the last milestone or puzzle you completed? The last puzzle that I completed was probably the um, the key one on the left there where you've got to replace the key with the dummy key. And I've opened, I opened the basement, but then I was scared to explore, so I left. <laughs> and now we're back here and I'm trying to like unlock maybe more doors that the armor key can open. Hopefully that helps. I don't know how, like, I don't know how linear this game is and how in what order you can solve puzzles. I'm not sure, but hopefully that's a, that'll help a little bit. <sighs> hopefully just the map will kind of give you an idea of where I've been as well. There's also a bunch of doors up there on the right that I haven't been. Oh, actually, that door up top. Let's see if we can open that. Because I'm avoiding the other area. <laughs> uh, this way? I think it's... This one? Yeah. Can we open this? <gasps> I can! Haha. -ha. I guess my family is the only one that says that for back to some hard work, right? <laughs> right, right, okay, so you're cruising along pretty good. I know exactly where you're at. I was into speedrunning this and achievement hunting for a, lo a long while. There. Oh, okay, nice. Cool. I'm turning to my parents because they're the only ones that usually say this. Oh, gosh. <laughs> mm -hmm. So we're out. This is outside. Oh, wait, I'm in there. Okay, I was really confused. I hope the dogs can't get up here. I'm trying to think. I don't think I've done anything since the last save because <laughs> I've been avoiding. I've been avoiding it. Let me take that. Thank you. Yes, please. I don't know if there's anything else back here that I should be interacting with. A table made of glass. Can I interact with the light? Me shit, camera. Okay. I don't think there's anything else. What's over here? Is that a telescope? A foliage, foliage plant. Someone was using the bench in place of a stand. Hmm. Hey, Reen, how you doing? My parents are around the same age as well, but they don't say, oh gosh. <laughs> 
Happy early birthday if I have not around your birthday or see you on the stream. Um, yeah, it's Anthony's birthday. Next month, we have so many people in the community who have October birthdays. So many. Ooh. Yes, I will take that dagger. Thank you very much. Did not even see it there. <laughs> I just have a habit of just going through and like... Clicking A. Hello. What you doing there? You right? Oh, cutscene. Okay. <gasps> Wait. Is this a friend? Shit. Can I? Forest has given up the ghost. It looks like he's been dead for a while. Can I take the weapon? Can I take the grenade launcher? Please, thank you. <laughs> a plant that's been damaged by exposure to the elements. Can I push this? It's like they were... I feel like he's gonna wake up. Maybe either now or when we go back. <gasps> no, I fucking knew it! <laughs> Fuck off. Knew it! Can't fucking see properly. Probably should have picked up the the plants. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. At least we didn't um we haven't really done too much. We kind of just explored that area. So, it's fine. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. You became a Jill sandwich. <laughs> Not quite. On the Ogosh part, I just wanted an excuse to use the Ogosh emote. <laughs> yeah. Your family swears like a sailor, but I'm what you call a Navy brat, meaning I'm a son of someone who is in the Navy. Ah. <gasps> <sighs> Okay. I I knew I I knew that 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 guy was going to get up. I knew it. Do I have space? I do have space to carry the plants with me. So yeah, I'm almost like I'm at caution. That's probably why I died actually. Like all there is. Yeah, I didn't do much out here, so that's good. We didn't do much. I think I found, yeah, so those these. Pick up the thingy, please. Thank you. Ink! 
Thank you for the five month resub. Thank you. Enjoy your sub badge and your spooky spooky emotes for uh, the next month. Well, yes, the next month. <laughs> and you added free viewing. Thank you for the support. Much appreciated. So technically you'd come through here and like not go in there to get those items. Like I could just get this gun and then yeah, yeah, cutscene. We don't need to see that again. Just give me the gun. <laughs> I could pick up one of the plants. What I'm going to try to do is I'm going to go in and try to pick one of them up, try to use it, and then pick the other one up and then run. <laughs> or maybe try to use both of them. Yes, 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 yes. We just want to. We just want to run, okay? Okay. We just want to. We want to pick them up. And we run away. Can I use it? Let's use it. We run, we run, we run. There we go. There we go. It was fine. It was fine. Do we need to go back out there again? No. <laughs> oh, we're fine. Okay. We could try the grenade launch. <laughs> Maybe, maybe it is like a use the grenade launcher against him. So that was, that's fine. If I have to redo that, that's not too, not too difficult. Good nights and good luck. Uh, no worries. Uh, would you prefer to be called Leafion? Uh, thank you for hanging out. You have a good sleep. There we go, break his ankles. I'll try. But the mnemonic, it's kind of true. At least last time I saw them, but one of my sisters had a kid recently. I hope they do a 180 soon. <laughs> Hopefully they, they become less demonic. All right, we're going in with the big guns. I don't know if he's going to be like right here, but. Well, that didn't do anything. Wasted a couple of them, but, uh... That, that one shot them. That one shot him. Okay. I think I got all the stuff from out there. Yeah. I probably didn't really need to kill him, but that's okay. I don't know. Hmm. I don't like that I can't just fully kill him. I feel like he's going to wake up again if I come back out here. Just like the others. Having that having that weapon with like the one shot might be helpful for later. <laughs> when there's like more of them and I need to just get them out of the way quickly. Okay, I don't think there was anything else out there, but I haven't found everything out there. Hmm. Also, Misfit works. 
but you're not overly particular. Cool. I think I saw you had a Discord link. I'm trying to use the app some more and wouldn't mind joining another group. Yeah, we definitely do. Uh, if we could get someone to post the Discord link in the chat, uh, you are welcome to join. Takes about 10 minutes before you can post just for security reasons, um, but we'd love to have you there. I should probably make a Resident Evil section now because <laughs> uh, we've got like a game section and um, if I'm getting into these games, it might be a good idea to have one. Dat cord! <laughs> I like that one, Bob. Not Discord, Dat cord! <laughs> Wub, you're great. I'm trying to think what else I've, I've missed. <laughs> Thank you, Kieran. I was hoping someone would post that. <laughs> His body's gone. Oh, okay. So. It I've noticed some of the dead bodies will like disappear. So if they disappear, they mustn't get back up. But if they stay there, it must mean that they're going to get back up at a later date. I'm learning. I'm learning. <laughs> Thank you, Wob. Thank you. Hmm. Oh! <gasps> I just noticed that shiny thing. Wait, no, I forgot to pick this up last time. It's the it's the dagger. I got it the first time I was here, and then I forgot to pick it up. Uh, I don't have room for it though. Uh, okay, I'm gonna try to remember. There's a dagger out here. <laughs> there's this one, and there's another one in like a bathroom that I um. Thank you for the follow. That I. I don't think I've redone the bathroom scene. A plant that's been damaged by exposure to the elements. So we we did pick up like stuff that kills plants, but I'm just kind of like, I don't I don't think here is probably the best place to use it. Well, so weird, no one is streaming tonight, but Emma on my follow channels. It's so weird if something happened to the world we aren't aware of. Um, that is weird. I think it'd be super weird if I went on my follows list and like no one was streaming. There's a, there's at least usually a few people on. Um, that's strange, but I know we've been getting a lot of like, uh, bot follows today. So unless people are just like, you know what, they're stopping streaming because of that. I don't know. Hooray for learning. Yeah. Oh wait, no, yes, Misfit. Sorry, I can take that one regardless. I just realized it's it's not one of those items. It's my it's my other one. Yes, I remembered. I remember that, but I forgot about it. But thank you for the reminder. <sighs> you remember this game from when I was a kid? My uncle had it and it scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Funny to look back now. Nice. Uh if I saw this when I was a kid, I'd probably be very scared too. Um, I did already know that misfit, so I don't mind a reminder, but, um, generally, yeah, we do want to be careful of any backseating or, you know, that kind of thing. You've got a ton of people on here and, hmm, kind of like no one else is streaming feels so calm. <laughs> you have no uncles that play video games? Oh. I wonder, if, I've probably got people on that are probably streaming. Yeah, I've got quite a few people on that are streaming. So I guess it's just the people that you follow um, that just aren't. I don't know. They're just not on. It's weird. <laughs> okay. Wait, that must have been the item that I, yeah, that was it. That's why it would, this area was still red. Cool, it was just the dagger. It was just the dagger.
Okay, will anything be different out here? I don't think so. Okay. Uh, I probably really should check out some other areas. I could check out the doors on yeah, that right hand side. Because I feel like I've been there not when I had this new key. I was here previously though. Um, all good, all good, Misfit. Um, like I said, I did already know that, but I just forgotten. <laughs> I forgot that that wasn't like one of the items that took up space. So you're fine. You're fine. You love this OG Resident Evil game. Also, hello everyone. Welcome in, um, Astafia. I didn't delete it. Yeah, yeah. You're good. All good. <laughs> And even if you guys accidentally spoil or um, say things, um, your comments will probably get deleted, but like, it's just to be extra safe. And it's all good if you make a mistake. These things happen. Uh, okay. Can I open this? <gasps> I can. I, um, I wonder how many of these doors I can open. Okay. Quite a few. You know what, we'll just go into the first one. If I need to redo that other section, like with that guy outside and stuff, I'm happy to do that because that wasn't difficult. I'm thinking to myself, I'm like, okay, if I die, we need to go back to this point. <laughs> No, Emma mistakes are unacceptable. <laughs> it was quite an experience your first time playing this. Nice. Well, shit, we got to Richard. Ooh. What happened? You're wounded. This whole place is a killing zone. There are monsters. It's not looking too good. What did this to you? A big snake. Oh. And it had to be poisonous. Poisonous? Richard, hold on. Oh no, he's gonna die. Me serum. I saw some, but didn't bring any. I'll go and get it, okay? You're gonna make it. Thanks. Oh no. Where's the serum? He saw it. Oh, I need to go past the other zombies. <laughs> no. Oh, big snake. Yeah. <laughs> um, I was in. I was mid sentence when that cutscene happened. Uh, I was gonna. I think I was saying that. Um. Hope you guys enjoy watching me play this game for the first time. Ah, <sighs> yeah, it's in that safe room. Which, I mean, I guess I could try to, <laughs> I just run, run through maybe. No, that room there on the left with the stairs is what, like there was a shit ton of them. Hmm. I guess it won't let me keep going through here. It just wants me to go back. I hope there's no like, um, time limit with this.
I mean, we do have the other weapon, which is good. Okay. I think I want to go in here. I think we want to go in here. The OG voice lines for this are your favorite ever though. Oh, really? I'll have to um, like maybe watch, catch them on like YouTube or something. Someone say snake. I think that's my cue to jump over to another channel for a bit. You know how I feel about snakes. Uh, yes, I think it was in the other, other half of the area, Anthony. So once we head back over, that's probably a cue to jump out. Um, there's, uh, there shouldn't be any snakes on this side as far as I'm aware, but I totally understand if it uh, freaks you out a bit. If I go into here, there's a zombie in here. Which we can deal with okay. How many... Okay. No! Oh, fucking run, Emma, run. No, it's got fucking huge claws! Bitch, no! Oh my god. Maybe I'd be better off using my other one. It's so fucking fast. No, shit. Oh, fuck off. Ah, I have to redo that outside bit. And there's that guy that we need to get the serum from. Like, maybe I should just go through this part here first and try to kill all of them. And then hopefully once I've killed them again, they don't get up again. Maybe? Snakes. Why does it always have to be snakes? <laughs> That's from something, isn't it? Up until I see my oldest friend have three big ass snakes with his three kids. They play with the snakes too and it makes me nervous. Ugh. Fight your fears and survive. I'm trying, game, I'm trying. <laughs> this seems difficult, yeah. Oh, you've only played Resident Evil Village, really? I've heard good stuff about that one. Um. Yeah. The controls are a bit, they're not the easiest to aim. And that one, especially with those really fast zombies, it's like, it's a bit tricky. Did you really just say that? Lil, am I really that old? Wait, who said something about being old? Did I? I don't think I did. Yeah, I think maybe if I go there, I mean, we could even grab the weapon from the other side. Don't kill the dude and just leave. We could still grab the health items though. I honestly didn't need to kill him, I don't think. Because being able to like, one shot some of those zombies will really be really helpful and also we have our shotgun somewhere but i don't have it with me right now <laughs> i'll be joining the 30s club soon it's not too far away
Alright, we have... Yes, I want to pick up the item, please. Thank you. I will take that. So there's this, there's the dagger, and there's the weapon, and then there's the health items, which... I think I managed to just, like, run past him last time, so... Yeah, we'll definitely take that one. Yeah, yeah, cutscene, we've seen it already. Grenade launcher, yes please. Cutscene. It's fine, just just take the items. Let's take the items. Angle's fucking me up. <laughs> this way, this way, please go in, Emma. Please go in the fucking door. Ah, <sighs> made it. Emma will soon be old woman. <laughs> Did I really look unhappy? It's fine. Thirty's not old. It's not old. Old ass man killing his wife and older woman. <laughs> that is just the best you have more things in order than in 20s. Yep, yeah, exactly. Exactly. All right, where are we going? I think we want to go in here. I'm fine. We're still fine. I think, though. I want to use the grenade launcher for this next guy because he's really freaking annoying and hopefully this can one shot him and the next few as well. Did that not kill him? Wait, no, I think it did. There's a pool of blood. He's dead. All right. Okay. Uh, map. We need the map. Um. We want to go into the stairs section. Hopefully this kills them for good as well. We got this guy in here. Oh, okay, I'm opening it. Fantastic. He can't see that I'm here. At least coming out here means that he is not gonna open that door and barge in. All right, we got a plan. We have a plan and it seems to be working. Now there's only two dudes in here that I've got to worry about. <sighs> These fuckers come back to life. So if I... Quickly do this... <laughs> Wait. Is he dead? I think he's dead. Can't see pull the blood. But I think this kills them. This better fucking kill them for good. Okay. I think our safe room's down here. Hopefully, if the medicine's not here yet, um, hopefully, oh shit, you're gonna wake up, aren't you? You gonna wake up? Oh, I don't know if 
gonna be worth saving again. Many of them are a sickly color. Yeah, I think once I, I've got to talk to that guy and then come back here. So I'm pretty confident in going through that section now. I just don't know if I want to save in here yet. How many do I have? What eight? But I mean, we're doing pretty, we're doing okay. I guess I don't have to redo that section again. But I don't want these guys to get back up again if I like... I wonder if they do. I'm just going to test it out. I can always run away. I can always run away. I just want to see if their bodies are still up here. Because if they're gone... Then they're gone for good. <gasps> they're gone for good, it looks like it. It's when they've stayed there and then haven't disappeared is when they get back up again. Okay, I think we're safe enough to save again, but I do have to go talk to that other guy so that I can come back and get the serum. But I'm thinking I want to talk to the other guy first, come back through here. And then we can save, and that way we're not wasting a save. <laughs> you know? These guys didn't respawn. I'm hoping the guy out here is not going to respawn. Your man's stressed about turning 30? Oh really, you've still got two years to, to go. <laughs> I've got about six months to go. <laughs> and this guy's gone too. Okay, cool. Oh, I like this grenade launcher. <laughs> okay. Where was it? Was it, I think it was through here. Yeah, it was through here. I'm glad I've cleared that area before talking to this guy. <laughs> that way when I need to go back through, it's like, it's fine. I think, yeah, here, because we use the key. Big 30th birthday party, one stream, mm-hmm. I mean, I usually do birthday streams, but it'll be a big Richard. one. Okay, yeah, so basically gives you that cutscene, makes you go back out. And now, hopefully, uh, there ain't too many enemies along the way. Hopefully. <sighs> my only problem with being 35 is I wish my lower back stopped hurting so often. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Being a misfit for a long time, it'll be hard to label. I'll be a hard label to shed. <laughs> I mean, you can still be a misfit, right? That does not, doesn't matter how old you are. You fractured your spine when you were 14. Oh shit. You always have back problems. Oh, that sucks, J Toys. Like a 30 hour stream for your 30th birthday. Jeff, no. <laughs> I could not. I could not. <laughs> if you guys didn't know, Jeff did a 30 hour stream. Was that? That was for your 30th birthday, right? Wait. Am I in the right spot? I don't think I am. No, I went through the wrong door. It was, yes. I don't know how you did it. I don't know how you did it. We go through this door, go down the stairs, get the stuff, and then I'm going to save. I think that's enough progress that I'm like, I feel okay to save and... Okay, I'm wary of this dude down here. Okay, he might get back up when I go back out though. 
So. <sighs> oh, game, can you let me? Aha! Oh. Oh, we can put some, we can put that document away. Oh my gosh, camera. Let's pop the document away because I don't know what that's for. Um. Having that with me is handy. I don't know if I really need it. Will you take the serum? Yes, please. I'm guessing it's obviously only given me the one serum. It's not like there's multiple options, even though it says there's lots of serums there. Obviously the game is giving me one. All right. Let's save. Let's do it. There we go. Oh, we made progress. Thank you for the stretch ink. Oh. Now I'm scared to exit this room because of the other dude. <laughs> He's right there. Jeff is superhuman streamer, this is how, yeah. <laughs> so I was looking at your schedule and I saw you're alternating this and Sekiro. <gasps> I actually finished Sekiro. I need to update that misfit. <laughs> I need to update that. Um, I'm actually playing a different game later, or mid next week. Uh, it's a new indie dystopian isometric puzzle game it's called the plane effect um so i'll be playing that i've actually finished sekiro i really really enjoyed it it had a big learning curve but it was a lot of fun um i did like the standard ending for my first playthrough and then i did a new game plus and i did the shura ending for that one because of back issues like keep keeps me up a lot so i end up with lots of insomnia oh you said it five days in a row every few months for, but you usually sleep every two days for a few hours. Shit. It's not fun when you pass, go past two days, close to three days straight up. It's not pretty at all. Yeah, no. That's really bad to not get much sleep. Like you can get really, I mean, you need sleep after a certain amount of time, right? You can't go without sleep for a while. 30th party we can have some party games review all the games you played on stream and highlight your favorites yeah you didn't do standard well you did return i did the one where you fight like most of the bosses you know what is sleep <laughs> is there a snake not yet not yet anthony i mean we might be going back over to the snake but i'm also kind of hungry right now <laughs> That's cool. I couldn't finish it. You liked it, but enjoyed Tsushima more. Okay. I haven't played that one yet. I know a lot of people have struggled to get into Sekiro just because it's so different to the other Souls games, but I know a couple of people who have actually, they've played it previously, didn't get into it and then tried it again and then got into it the second time. So if you could get back into it, I don't, I mean, do you know how far you got? Um, I was pretty scared to try it because I knew it was so different, but once I got past that learning curve, it like, yeah, it's really good. Want me to bring a snack? Um, nah. Emma did the run where she told the game to get wrecked. <laughs> Thanks, Jeff. I'm proud to have first tried a couple of the bosses and I'm proud of how I did with the final boss and certain other bosses too. No, you just snacked it. If anyone new is watching, Karen Zero is my fiance, so he is allowed to say stuff like that in chat <laughs> to me. <laughs> and he's the only one who's allowed to say that. Oh. We gotta get this serum back to him, but I'm I'm scared to go back. I 
I'm really enjoying this. Yes, I'm IRL partner. Not okay. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, it's not just some. I mean, you are a mod, but not some just random saying stuff like that. <sighs> yeah, don't be a creep. <laughs> Yes. No, Kieran, you just snack. Kieran is also a snack. He never says sweet things like that to me. Oh. <laughs> I killed the first, like, major boss fight, like the guy on the horseback. Yeah, yeah. Then not much farther. I got a lot of shades of... I got a lot of shades of Bloodborne, which is cool, but not my favorite. Um, yeah, so you were very early on. I would say if you ever felt like it, I know, like I said, I know various other streamers who struggled, but then went back to the game and got more into it the second time. Um, so I think if you can get past that that point, uh, it gets it's really really enjoyable. It definitely has quite a steep learning curve though. But obviously, if it, if you're like, no, nah, I don't want to do it, then obviously that's fine. Obviously, it's okay. You've got a creepy emote by another streamer? <gasps> Did I read? I think I read that. Oh, that is creepy. Ah, this is Selena emote! <laughs> that must be one of her new ones. I um haven't seen that one. That is terrifying. That is terrifying. As far as like combat goes, really aggressive and less defensive, which is my playstyle, but I'll have to give it another go. Wait, are you talking about um Bloodborne? Or Sekiro? You've seen that one? I don't think I I haven't seen it. Maybe it's a new one that she uploaded? I don't know. I don't know how easy it is to, is going to be to get back to this guy. I don't know if the zombie out of out here is going to wake up now. Like he's going to wake up at some point, you know. We'll we'll suss it out. Like I don't know how easy it is to get back to him. There's no more zombies in here. There's still something in that lower part of this room that I haven't found. And I don't know what it is. Aggressive and parry is the way to go. Blocking is no fun. I barely block play street photo. It depends on the game you're playing. Bloodborne is very aggressive and you, I mean, you can't block in Bloodborne. Bloodborne's very aggressive. Sekiro, you can be very aggressive, but obviously you'd need to deflect a lot depending on the enemy. Both Bloodborne and Sekiro, yeah, you're really based on offense and powering if you had to describe it, yeah. Bloodborne's definitely more aggressive and obviously with Bloodborne, like when you know, you can get more health back by attacking, just like that really like adds to it. Anthony, we might be going to snake territory soon, just as a warning for you. Just in case. I think it's new, I say it and I was like, what the hell? But I mean, it kind of inspired one of my spooky modes. Oh, nice. Oh no, is he dead? Oh, there's a thingy there. There's two of them there. Shit. Are we gonna have to kill him? Richard is already dead. What a tragic fate for such a close friend. 
I'm going to leave the health items there because I don't have any space to pick them up. You know what? Let's um suss out this room. We might find a snake. You found this show called The Big Bang Theory. It's so great. I've seen bits and pieces of The Big Bang Theory. It's not really my kind of show. It's a bummer about Richard. Yeah. He's totally going to get back up there. We're going to have to fight him. <laughs> Gross! Its head came right off. Lovely. It's locked. An emblem of a shield. Ah, okay. It's one of those ones. This looks lovely. What's in here? Hopefully it's a little safe room. Please be a little safe room. I think so. Yep. Oh, we got 45 of them. I've only got one more grenade launcher left. I feel like I should save that for something, but I don't know. It's very dark in here. It's too dark to see much of anything, exactly. We have to turn the power on at some point and I think we're gonna have to go into the basement. <sighs> For that. Ooh, I can push that. Let's do it. <gasps> Is that a secret? <gasps> I'm, sorry, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, guys. I think he's, I think you he might be dead now. This, having this table in the middle is great. The screams, I'm sorry. <laughs> I can see it in your eyes, you have to make October or Resident Evil month. <laughs> He's dead. What's back here? Better be worth it. What is that? Fucking hell. Are you serious? It's too, I, I can't get anything in here because it's too dark. Shit. I reckon I need to have the lights on to be able to actually get stuff in this room. So apparently it's too dark for anything. Our friend's probably going to get back up again. You agree with J Toys, Chris? I knew you'd agree. <laughs> Okay, that guy is gone, so he is dead, dead. Hopefully not coming back. A friend. Don't be sorry, that's what makes it, it a scary game yet. Oh, 
Okay. Wait. Is that the same body? Oh, it's a different one! Oh. That was weird. Okay. <sighs> We're fine. I was like, I'm out of bullets, but we got we have 30 more, so that's fine. <sighs> this is your favorite game series after all. Oh, it's your favorite. I didn't I mean I knew you loved these games, but I wasn't sure uh if it was like a favorite or just one of your favorites. Um There's a safe room there and it's red. I might go through to that one. We could... Oh, we got seven. I unlocked this as well, so I'm kind of... but I'm kind of scared to go in here. Like, it looks like an important room. <laughs> Although we haven't done too much. We basically just got the serum, found out he's dead, checked out the other room. Kill some zombies, and that's about it. This looks like a special door. The sleeping night. The puzzle room? The sleeping night. Oh, wait. They're all the sleeping night, apparently. There's something in this depression. But the grate is in the way and you can't reach it. Yeah, I think I meant to put... Woe to those who disturb my sleep. There's a switch here. Oh no. I'm not pressing the switch. It looks like I need like a, either I've got like the sheet music that's like that square shape or the wood, the wooden piece that's like maybe meant to go there. I mean, like I said, we haven't done too much, <laughs> but I'm also just like, mm, maybe see if I can go and get those items and just maybe test it out. Where are we going? Yeah, if I go around here, through this door, we can go to this other safe room. Get our things and test it out. There's a body there. Watch. That was not here before. I left you some bullets in the room on the right. Feel free to use them if you manage to get yourself in trouble, Barry. Okay, I'm kind of scared to go in this room now, but it might be fine. <laughs> but he, he left me some- oh, he left me a bunch of stuff! Yes, I will. Oh, these ones I can all pick. I can pick all these up. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Pick it up, please. <laughs> A 
a meme going around saying Chris Pratt, uh, Homer Pope Mario, that's so wrong. Uh, I'm pretty sure Chris Pratt, I, I could be wrong, but I think he goes to a homophobic church and that's why. What's that one again? What is it though? I don't remember what that is. Let's put some things away. Well, I don't need the serum anymore because <laughs> Frendo is dead. I mean, we might need it at some point, but. I thought there was no storage. In no, there is storage. And thankfully, the different storage boxes share the same items. So I don't need to like have certain ones in certain areas of the house. It's good. What do you have in the item box? I'll, ha I'll show you. Let me um, pick all these up and then I can... Incendiary shells. Sure, I will take them. I don't know what they're used for. Actually, hang on. I'll show you what we got. We got some first aid spray, shotgun shells. Shotgun, broken shotgun, emblem, blue gemstone, wooden mount, red herb, fuel canteen, musical score, acid shells, green herb, serum, and first aid spray. Uh, I wanted to look at the description for that other item. Okay, they are for the grenade launcher. I was hoping they would be. I wasn't sure. I was like, oh, are they for the grenade launcher? Nice. Um, I'm just trying to think. I don't want to bring everything with me. Like maybe I put the ink ribbon back in here. Well, maybe we save. I might save and then. Hmm. But then we can come back for them. I don't know if I'm gonna need the key anymore, but I might want these for the grenade launcher, but I don't think I can. Yeah, it's, it's so annoying. I'm like, can't I just put more into my <laughs> grenade launcher right now to get rid of them? Same with, um, this one. I mean, I wouldn't get rid of this lot anyway. Um, I wanted to try either the, the wooden mount or the musical score look like they might fit into where that button is, but I don't know if that'll actually do anything or not. Magic story box is always great. <laughs> yeah. It's got a lot of space in it too. That's interesting. I'm curious how you'll work through this. Hmm. I think. Let's we'll, we'll we will save. Because I've done a little bit of progress since last time, not heaps. Not heaps. And I guess I could always reload another save if I'm like, oh, I should have waited or something. I could just redo it. All the puzzles you're working on, I mean, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of items that I have that I haven't used yet. Speaking of saving, I think I'm going to crash now. Night, Emma, night. No worries, Zen. Thank you for hanging out. Hope you have a good sleep. Do it. I'm falling asleep. Good luck in your playthrough. Hope you'll have a great night. No worries. I see what you did there. I see what you did there with night. <laughs> By the way, uh, you guys have good sleeps. Is the snake gone? Uh, there's been no snake. I thought there was going to be, but we haven't seen a snake. So, um, we're a little ways off. Cool. 
I know there's there might be a snake around that half of the house, but I'm just like not sure. I'm gonna I'm gonna test something out. Uh, I'm gonna pop these away because I don't think I'm gonna need to save anytime soon. And I guess a lot of the saves, not all of them, but a lot of them, the save states are near these boxes anyway. So it's only if I come across like a new one that I'm kind of like, oh, it'd be nice to have them with me. Um, yeah, no, I haven't found the snake yet, but I think, I don't think we're going to find it anytime soon. Safe to stay a little bit, yeah. Um, where am I going? Where am I going? We're going back up to that. Wait. Yeah, we're going back up to that room with the knights in it. Is this guy going to wake up? I think if I walk past him, he probably will. Hmm. If you could, if you could give um sharp a whisper heads up that'd be appreciated i just don't want to know in chat when it's coming soon like i i figured there's gonna be a snake at some point soon but just so it doesn't kind of warn me about it too you could dm each other instead okay fuck i forgot to pick up the items that i was gonna bring I mean, we did just save, so I mean, I cleared space for myself. I've just saved, so if I die, then it's like, whatever. You know? Let's press the button. It's gonna, something bad's gonna happen. Oh, okay. Interesting. Uh, Critical, hey, how you doing? I'm playing Resident Evil, I am. It's going well, I'm really enjoying it. It's a lot of fun. So I've been lurking today, playing a bit of Kana since my connection is cutting out. A oh, no worries, Ryan, thank you for the lurk. That doesn't look healthy, it does not, Pakura. <laughs> so hi, how you doing? Not very healthy, healthy at all, right? I don't think I, I don't have any type of like mask or anything. Unless I'm meant to just, I don't know. I wonder if I can swap things. I can, that was handy, okay. Um, These are the only things that I'm like, are maybe the similar shape. But maybe I'm just meant to leave the- I don't know if I'm meant to just leave the room or not, but these are the items that I wanted to grab last time. But I don't think placing them there is going to really do anything, but it's fine. We give it a try. Trial and error. Let's see what works. Is this the remastered one for PC? Because your character looks really detailed. Uh, this is the remastered version and I'm playing on Xbox. But yeah, they definitely look way too good uh, <laughs> for when this game was made. I don't even know when this game was made. Was it like late 90s or early 2000s? I'm not sure when it was actually made. Late 90s, yeah. I wonder. Oh. Were the things behind here? I think. 
think maybe. I don't think this is going to do anything here. Yeah, okay. Now let's press the button. Okay, there's still smoke coming out. I thought pushing them would maybe block it, but I guess it's coming out from other areas. What about if I go back in? <laughs> No, 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 don't push it that way. Can't push it that way. Maybe I need to only push a cert certain ones in. They all say the sleeping knight. Shield, axe, sword, polar. Shield. Let's try something. Axe. Oh, wait. <gasps> no, I'm going to restart that. Restart. I didn't realize that it, I didn't push it all the way in. And I think maybe I meant to do it in the order on the pitches. Then the remaster of the remake was 2015. Oh, okay. The OG 96. Remix 2004, remaster 2015. Okay, 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 okay. I almost said it in the right order before, I think, anyway. Shield, like I said, shield, shield, axe, sword, pole. Shield, axe, sword, pole. Yeah, I think I did that in the right order, but I didn't push them all the way in. It didn't. I see what's happening, okay. We good now? We good? Aha! I had the right idea the first time, I just didn't push them in far enough. A mysterious box. Fuck. It's fine, we can leave. Hopefully when we come back it's not- like I literally can't do anything. Just testing, just testing. Um, yeah, I think I need to, hopefully this doesn't reset. Hopefully now that I've unlocked that, that stays unlocked. We'll go back, put my things in the chest, come back and see. Otherwise I know how to do that puzzle. Well, it was trial and error, but we did it. Question though, do you plan on playing Resident Evil to OG or remake? If I play it, which I probably will because I'm really enjoying this, um, I'll probably play the remake. Anthony, thank you for the hydrate and the stretch. 
Why not both? I mean, like, I mean, I could play both. I very much could try both. Oof. this in here. What did I? I took out my save states, but I don't really need them. Don't need them just yet. Wary of that body. If I have to redo this again, <laughs> I feel like I'd rather just reload from my last save state. Because I also wasn't as hurt before. Let's see. Let's see. No, it's fine. Let's take it. Jewelry box. Heck yeah, I will. Now, I have no idea what we're meant to use it for. But. Let's have a look. That's like, that looks like a card. That's like half a heart. That's the other half. Oh, the shapes are the ones that are on the top. There's a design of the sun and the moon. On the plate it says, sunshine will awaken me. Ooh. There's a switch. Wait. Okay, well this is the sun, so I, I realized I was pressing the moon one. Ugh. It's a mask, okay, that's a terrifying mask. Death mask, lovely. Can we wear it? It's a death mask without eyes, nose or mouth. There's nothing unusual. I mean, there's a red thing on it. I don't know what that is. Are you sure there's nothing unusual? Okay. All right then. Okay. Who's gonna jump out at me when I exit here now? Well, I have no idea what that's meant to be used for. <laughs> um, oh, I can go and get that item from the bathroom again because I had, didn't do that scene again after dying. Also, it's getting cold in here again. Just gonna get my blanket. It's annoying because I kind of want to do a bit more before I make another save state like we solved that puzzle but that's basically it and i could easily do that again um i can venture a guess i mean there's definitely areas to look at i also might have some food because i'm kind of hungry it's almost six o'clock.
Hmm. Hang on. I thought it might be this room. But I still never found everything. Like when the room is red, it means I haven't found everything. Can I guess? Um, no. <laughs> Just in case you're right. The pages are blank. There's definitely still something shiny though. Like the tape. I need the tape. <gasps> oh, it's a lighter. Oh my God. I swear I saw this earlier, but I thought it was the journal, but it's not. Fuck yeah, we'll take that. I mean, that's worth saving after now. <laughs> now that now I've got everything. Wait, no, I haven't. The room is still red. <laughs> Now does it? Am I meant to burn it? <laughs> Let's examine it actually. Lighter of... Lighter? <laughs> Is that what it says? Words are carved on it. Don't play with fire, love, Jessica. Okay. It was a present from Jessica. By the sounds of it. I don't think there's anything that I can really do there. Hmm. Well, we found something else. We found something else. I also missed some items in that other area, but we have, we have to go back there anyway at some point. Um... I also think I kind of need to heal because we are at caution. That's not terrible. I think caution is only one down from like normal. I think. Um, I haven't done much, but I'm also like, oh, I should save. <laughs> Hang on, no, you want me to map, Emma? Map, please. Have I? I don't know if I've tried to go in those doors yet. I feel like this guy is going to... Let's do this. Thank you. Is he going to wake up? He didn't wake up. Oh shit, it's a new door. Okay. Uh, kind of scared, but let's check it out. There's a health item. Fuck. Ugh, I can't even use it. Damn it. There's a large scratch in this wall. It doesn't look like the work of those rotting freaks. Great. Just perfect. This is a massive house, by the way. It's huge. I mean, it's a mansion. 
there's so much. This is a really awkward angle. Okay. <gasps> yes! We got more save thingies! No! Oh, damn it. I think I'm gonna have to go back and then come back here. Because I can't pick anything up. Running out of storage space. We'll go back to the storage box. Put some things away. And then come back here. I just... I can't do it right now. Maybe once we've explored in there, then we can save afterwards. That's like... A decent amount of progress. Solved a puzzle. Found some stuff. Got the lighter. That I missed. That was literally right there. <laughs> that I could have got earlier, but I just didn't notice. Tex, welcome back! I'm doing good. I'm still surviving and not crying of fear. <laughs> okay. I have a lot of bolts right now, so I don't know if I really need my survival knife. It's handy to have, but like, we're doing alright. And I don't know if I need the lighter just yet. But key and, uh, to protect myself. That's what we're gonna go in with for now. Once we've, yeah, like I said, once we've done these, we'll come back here and save. He's gonna wake up at some point. I'm so wary now of like <laughs> bodies that are lying around. I still don't know what the the red herb does, but Oh, it still says caution. Okay. Maybe. Oh, it's not necessary to use this now. Okay. I'm glad it didn't let me take that. Like, I, I wasn't able to really waste it, so that was good. Okay. Now... We can take that. It looks like someone took something and then left in a hurry. Okay, it's all the same stuff. These footprints look like they're headed straight through the bed. It's not scary. Someone was sleeping and then they left in a hurry. Okay. There's nothing in the drawers or on the shelves. What's this? It's a box of some- <gasps> First aid box! Shit yeah. What do we got? There's nothing unusual. A first aid spray was inside! Cool. We've got quite a few of these. Do you want to peel with the red herb? Oh no, not yet. I'm sure I will eventually figure out what it's for. Emma got scared? No, no, never. Never. <laughs> you proud of me, Tex, for playing a scary game? I mean, it's not that scary. Really. Oh, 
really that scary. Okay, can I open this door? We can lock pick it. Okay. <sighs> I'm like itching to go save. So I'm hoping nothing too scary or anything kills me, really. Ugh. Oh, you can... Take that. Assorting fishing lures. The container is full of dead bugs. Researchers will. A letter is slipped inside. The top part of the letter is torn off. The rest of the letter is legible. Out of curiosity, being on Australian time, how long do you stream? So I usually stream minimum like six hours, maximum sometimes eight hours like today. <laughs> um, so right now it's like just up to 6 p.m. But I'll be streaming tomorrow, so I usually don't like to stream too late because I want to be able to like chill out for a bit, you know, have a bit of a night off and then, um, yeah. But like six to eight hours is pretty standard. Six, seven is more average, more standard, but sometimes I'll go a bit later, depending on what I'm playing, what the, you know, how I'm going with the game, how I'm feeling. I'll be proud of you when you finish the Outlast, Outlast series. We'll see if I ever get back to them. <laughs> Pink lemonade with the red herbs. <laughs> interesting combo, yeah. They added interesting fla flavor uh, to pink lemonade, yes. Okay. Alma! Guys, we need to uh, timestamp this so we can... Sh Alma, Alma Negra needs to be here. <laughs> Almanegra hasn't played this game yet either, so they probably wouldn't have known about this. Alma, I have tried to survive only to see you again, but my efforts only delayed the inevitable. I am infected, and there is no cure for what will follow, except to end my life before I lose the only thing that separates me from them. My love for you. In an hour I'll have entered my eternal sleep where there is no pe where there is peace. Please understand. Please know that I'm sorry. Martin Crackhorn. Crackhorn, what a surname. Ooh, I was gonna say, what is that? Various types of fish hooks. Okay, I almost need to like come back here to collect some stuff. The water tank smells like something once lived in there. Perhaps someone was using it to raise some kind of creature. Okay. There's a white lab coat hung up here. It smells vaguely like a medicine cabinet. But I was going to say, it looks like you can take that. That looks fake. <gasps> oh. Let's press it. Nothing happens. Maybe it has something to do with the insect specimens. Hmm. Okay, we gotta come back here. Alright guys, we're going back again. What I might do... Hmm, should we save yet? I don't know. Oh boy, okay, because looking at Twitch it says only four hours and it's early morning my time ESD in the States. Yeah. I just didn't want to fall asleep and maybe leave sharp hanging. All good. I'm probably going to wrap up soon because I have been going for eight hours. <laughs> and I'm getting a little tired. And I'll be back tomorrow. I'll be streaming this again tomorrow. Um, so it's not like I'm... I'm not going to be playing it again soon. A collection of insects? Is this Animal Crossing? <laughs> Eh, okay, he's still he's still staying down.
I just don't want this button in that room to... to hurt me. We have so much stuff. Okay. Um... I guess I can do that. So now I've got nine total. I think there was like, there was three things that I could pick up out of that room. Oh, thank you for that, Anthony. I just saw that. You're hitting it hard. I'll be back to tomorrow's stream. Nice. Night shift gang. Yeah. You like to be around and see where this goes. Yeah. Uh, it's on Discord. Okay, cool. Thank you. If I spam you up again, will you play Outlast? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Alright, so we need to go back to that room and get those things. But I don't know what's going to happen. I think. I think it's okay to do another save state. Because we, I think since the last one, we did the puzzle. And then went into those other rooms. I just don't know if I'm like saving too much or too little or what. But we will do this. There we go. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. I watched too much Dateline, <laughs> but you're back now. You missed Grenade Launcher? Oh no. Have you had to use it yet? I did. Raya, there was a section where there was a bunch of um, zombies that were getting back up and it was just like the, gr the Grenade Launcher so far has been one-shotting the zombies that I've come across. So it was very helpful when I was like in a hurry to like, to do that. Um, it was very helpful. And now we have a bunch more ammo for it too. I believe in that. No, I'm going to boogie. Got to do some cooking in the morning. It was a pleasure to meet you all. See you next time. No worries. Uh, Misfit, thanks for hanging out. Uh, I think I might wrap up here because I am getting quite tired. It is a quarter past six. I want to chill out and uh, enjoy my night off. Um, so I think we might leave it here. Uh, I, will, I will be back tomorrow with more of this game, Resident Evil 1. Uh, I'm really enjoying it, so I'm really looking forward to it. Um, let's go do a raid. I would love it if you guys could join me. Uh, thank you for all the follows today. All of the subs. All of the lurks. Everyone who's chatting. I appreciate you all. Uh, it was annoying that we had all those bot follows today, but it's fine. We can deal with it. And they all unfollow anyway. But we did reach 3,000 followers, which is very exciting. A real raid this time. Yeah, we're not going to raid one of the bots. Oh, thank you, Bagel. Thank you, Tex. I hope you'll still be alive tomorrow, Tex. <laughs> no raiding bot channels. Thanks for watching, uh, Jono. Who shall we raid? Nick is on playing Jedi Fallen Order for the first time. Um... Tiggity, Tiggity is on right now. I've never been able to raid Tiggity because he's never on. He's playing Metroid Fusion? Hang on, how long has he been streaming for? 16 hours? He's been doing a subathon. I wonder if he's going like really late or something. My Hoorab is doing a 12 hour charity stream wearing a tingle suit. I think I did see that. Um, I don't know. Hang on. I literally never get to raid Tiggity, so I'm kind of like, hmm. If he's still going, we can raid. He's playing a Metroid game too, and Metroid's really fun. Um. Yeah, let's, I've never been able to raid him because he always streams like morning... 
And he's doing a subathon, so that must be why he's on so late. <laughs> I don't know if he's finishing though. Oh, do you guys know? Like he's on a pause screen. I don't know guys. We can just do it. We'll just do it. If he's finishing, that's fine. We will go share the love. I see uh, someone else over in... Uh... <laughs> Chig's channel too. Um, I met Chig's through Lainey, that's how. I know. Let's go do it. I'd love it if you guys could join in. Let's go share the love, share our spooky emotes. It was a Game Boy Advance game. Oh, okay. The one before Metroid Bread. Ah, nice. Let's go, let's go say hi. I've never been able to raid him. And uh, let's go do it. Anyway, thanks for watching everyone. I will see you all again tomorrow, the same time as today, with some more Risen Evil 1. And uh, yeah, have a lovely rest of your night, everyone. Bye. Thanks for watching.